GTA 5 is a legendary game, but I know something you don't. How to hack into the code and change anything I want. At first, I made Franklin the richest man, and then gave him superpowers, and later on found cars that don't even exist. But over time, I got carried away. So one day, everything changed forever, and events beyond our imagination started to happen. He disappeared, went to prison underground, and, well, there's worse. But you'll have to watch to find out. Packed with mystery, adrenaline, and secrets, Franklin truly lives an extraordinary life. So grab some popcorn, sit back, relax, and enjoy the movie. <sighs> Franklin, switch off that alarm, dude. It's too early, man. Wait, what's that What's that noise I can hear? Why is the ground shaking? Is it an earthquake right now? This is really strange. Oh my days. Oh my goodness. There's a tsunami. Get out of bed. Get out of bed. Get out of bed. No, I can confirm we are definitely not dreaming. Why is everything shaking? Why is there an alarm going off outside? Did we sleep through something? Oh my days. That tsunami is still there, dude. Not gonna lie. I don't know why we've woken up in a tsunami. How did nobody tell us? Yep, there's... Yeah, oh my days. Two hours ago. Two hours ago. There was a tsunami red alert two hours ago. How do we miss this? How did... Franklin, how do we miss this? How did... I'm panicking. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm actually panicking. I don't want to get swept up by this tsunami. Army. Franklin, we're gonna get out of here. We got a car. We'll drive chop out of here. There's still time. Where's the car? Where's the car gone? Franklin, where's the car? Where do you put the... Why is the... Oh my days, I just realized. Yep, we parked the car down there last night and we walked back. Oh, Franklin, why do you do that? Why did you do that, dude? Is there anything else around here that we can use? <gasps> Guys, that tsunami is getting closer. Michael, Michael, we'll, 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 we'll call Michael. Michael can give us a lift out of here. Michael, Michael, Michael. Oh, my days. Oh, it makes it so difficult when the ground is shaking. Just phone Michael. There he is. There he is. Michael, please. Why is it busy? Oh, I haven't got time for this. I haven't got time for this, dude. Clearly, Michael's evacuated as well. Chop, I'm taking you out of here. We're getting you out of here, Chop. We're barefoot as well. Oh, my days. Chop, come with me. Come with me. There is a giant tsunami on the way, and we are literally in the line of that tsunami. We gotta go and get that car. We have to get that car. It's in Vinewood. We're going to get that car. Go, Franklin. Go, 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 go. Oh, my days. Why is it cloudy now? Why? I can't even see the tsunami anymore, but I can hear it. I can definitely hear that tsunami, dude. It is close. All right, we're gonna hop through these back gardens. Guys, if you haven't pressed the like button, please do so. I am begging you right now. We need all the support we can get. I don't want to get caught up in this tsunami. We're not letting Franklin get caught up in it, guys. Not today. Wait, the lights just went off. The lights just went off. Literally every single light around me has just gone off. Every single one of them. There's no power in Los Santos. There is no power left. Right, is my car down here? Come on, please tell me you're here. Please tell me the car is here. Please tell me it's there. Come on, there is no cars on the street. I don't see a single person. Yes, we got the car. Chop, get in. Get in, Chop. Quick, get in. Get in. Chop, get in. Get in the car. Thank you. Now, which way is it out of here, dude? Is it this way? Oh, my days. Oh, my days. That's a big tsunami. We gotta go back. We gotta go back. I'm not going around there. I'm not going. Oh, my days. The tsunami's around that corner as well. Okay, we're driving out this way. We're driving out this way, dude. We're going. We're going this way. That was huge. That was huge. How is a tsunami even that big? How? How? Yes, I can see people. There's still people here. There's still people here, dude. All right, come on. Come on. Come on, guys. We've got to get out of here. Oh, my days. So I'm not alone. There's still a few people left. All right, we're taking this corner. We're taking this corner, and I'm getting up those hills. We must be literally seconds away from being swept up by that tsunami, dude. Seconds away. I can see the tsunami in my wind mirror. I can see it in the wind mirror. How can I see the tsunami in the wind mirror? Oh, my days. Guys, it has literally just started raining right now. It is just started raining down. The roads are incredibly slippery. I'm going off-road. We're going off-road. I, I don't want to get caught up in this. We are not sticking to the roads. Off-road we go. Just don't destroy this car, Franklin. It's the only thing we have and there isn't a car around. Literally everyone has evacuated and we slept through the entire thing. Can you believe that? Can you actually believe that, dude? <laughs> we slept through an entire evacuation. I think we're going to be okay, guys. We're quite high up now. That tsunami has got to be close to me. Oh my goodness. I can't drive this. I just can't drive this car. I'm just saying I keep flipping it, dude. Stop. Why? Why are you stalling on me? Drive! Drive the car! Drive it! Oh, my days. Come on. Come on. Why won't you drive for me? Just drive. Thank you. It doesn't help that the ground is shaking like 24-7. We're on a stable road now, guys. I think I found the path going up here. All right, good. Good. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, oh my days. Okay, the ground isn't shaking as much. I think we're okay. I think everything's fine. How high up are we? We're pretty high up, guys. We're gonna be okay. That tsunami is not gonna get us. <sighs> <laughs> what a morning! What a morning! If those hills don't break the wave, there is no chance that we're gonna make it through the tsunami. Break the wave. That tsunami is like 10 times the size of Maze Bank. Break the wave. Break the wave. Please, come on! I've never been so happy here in my life. Guys, we made it through the tsunami. We were chased out of Los Santos by that. <laughs>
Oh my days. Hey, Chop, what do you think about that? Chop, Chop, Chop. Chop? Where did Chop go? Oh no. Oh no, I've got a really, I've got a really bad feeling. It was very strong winds when that tsunami hit, dude. I mean, there were waves coming up this hill. Let me tell you that right now. There were waves. It was terrifying. What if Chop has been swept down there? I mean, it's quite a steep cliff. Oh my days. Franklin, we gotta go and rescue him. There is no way. I'm not letting Chop get swept out by there. How on earth do we even get down? No, don't fall. Don't fall. Oh my days. No, Franklin, careful. Careful now. Careful. Don't fall down there yourself. Hey, right, we're taking the car down. We are literally stuck on this hill right now, guys. There is no way of getting off this hill unless we want to swim. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're rolling down. Please tell me Chop's down here. Chop, 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 Chop. Don't fall in the water. Don't fall in the water. Don't fall in the water. This is our only car. This is our only source of shelter. Okay, leave the car here. Where does he go? Can you guys see him? Those waves are huge. They're massive. No, 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 no. Please tell me Chop's okay. Where does he go? Where does he go, Chop? Guys, I think Chop's in there somewhere. I can hear him. I can hear him barking. He's up. Yeah, he's in there. He's in there. He's this way. He's so Somewhere around here. Can we see him? Guys, I need you all to keep an eye out for Chop. Can you see him? Chop, come on, show yourself. Where are you? I can still hear him. I can still hear him, dude. How can I hear him, but I can't see him? There he is. I can see him. Oh, my days. No, he just fell into the water. He fell into the water. I'm coming to get you, Chop. I'm coming to get you. Don't worry. Don't worry, Chop. I'm coming to get you. Oh, my days. It is so cold in here. It is freezing. Chop, you're there. Oh, my days. You're safe. All right, follow me. We're getting you out of here. Hold on, Chop. I'm going to get you out of here. Just hold on. Hold on. Don't let go. Oh, oh my days. This is so stressful dude. Come on. Ugh. Franklin, get up. Get up, Franklin. Get up. Get up. We've been underwater too long. We've been underwater too long. Come on. Come on, Chop. Just hold your breath. Hold your breath, dude. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Ugh. Just get out. Get out. Come on, Franklin. Yes. Oh, no. We fell back in. This is too difficult. It's just really steep around here. All right, if we follow this corner up. Yes. 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 Oh, my goodness. This is too tense. This is too much. Okay, we got Chop. We got him out of the tsunami. Now we've got to figure out a way to get back to civilization, wherever that is. I mean, if they have evacuated. Where do you think they went to? Could they have gotten a boat and sailed somewhere? There's a telephone tower there. So what I'm thinking is there might be civilization on that island over there. So if we can float this car over to that island, then we'll be all right, you know? I think we'll be okay. Ooh, no. Okay, these waves are too big. I'm just gonna have to go with the flow. Chop, we're just gonna have to go with the flow here. We're just gonna have to go with the flow. And see where the current takes us. This is the only way around. Uh, there's no boats around here. I ain't swimming. Do you guys fancy swimming through there? No, that's what I thought. This is literally the only way. And let me tell you right right now. It is terrifying. It is genuinely- Chop is in the back. <laughs> Guys, I'm a little bit scared right now. What if this takes me out of the map? Like, literally, what if this just carry- No, no, okay. We gotta try and use this engine. Use those wheels. Back up. Back up, Franklin. Back up. Back up. Back up. These waves are too big. They're just too big. They're way too big, dude. Come on. Come on. Try and get some traction. Just back up a little bit. We're gonna go to Mount Chiliad. <laughs> this is working. This is actually working. Oh, man. This wave is so strong. Seriously. Hang on. A boat. A boat just came over the wave. Okay, so we've got a decision to make, guys. Do we get out of the car and swim to the boat? Because that's gonna get us to where we want to. Or do we stay in the car and keep our fingers crossed that this wave does not chuck us out of this map? Oh! <laughs> back down the back of this wave. It's now or never, dude. It's now or never. I'm ditching. We're getting out. We're swimming. We're swimming. This might be a terrible idea. Who knows? But we gotta get that boat. Swim, Franklin. Swim, 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 swim. I think the boat was over here. Please tell me it was. Where was the boat? Come on. Oh, my days. These waves are too... They're too big. They're just too big. I can't control myself in these waves. They're just too strong. Where was it? I, I, I genuinely can't see it. Hang on a minute. It's over there. It's over there. Oh, yes. We were ahead of it. Oh, okay. Quick, 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 quick. Get on. Get out. Oh, my days. It went straight over me. Okay, we're swimming underwater. This is probably the only way, Chop. Just hold your breath. Hold your breath. The waves are too big. We're literally swimming against this wave right now. Come on, Franklin. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, my days. These waves are too big. Give me the boat. Just give me the boat. It's not that difficult. Come on. Come on. Jump on. Jump on board, Franklin. Just, just climb. Climb. Yes, 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 yes! <laughs> oh, finally, Chop, we're on board! Everything's gonna be okay. Oh, my days. That took me literally forever, guys. I don't know if you saw all of that, but forever, forever. These waves, they're just too strong. Oh, for a second, I thought I was a goner. Okay, we're moving. We're getting out of here, dude. I'm going to Mount Chiliad. It's the best place I can think of right now, and the closest as well. And these waves, they're, they're too strong. I don't want to keep jumping over them in case I break down this boat, guys. So we're gonna try and find the easiest route between them, if that's even possible. I don't think it is. I don't think it is, guys. Here we go. Okay, ride along this one. 
We'll ride along this one. All right, nice. Nice. You're doing great, Franklin. You're doing great. Ride along this. You're doing amazing. You're doing amazing. Over this wave. One more wave to go, and we've made it back onto land. I cannot wait to put my feet on land, guys. <laughs> it's been that long. Come on. Come on. No. Use the engine. Oh, my days. These waves are too big. Just get me onto land. Here we go. Land it. Land it. Land it. All right, nice. Nice. And don't get out yet. Don't get out yet, Franklin. Don't get out yet. We're going to do one more shot. One more shot at this over the wave. Uh, yes. Yes. Okay, get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. And run. Run. Run up Mount Chiliad. Run up Mount Chiliad. The boat's going to be okay. Don't worry about that. Ooh, how we made it through that, guys. I have no idea. But that was the craziest tsunami I have ever seen in GTA 5 a million times over. I haven't seen anything scarier, anything crazier. We're actually lucky to make it out of that alive. Not going to lie. Next time, Franklin. Maybe next time. Don't sleep through an evacuation. Okay? It's there for a reason. Boy, am I glad to see you guys. Come on, shop. Come in. <sighs> My days. We finally found shelter. Guys, we did it. We made it through the tsunami. There's a lot of money in the world, and Franklin has nearly all of it. He's been a billionaire to a zillionaire and upgrades his house every single time. He's lived in places only dreams are made of. But today, we're about to pull off what's never been done before. You see, I've been scavenging high and low for cash. I don't care where it comes from, because when you have this much money in your bank account, there's not much else left. But I found one place. One place which actually has money. The blank County Savings Bank. This is the only other place where money exists, other than Franklin's bank account. But if I pull off this heist, we'll officially have made a good gillion dollars. I've done the calculations, and I think there's enough in there, and nobody has ever been a good gillionaire before. And with that much money in my bank account, I can do literally whatever I want, including upgrade my house one last time. We've done some awesome upgrades. Last time was a centillionaire, and then it was a decillionaire, and before that it was, let me think. Oh, I remember, a non all of those houses were great. <laughs> they were cute, actually, when you compare it to the one we're going to build today. The definition of a gugillion dollars is an amount which can't even be calculated. There's no exact amount of zeros behind it. It's a gobbledygook, made-up number, something you say when there's a lot of stuff out there. But it's time to finally reach that amount. And I don't even know if this is going to break my game. We're going to hit the limit on the amount of cash you can make in this universe. And this place is going to help me get there. Let's do this, Frank. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, gentlemen. I would like to steal all of your cash. That's right. Get on the ground. I'm not kidding. I need to shoot out these cameras just in case somebody comes to arrest me. Hey, get on the ground, tellers. They don't want any trouble. I just want the key card to take the money. All right, I got the key card. Oh, yeah. Okay, we got a four-star one to level. Not surprised there. I would have given myself a one to level two. I right, whack it in. Okay, this guy's called Mark. The other guy's called Richard. Richard, Mark, I'm sorry I had to do this. <laughs> You're gonna have to break the news that you are the guys who let me take the rest of the money. How is everyone gonna eat? All right, let's jump in. There's some cash out here. This is great. All right, load it up, Frank. Get every single dollar in your bag. 5 million, 11 million, 16. If I make it over 100 million dollars, we've capped out the limit and made it to a gugillion dollars. 61, 66, 72, 77. <laughs> Done it, dude. 94, and there it is. 100 million. I may as well steal everything else, you know, get some extra cash on the side. Whoa, what's happened back here? Okay, quite a mess has happened in this room. <laughs> well, it's all right. I'll just keep taking this cash. 155, 160, 166, dude. Okay, we're gonna make like a quarter of a billion dollars just from this heist. Can you imagine the house we're gonna build? For a gugillion dollars, it's gonna be better than any house we've ever seen. Anyway, thank you very much, guys. You've done fantastic. You have officially given me the rest of the money in the universe. All right, Frank, you know the drill. We've got a few officers outside and I'm not afraid to get crazy with them. <laughs> All right, quick, get a new car. Get a new car, Frank. We're driving out of here. Whatever you do, don't get arrested. Da -da 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 -da. All right, see you later, officers. Thank you very much. If I can make it away from the police, I will have a gugillion dollars. But don't worry, I've got a plan. These guys are not gonna stop me. Whoa. Oh, oh my days. Okay, they shot out a tire. They shot out a tire. Okay, maybe my plan was not this. But we can still do this. My car is getting completely destroyed. If I can just get to the beach and then keep my eyes peeled. I know there's an escape route around here somewhere. There's like a pipe I can go down. It leads me straight to the sewers. Where is it? Where is it? I know it exists. Come on. Oh, no, guys. I think I'm on the wrong side of the beach. <laughs> oh, this is really awkward. Well, looks like I'm gonna have to turn around and go that way instead. No way. These guys really didn't want me to steal the money. <laughs> they got airstrikes coming down on me. Alright, better watch out for them. I just need to get to the sewers. That's literally all I gotta do. If I get inside that pipe, the police will lose me. I know they will. What happened to the planes. 
Oh, no, they're still chasing me. All right, we better get moving. We better get moving. Yes, you guys, that's it. That's the pipe. Quick, get in, get in, get in. Frank, get in. We'll head down and lose the police through here. They won't dare come down this pipe unless they got a death wish, which I'm sure some of them do. <laughs> they sent an airstrike after me. That is not normal for a four-star wonder level. They clearly need this money. Come on, officers. Come on. I dare you. Someone just pop your face into the pipe. I'll be waiting. I'm really expecting just someone to pop their head around now. I, why, why am I thinking that? It's never gonna happen. <laughs> hello? Is anyone down there? Come on! Say hello to Frank. Is it not worth risking your life for? I've lost the police. I've got the money. And most of all, my game is still working. I've done it. Franklin, we are the very first Googillionaire in GTA 5. Now, we could enjoy the craziest lifestyle. Believe me, we could. But this video is exclusively for the house upgrade. I want to see what those talented builders can build for me today. What does it say over here? It just says a Googillion. That's all it says. That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I never thought it would say, like, actual Googillion. I phoned up the builders, let them know what's happening, and any second now, they'll be here. So in the meantime, I'm just gonna enjoy a nice little drink to myself. I'm a Googillionaire. I'm the richest man in the world. There is not a single dollar out there which isn't in my bank account right now. Oh, yeah, I, I can taste the wealth right now, Frank. This is beautiful. <laughs> we have never been this wealthy before in GTA. <gasps> there they are. Okay, they're already at the door. Amazing, they were so quick on it. This is the wealthiest construction company ever to exist, by the way. And they're gonna make even more to do. Whoa, jeez. Okay, I've never seen this many of you guys here. Oh my days, you're on my house? What are you doing up there? Hey, Steve, you having a good day? Yeah, I've never been better. You want another house? Yeah, I would love another house, Steve. Uh, you got any cool ideas? Yeah, I got plenty. How about you? Yeah, I, I got a couple of ideas as well. I, I, basically, I want to make sure this house is the best one you've ever done. I want to have like a million cars on there. I want to have two golden helicopters. I want to have flying cars. No, I want to have flying Lamborghini cars. I want to have it all. Yeah, we can do that. You got the money. Yes, sir. I've got the money. Here you go. You kill your dog. Whoa, I can't see anything. It's just zeros. Don't bother counting it. It's all there, I promise. Yeah, thanks. We'll give you a call later. All right, sounds good to me. I'm so glad these guys aren't asking you to subscribe. They did that before. And it was so evil of them. You know, I paid them all my money and then they blackmail me with subscribers. You know, I'm glad you guys are actually getting on with the job. So I'm gonna get out of here, enjoy the rest of my day, and, uh, you know, try and see what else we can do around Los Santos with zero dot. Wait a second, I gave them all of my money? No, I had like a hundred mil left. You guys saw what I made in the heist? I only needed a hundred million dollars to make a Google and Hey, I think I overpaid you. Uh, do you want me to count it out? It'll take, uh, take a long time. Oh, wow, this guy. All right, you know what? Take the money. It's all right. I'll figure this out. <laughs> it's not like there's any other money left in the universe, dude. All right, Frank, we better get out of here anyway. We gotta entertain ourselves for the rest of the day. Hang on a second. You guys hear that? That sounds like police sirens. Okay, I'm just gonna get away from my house. I don't want them to come towards me. Just, just in case they see the builders and stop the actual build. Do -do -do. Nothing to see here. Wait, is that a tank? Oh, no, this is the military. Freeze. Hey, uh, you want me to freeze? Is that a rocket launcher in your hand? Uh, <laughs> you're not going to shoot this close. Quick, Franklin, drive, freeze. drive, drive. Stop telling me to freeze. I'm not going to freeze. No, they shot a rocket launcher. No, <gasps> Franklin, Frank. Oh, no, guys. They shot a rocket at my bike. Are you kidding me? My head. No, I'm in prison. Oh, no, no, no. This is really bad. Guys, you gotta let me out of here. Come on. You don't understand. Is he awake? I believe so, sir. Oh, yeah. You better believe I'm awake. I'm getting ready to shove this fist in your face. Come on out. I'm waiting. Wait, you want me to, to come outside? Okay. Let me look at this place. Ooh, there's a lot of soldiers around. Oh, hey, man. <laughs> what a coincidence, eh? Get on your knees. Okay, this is a little bit scary. You don't understand what you're doing, okay? You're making a big mistake. I said, get on your knees. What if I don't want to, huh? Oh, what if I don't? Ah, ow, come on, man. I'll make you get to your knees. He just smacked me on the ground. Looks like I haven't got much of a choice. These guys aren't playing around. What do you want from me, mister? I haven't got anything to give you. We're hungry, Frank. We want our money. Oh, you want your, your money? Let me just check my accounts. Ah, oh, zero bucks. Yeah, it's gone. Disappeared. I haven't got anything to give you. I'm just as poor as you guys. He spent everything on the house. That's a shame. You're gonna make a mess of my floor. Oh no, he's actually gonna take me out. Hey mister, please, you don't wanna do this. Smack subscribe to survive? Wait a second. You guys can save me. If you smack subscribe as hard as you can uh, and as quick as you can, then we can save Franklin together. And he better be saved because I, I wanna see his house. Please mister, you, you gotta give me some time. Can I tell you a joke? I need you to smack subscribe now as hard as you can, guys. Like, give it a punch, give it a whack. Do everything you can to it. Oh my days, please don't do this. Please don't do this. Say goodbye. Okay, now he's really not kidding. I genuinely think he's going to ah, ah, Come on! He actually shot me! Did we not get enough subscribers? Frank, switch to Michael. Wait, 
Is this it? I don't think we get to see his house again. It's been a pleasure, Frank. Can't believe it ends this way. What's Michael doing? Looks like he's just doing some shopping. Like, he has no idea what's just happened. Franklin is arrested. He spent a gugillion dollars. He might even be dead. Wait, we can rescue him? All right, Michael, looks like we got a job to do. We only have five minutes to rescue him as well. He's still alive. He's still alive. I think we got just enough subscribers, but we got to rescue him quickly. If that five minutes runs out, we might actually lose Franklin and lose that house altogether. Reports of a gugillionaire shot in the police station. Money will be distributed to the public soon talking about it on the radio as well. Wow, this is big news. Okay, we better be careful going into this station. Oh my days, they're already driving supercars away from there. It's like they're celebrating again. Now they know their money's coming back. <laughs> I mean, that's actually kind of good. Okay, there is not much time to think about this, Michael. We're just gonna do this right now. Hey, officer, <laughs> I need my buddy Frank back. Thank you. It's about time we give them a taste of their own medicine. Hey, boys, I'm here to get my friend. And if anyone tries to stop me, believe me, you will go down. Oh yes, the jail cells are right here. All right, what's the most powerful gun we have which doesn't hurt Franklin? We got a bit of time. You know what? This shotgun's probably it. Let's do this. Hey, officers. <laughs> I would like my friend back, please. Oh, jeez. Okay, they all got guns. Every single one of them's got guns. <laughs> please don't kill Michael as well. Oh, my days. He's on the ground shooting me, dude. Okay, get him, get him, get him, get him. Quick, quick, Michael. This is fantastic. I've got a bit of cover. And now I've got a good process going on. I see you behind the wall, mister. Oh, jeez. No, no, no. <laughs> How's it looking down there? Oh, yep. Yeah, this is easy peasy. <laughs> you guys got to reload. Oh, that's kind of cute. Guess what? I don't really have to. I got three bullets left. Hey, Frank. Good to see you, my guy. So glad you're alive. Kinda. Still barely surviving. Gee, someone's- They're in the prison cell! Just gotta deal with this last guy and we're bam. There's everyone down. So glad I wore bulletproof armor. Basically the same stuff these guys wore. Wait, is he locked himself in the cell? Two- Three of them in the cell? <laughs> guys, it's bulletproof glass. Don't know what to say. Oh my days, there's the police officer right? I'm getting you, mister. How dare you? You're the guy who took out Frank. Right, what have I got? I got some tear gas, got a jerry can. Oh, a grenade. That ought to be quite fun. Heads! Shoulders, knees, and toes. <laughs> Alright, this isn't good. The police are actually coming in. Frank, you're coming with me. I'm getting you out of here. Come on. Let's get you in my car. Now, let's get you out of here before the police arrive. I can hear backup on their way. So many sirens coming towards us. Please tell me there's a car out here. There's gotta be. Yes, there's a police car. If we get him in the back of that, then we're gonna be just fine. Come on. Come on. Just a little bit more, Michael. A little bit more. All right, Frank. Let's get you down to the ground and get in this car. I should have known this. I put Frank on the back seat. His head's below the windows. He'll be fine. We just gotta focus on Michael now. Five stars. Helicopters in the sky. Oh, yes. A spooky train yard where there's barely anywhere to drive. This is fantastic. What a what a spot to be, Mike. Oh, this is not good for a car. Especially a police car. The suspension's terrible. Can I get around this way? Yes, we can. Oh, beautiful. I'll hide in this garage. They'll never find us in here. It is my responsibility to get Franklin to a safe place. And once we do that, he can heal up and get ready for this amazing house, which is going to happen later on today. How's it looking outside? Anything? Oh, yeah. Okay, we've got a couple of people searching for us, but I think we're going to be just fine. What did I say? Just fine we are. Well, I'm glad that's over. I'm taking Frank back to my house. At least until all of this blows over and he, he gets a bit better. Frank, rest up. You took quite the hit there in the police station. I'll deal with the rest of it and I'll let you know when the house is ready. Hey, hang on a second. Do you guys hear that? I think that's his phone. Well, it'll be rude not to check. It's the builders. I think the house is finally done. Hey, Frank. Frank. Oh, he's not waking up. I better take the call. Hello? Hey, who's this? It's uh, Mike. Uh, Frank's friend. Is the house done? Have you got $10 million, Mike? Uh, no, I don't have 10 million dollars. We can't build the house without it. We need 10 mil. Oh, really? I'll figure it out. Can we do a trade? There's not much money left in this world. Yeah, we can trade. All right, then. I'll, I'll see you later. A gugillion dollars. I thought that would be enough, but now they want 10 million. This is a ripoff. They shouldn't be asking for this, but hey, I need to make 10 million dollars, and I've got just the right idea. Uh, it's not exactly money to be made in Los Santos, but there's one person I know in this city which has expensive taste. They will definitely have something worth 10 million dollars. Let's go and pay them a visit on behalf of Franklin. Simeon Yatsarian, the only person I know who has supercars worth $10 million. And by the looks of it, this is a pretty good day for him. Now all I gotta do is wander in, grab a car, drive out of there, and <laughs> it'll be smooth sailing home. Hey, Simeon, how you doing? Love these cars. Welcome to Simeon's store. Would you like a car? Yes, I would like a car. Can you tell me how much each car is worth? They cost anywhere between 10 million million to 50 million what would you like for okay so any of these cars will cover the cost i would like 
Which one do you reckon? I mean, this yellow one looks amazing. I would like this car, please, Simeon. And guess what? I'm not going to pay. <laughs> Wait, the engine's not working. Oh, well, this is a bit awkward. I really thought I could just drive away. Oh, now Simeon's walking over to me. You idiot. You really think I would let you take a car? Talk to me. Why do you need supercar? I need a supercar to, to trade with a guy. He needs $10 million. I understand. You do one job for me, and I give you car. Well, I suppose that won't hurt. All right, Simeon, you got the deal. But whatever happens, I don't want to die on this job. I can't make a promise. But you should be okay. Looks like we're doing some work for Simeon then. But once I do this job, he's gonna give me this car. Which will be plenty of money to get that house sorted. Give me the info and I won't let you down. Look out for the police officer. He knows me. Tell him I sent you. Okay, so through that door is a police officer, which I gotta go and speak to. I'm a little bit nervous right now because you know what the police did to Franklin? They kicked him out for the whole video. And this is meant to be his house upgrade. All right, this better not be a stitch up. Hey, officer, I'm putting a lot of trust in you. Simeon sent me. Ah, oh, you were sent by Simeon, eh? The cars are on the plane. It takes off in 10 minutes. Wait, Simeon wants me to collect the cars on the plane. Okay, we got 10 minutes until it takes off. We can make that. Where's this plane they're talking about? I don't see anything on the runaway. Whoa! All right, I do see that. Okay, it's already moving. That means they're going to be taking off very soon. Once they get around to the other side of the runway, they'll be flying in the sky. And I still need to get these cars. Wait, are those the guys who loaded them? Okay, let's just make sure they don't bother us either. Yep, these are definitely the guys who loaded these cars. And they're willing to shoot me, which means they got a lot to protect. All right, those guys are dealt with. And let's find a way on this plane before it takes off. Quick, 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 quick. If we can just get through the back, then we're gonna be just fine. How do I open the back of this? Oh, come on, please, open. We need to get this down. Oh, come on. Okay, that's not opening up for me. It's locked. I gotta find another way in. Oh no, it's speeding up, it's speeding up. We're gonna have to try and climb onto something. What about this wing? Oh, it's no use, it's too high. I'm gonna need to take that vehicle. If I can climb on the roof and then climb on the wing, we might just be able to make it. Yes, I've got the car. Now let's drive it to the wing. I've never tried to get on a plane like this, but I feel like this is super dangerous. All right, nice jump out, and let's get on this wing quickly. Come on, jump up, and quick, don't lose it. Ah, nice. Oh, hold on, hold on. I've made onto the wing, which is fantastic. Now I can find another way in from the roof. Ah, oh, that hurts. Whoa, wait a minute, though. These are the cars. <laughs> We're in the plane, and uh-oh. Okay, that doesn't sound too good, and these guys haven't even noticed me. Quick, let's get them before they turn around. <laughs> okay, nice. But, oh, oh, my days. Okay, they really have taken off. How on earth am I supposed to get all of these cars out the plane? Let me just take a look outside. Gotta kick this down first. Come on, get this, get this to come down. If I can just weigh this down with my body. Oh, oh, oh my days. Okay, we are in the sky. How do we get this high already? All right, uh, we can do this. This is crazy, Simeon. I can't believe you wanted me to do this. Wait a minute, how am I gonna do that? There's one, two, three for five different cars, and I have to somehow get them off the plane. I think I've got an idea. If I attach every single car together, I can drive the front one out and take all of them with me. That is a genius idea, but the front one better be powerful. All right, nice. Okay, they're all on. Let's get this out of here. This is a super risky plan. Let me see. Is there anything I can use? Turbo. There it is. All right, let's do this. Arr, come on. We're still not in the red. Okay, we can go even faster than this. Where's the other switch? Supercharged turbo. Come on. Um, yes! Okay, we're pushing to the edge. We can do this. This is insane. I am dragging five supercars off a cargo plane. We better do this quickly before we go over water. And last time I checked, we were in Los Santos. But once it gets off the island, we're screwed. The things I do for Simeon. Just a few more meters to go, Mikey. You got this. You can do this. We're getting there. I think I burst a tire. Here goes nothing. Simeon, this is for you. <laughs> oh, my days. I have never done this in GTA 5. If only Franklin knew what we were getting up to today. All right, Mikey, we got to land this and not destroy the cars. Oh, my days. Wait a second. I think they're okay. We almost squished a few people, but they look drivable. <laughs> that was insane, dude. That deserves a like. I don't even think they've done this in Fast and Furious. That's how crazy it was. As promised, Simeon, every single car from that plane. You just got to forgive me on the damage. We did have to drive out of the plane like a mile up in the sky. But hey, I got the rights for you. A deal's a deal. Good enough. Take the car. Whichever one you want. 
I will, Simeon. I will. Now we got the pass from Simeon. I can finally take the car and trade it for the house upgrade. <laughs> All right, Mikey, jump in and let's deliver this to those builders. I can't believe Simeon let me have this car for five of the vehicles I took from the cargo plane. I mean, this is a seriously rare ride. There's only one or two of these which ever exist, and they're both in Simeon's store. The interior is fitted out with the best details possible. The steering wheel is on the right way around from the UK. <laughs> and everything else about this ride is just beautiful. Hello, hello, buddy. I got the ride. He looks happy to see me. Will this do for the $10 million you asked for? I mean, I was told it's worth at least 10. This is amazing. This will do perfectly. Yay. All right. We, we got the job done. So you don't need any more money? No, we're done. Do you want the key? Do I want the key? But this is Franklin's house. He robbed a bank and did a lot of hard work to make that money. But we could just nab it last minute and <laughs> take the house from him. I mean, after all, I'm the reason this plan even went ahead. I mean, if I didn't get that car, this house wouldn't have even been built. I mean, I think Michael deserves a little bit of credit for that. Hey, I'm getting bored. Do you want the key or not? Yeah, I'll take the key. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'll take the house. This is great. Deliver it to Frank. After all, he is the real owner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll deliver it to Frank. Don't you worry about that. I got the key. He just gave me the key to the Gugillionaire house. And now I've got the key. I can do whatever I want and never... Oh, oh, hey, Frank. Hey, this is a bit awkward, isn't it? Let me just... There we go. One for one. So, <laughs> what's up? Oh, you want the key? Listen, that, that guy's got the key, buddy. No, I gave the key to you. Hey, hey, come on. Come on. No need to rat on me. Now he's gone. It's just me and you. Listen, Frank, you were out for the whole day. I looked after you. I saved your life. All right, if it wasn't for me, you would be dead in a police station and I would still have this house anyway. So I deserve some credit. Okay, you know what? I've got an idea. Clearly this isn't going to go anywhere. One game of golf, me and Frank, winner gets the house. How does that sound? This could be the biggest plot twist in GTA history. Yeah, Franklin doesn't seem too happy about that. He looks genuinely terrified in those eyes. If I beat Franklin at this game of golf, I get to take his house for good. Hey, so Frank, you ready to lose out on a gugillion dollars? I mean, that name even sounds Sounds funny, just like your face, Frank. <laughs> I'm throwing them out there left, right, and center. Bam! <laughs> All right, let's get started. I'm not gonna waste any time. I'm gonna check out where the wind's going. Is it going east? Right, it's going south and west. Whoa, there's quite the gale. <laughs> Better be careful for that. So let's see. If I want to beat the gale, we're gonna have to whack it about no, no, practice swing. All the pros do practice swings. And again. Could have done a bit better, Mike, but that's still all right. You know, that's not a bad shot whatsoever. That's basically the kind of shot Franklin would do. It's a new record, so let's go easy on him for now. I'm here to steal. That's all I'm going to do. Ooh, that's a little bit too far to the left there, Frank. You're on the path, basically. I mean, a few inches to the left, and that wouldn't have even been allowed. All right, where's his ball? I think I think his game is just ball power. It's right there. I reckon I could waste a shot, and I would still beat him. But I'm going to play this fair and square. Let's send it over there. Nice. Okay, that's a bit too powerful, but we're okay. Everything's fine. Michael's doing well. He's gonna hit the tree, let's be honest. Oh, jeez. This is why Franklin needs me to play for him all the time. Oh, you know what? Given everything that happened, that's actually not too bad. <laughs> Get on the green now, Frank. That's, that's too powerful. Way too... Okay, almost... Almost in the sand. You know what? I reckon we could win this. I can see that. Let's go into the hole. <laughs> Imagine if we get a hole in one. Whoop! bam Nice one, Uh-oh. Wait, is this gonna go in the sand? Oh, no! It's in the sand! I've never got it in the sand before. Okay, Frank's on shot number five. That's on the green. Okay, he might get it in on seven shots. That's what I'm thinking. If we're being realistic right now, how many do we have? Okay, this is shot number four. Let's get it out the sand. Focus on that for now. Go out the sand. Play it safe. Play it safe. On the green, just ahead of Frank's. That's a putting distance. We can get it in. No way is Franklin going to get that in the hole. Oh, my days. Okay, seven shots. Like I said, he got a bogey. It's respectable, but it's pretty terrible, to be honest. If we get this in now, then we get this house. All right, I'm thinking holes there. The wind's going back. Get in the other. Oh, hold up. Please tell me this. That's going. Oh, yes, he's in. We got it on par. Check it out. Franklin, give me that house. You lost by one shot. A deal's a deal, Frank. Pay up now. Oh, wait, wait, wait. He's going to shoot me. Hey, hey, come on, Frank. You got me. He just went back on his wood. Are you kidding? Hey, I'm dead, Frank. I'm dead. You got me, all right? You happy? I can't believe Franklin just stole the keys back from Michael. Even after the game of golf, he wasn't happy with that. Anyway, let's go and check it out, wherever this house is. 
Yes. Hey, that must be my lift. Uh, hello, mister. Are you looking for the uh, person who owns the Gugillionaire house? Because that would be me. Congratulations on winning the golf game. Oh, yeah. Uh, thanks, I suppose. He's lying. Shut up, Michael. No one cares about you. All right, get me in the car. Drive me to this house. I want to see it. Actually, the car drives itself. Have fun. The car drives itself? Amazing. Well, I don't have to do anything then. All we got to do is sit back, relax. I will see you guys when we get to the Gugillionaire house upgrade. Are you excited? I am excited. This is the most amount of money I've ever spent on a house in GTA 5. It's gonna be insane. This is the Gugillion house upgrade. Wait, before I go inside, I want to get like a view from up on this hill. I gotta get a view. I'm taking over on this car. This house looks crazy. Wow. So to really appreciate this place, you've got to get high up. It is the biggest house I have ever seen. It's got three different car parks underneath. It's got a runway. Okay, I need to explore this place. I am freaking out right now. Franklin, get in that house now and check it out. So this looks like the only way into the house. It's a drive which takes you up to a gate. It's number 1,000. Vinewood drive. This is the thousandth house. That's a number that's easy to remember. Welcome to my basketball court. Uh, yeah, I think this is a great place to play basketball. Ooh, wonder where that goes to. Wait, I see a marker. Garage deck. That must take you down to the um, garages below the house. Yeah, let's go and check that out. Cool. So this is the deck. So this is the first one. When I was above there, I saw three. Can I still see them down here? Yep, one. And then I think the other one is right at the bottom. <laughs> wow. And I can drive between each garage area. That is crazy. Check it out. I can go down here. I can go down to the other one. There's so many cars and they're all super cars and they go on for literally ever. There's got to be at least a hundred on this deck. Anyway, go back inside. I want to see the rest of this house. So I can drive up this way and I don't actually know where this takes me to, but apparently you can drive cars there, which takes me to the back of my house. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Franklin, it's a good job you did stick up for this house because they completely themed it around you. That would have been seriously awkward if we gave it to Mike. <laughs> Wait, I need to see some of those photos. Check it out, guys. This is hilarious. So this is my office slash reception room. It's me, Franklin Lamar. Franklin Clinton and partner. That must be the house we sort of built it from. That's a very nice house. It's basically a fortress. Wow. And look, there's a Bedford shop. Oh, doesn't get any more adorable than this. This is one of the kitchens. And can I just say, there is like a shallow splash pool, which goes around the entire like garden. I need to get outside and see that. But first, here's my other kitchen slash bar. We've got a bit of wine here, a little bit of drinks. And there's my piano, Don't Touch. It belonged to a very famous person who now isn't around anymore, but that was once their piano, I promise. There's my lounge, is my other lounge. More photos of Frank at my old house, good old 3671 Drive. I, I forgot the name, but hey, that was where I lived before. Here's my trophy display. This is where we get all our trophies for being just an absolute boss. And down here is the toilet. Toilet made just for bosses. There's even a, a shower in there as well in case anyone needs to shower. Before I go upstairs, I want to check out downstairs. If there's anything cool about this house, it's got to be down here. I don't want to see the bedrooms or anything. I want to see what cool things they've given me. So they're giving me some artwork. Nice, some golden records. Oh, why are there people in here? Oh, I got a cinema. Awesome. This is the garage where we came through. Okay, that's, yeah, that's good. Through here is another lounge. Franklin Clinton and Partners. Nice. There's all my guitars. There's my cars. There's my recording studio. What? I can make music in here now. And what's through here? This looks like a vault. Wait, escape. Hang on a second. If I move the money out the way, there's a trap door which I can go down. I gotta check out this trap door. Oh, there's an underground tunnel. I have never had a house which has an escape route. I mean, everything's been connected in the past, but this is next level. And just in case the police arrive or someone tries to get my money or something, I can go down through here in style and escape my own home. Oh, uh, watch out for that, Franklin. <laughs> just tripped over on a rock. This is what a Googillionaire always needs. I mean, when you have this much money, so many people are going to come after you. And this is where we end up. Where even is this, actually? Through a little forest, which is at the side of the house. Okay, that's pretty cool. Get to climb back up over my helipad with my golden helicopter on. Sorry, guys, I got to stop bragging. <laughs> There's too many good things around it. Oh, I got a gym. Nice. So I haven't even been outside, but on the ground level, you know, just above the cars is the splash pool, which we saw 
door go around the entire house. But if we go up another level, there is an actual swimming pool that we can use. And there's deck chairs outside, a nice place to rest, get a nice tan, etc. Open lounge, which we've already been through. And up there is the bedrooms. So let's not waste any more time. I want to check out the actual bedroom. So check this out. This is another lounge. How many lounges does a house need? I mean, I don't have this many friends. Chop, another bed for him in case he wants to sleep in my room, I suppose. Or is this Chop's room? I, I don't actually know. It's a huge bed, though, so I wouldn't complain. This is the bathroom for that room. Yep, pretty big. It's basically three bathrooms. Wait, 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 wait a second. Wait a second. I need to inspect this again because did I just see two toilets? One there and one there. I have never seen a bathroom with two toilets. Now you and your partner can go to the toilet together. <laughs> this is so strange. What's through here? Ooh, lots of Oreo posters. All right, I would love an Oreo right now. That would literally make the house complete. But instead, this is just another bedroom, walk-in wardrobe, another bathroom. And around this way is just a balcony, which looks over my amazing office. Well, this is officially the best house ever, but we haven't seen everything. You might remember, there's a runway on top of this house. I can't forget that. There's some colorful planes. They look beautiful. And there's also this little house thing over here. Looks pretty interesting, kind of like an open air house. And inside are some pretty rare cars. How do I get them from down here? Like, why are they on the runway? That's an interesting one. All right, I'm gonna have to jump in and figure this out myself. It's a Lamborghini, it's got a spoiler, it drives, the wheels work. Oh wait, it does do something. The wheels just went up. Does that mean it can, it can fly? That would explain why it's on the runway. I got a flying supercar. <laughs> And they gave me three of them. Oh, Simeon's gonna be so annoyed when he finds out I've got one of these. And no matter how hard he tries, he's never gonna get them because this house is a fortress and no one is gonna enter without me knowing. So if you enjoyed the video, smash like and help us get to 7 million subscribers. And if you want me to come back and do an even better house upgrade, I'm gonna need you guys to smash like as hard as you can because I don't know how we're gonna make the money, but I will figure it out if you guys want me to that much. Don't you look at me like that. I'm Chop. <laughs> I'm playing as Chop today, and we're in the park scaring all of the dogs, making sure they know who's boss, because, you know, guys, Chop's boss. And we are with Franklin. Oh, no, I'm chasing my tail. I'm chasing my tail. I'm chasing my tail. <laughs> Come on, Chop, get the tail, get the tail. <laughs> anyway, I'm playing fetch, not chasing my tail with Franklin. At least I was playing fetch because Franklin has now found a lady to talk to. Who is this woman? I thought I was your, like, best friend and the only person in your life. Franklin, do you want me to bite her? Thank you, he's gonna throw the ball. Okay, whenever you're ready, Franklin, whenever you're ready. <laughs> All right, where's it gonna go? Where's it gonna go? Where's it gonna go? Oh, I see it. I see it. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Quick, get the ball. Get the ball. Oh, it landed already. Don't worry. I can still get it. Hey, Franklin, you threw this one far. Do you want to get rid of me or something? Went all the way down here. Where did the ball even go? I can't even see it from here. Guys, do you have any idea where it went? Can you see it? Uh, hold on a second. What is this? Is this what I think it is? It is. <laughs> yeah. All right, pick up the ball and let's go back to Franklin. Yes, he threw it again. And this time he threw it even further. Hold on a second. That's gonna get stuck in the tree, Franklin. Did it get stuck in the tree? I'm gonna have to check this out. It went down here somewhere. Oh, uh, I think it got stuck in the tree. Franklin, <laughs> I think the ball's stuck in the tree, dude. Oh, man. How am I supposed to get that, Franklin? It's stuck in the middle of the tree. I'm not superhuman. There's nowhere I can climb either. That's so annoying. Well, there goes my ball and all of my fun today. Looks like I'm gonna have to make friends instead. What are you looking at? Are you looking for a ball as well? Have you found a ball? Oh, you want to come back here? Come on, come on. Oh, my days, dude. Is Chop trying to make friends? <sighs> Franklin, Franklin? Uh, Franklin, where have you gone? Why is that woman running? Hold on a second, this doesn't seem right. What are you looking at, huh? Yeah, running back and forth like you're the happiest dog in the world. Where's Franklin gone? Hold on a second, no. That's the woman Franklin was talking to. She's on the ground. I think she's trying to say something. What are you trying to say, lady? Hey, uh, they took your... Oh, no. Sorry, what is that? I don't understand English. Can you speak to me in dog language, please? Oh, man, language barriers. I have no idea what she's saying. I have a feeling something's happened to Franklin. Look at this. His car's even here. He hasn't taken the car away. Hey, Franklin. Franklin, have you seen Franklin? Excuse me. Excuse me, Franklin. Franklin? Excuse me, rabbit. Have you seen Franklin? No. Come on, where's Franklin? Where is he gone? Where is he gone? No, no, no. I'm getting flashbacks already to 2020 when Franklin first went missing for the first time. Shop, don't worry. It's gonna be okay. We'll find Franklin. 
Now let's look around for clues. She's clearly on the ground, so something must have happened to him. But they must have taken him away because he isn't here right now. 101 logic with Nort. Don't worry, Chop. Me and you are a dream team. We're going to find Franklin, and whoever's taken him are going to deeply regret that. Okay, let's think about this. If somebody took Franklin, they couldn't have gone that direction because that's where I was. I would have seen them go. I didn't even hear anything either. They wouldn't have gone up there because it's a cliff, and they wouldn't have gone up there either because it's a cliff, which means they could have only gone that way. Anything, Chop? Anything? Oh, hold on a second. What is this? This is a tire track, and cars aren't allowed to drive over here. Looks pretty fresh to me. I can smell the rubber right now. Yeah, this is new. Franklin has been taken, and they put him inside a car. Confirmed. I'm gonna follow these tire tracks. Hey, Chop, can you pick up the scent? Yeah, I got it, guys. I got it. Don't worry. I'm gonna follow the tire tracks down and see where they take me to. Hopefully, these are gonna take us straight to Franklin. You would like to think so, at least. Yeah, they go down this grassy area and straight onto the road. Perfect. I think we got him in our sights. They go quite far down as well. No way. Look what I found. The tire tracks take me to this. And this is fresh. The car is still on fire. Hey, Chop, keep back, keep back. Just in case that does explode. We do not want to be caught in there. So whatever happened to Franklin can't have been good. Oh, my days. The car being crashed. What happened here, dude? Hey, Chop, we gotta look for some clues, but be very careful. If that car explodes with us around, it's night-night for us. The fire's gone out. That's good news. The car shouldn't explode. Okay, let's take a look around here. What else can we find? New tire tracks. Hold on a second. These tire tracks, I don't think they belong to the car. These go around the outside. This car looked like it went straight on. That's interesting. Okay, so we got another pair of tire tracks. I mean, could they have really driven off in another car? I'm gonna check inside this house. Maybe, frankly, inside here. I'm inside the house. Now, everyone, I need you to be quiet. I'm using Chop Sniffer for this one. Anything, Chop? Anything? Okay, let's see. I don't pick up any sense. Maybe he could be inside a room like this one. Franklin, I'm coming to rescue you, buddy. Franklin? 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 Come on, buddy. You gotta be in here. The car's parked outside. Where could he possibly be? So he's not inside the house, which means they must have crashed this by accident. How weird is that? Hold on a second. I can see something down there. Do you guys see that? There's something white. What does it say, Chop? <gasps> That's Franklin's photo. We're on the right path. It's official, ladies and gentlemen. Franklin has been taken. He wouldn't just leave his photo lying around. That's an important photo. He uses it everywhere. Okay, Chop, listen to me. Don't panic. Don't worry. We're gonna do everything we can to find him. Hang on a second. He's found something. Oh my days. He's found some sunglasses, and these are Franklin's glasses. I recognize these. He wears them, like, every single time he goes for a date. Yeah, Chop hates these because he leaves him alone all night. Alright, let's go this way. <laughs> okay, carry on, Chop. Carry on picking up the scent. Let's go. It's getting stronger. It's getting stronger. The scent is getting stronger. It's this way. Hold on a second. This is the Lost MC. Franklin and the Lost MC don't get along. Is it coming from in here, Chop? If it is, then good luck, buddy, because these guys are mean. Please not in here. Please not in here. Please not in the Lost MC. <gasps> Chop, I am not starting a fight with the Lost MC right now if they haven't got Franklin. Look at that guy staring at me, dude. Mm. Oh, that was close. It's not here, guys. We're very close to Franklin, though. Wherever he is, he's within a block away. Mm, we're getting closer, getting closer. Where is Franklin? Where is he? He's meant to be, like, around here. Hold on a second, Chop. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Ow, ow, come on. I'm literally seconds away from finding Franklin. Do you mind, ma'am? Oh, as I was saying, I think he's down here before I was rudely interrupted. Okay, let's take a look. How do I get down here? These are just ladders. I'm a dog. Looks like I didn't even need to cross the road in the first plow. Oh, my days, Chop. We gotta look where we cross the road, okay? Franklin could be under this bridge. I have a feeling Franklin is under that bridge. Are you ready for this, Chop? I hope you can swim because you're gonna need to swim right now. Oh, there he is. There's Franklin. Franklin, it's me. Oh, my days. I can't believe it. he's being held up at gunpoint. Oh, no. No, he's seen me. No, no. Go get him. Go save him. Ah. Chop, chop, chop. Oh, no. What's happened? What's happened to us? What's happened to us? Give me your car. No, I think they've taken me as well. Huh? Huh? Oh, no. No, no, no. I'm in a cage. Franklin, this is bad. This is really bad. Hold on a second. These are the people who took Chop the other day. Do you remember when Chop was kidnapped? These two men were the ones who took him. No, I think they're seeking revenge. And Chop, we're stuck in this cage. Oh, no, no, no. I can't believe it, dude. How have we ended up in this situation? You've been a pain to our business, and you're going to pay. Oh, man. This doesn't sound good. I don't understand a word they're saying, but it doesn't sound nice. And considering they got me in a cage and Franklin on the 
ground. These guys don't seem very nice at all. Hold on a second. That's the keyhole up there. You can open the cage from the back. Okay, Chop, listen to me. We're gonna try everything we can to open this cage, but even if we do, there's three of them. No, there's four of them. There is a scary looking clown in the back. That's terrifying. Let's think of a way out of this cage. There's gotta be a way out. I'm getting bored of this. Take him away. Huh? 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 Who are you? Hello? Please don't do anything. They've taken my owner. They've taken Franklin. This is not the situation I wanted to be in, okay? Can you just let me go? I'm just a dog. Yeah, look cute. Look cute, Chop. Look cute. All right, let's just look cute for the camera. I'm just a dog. All right, let's just get him. <laughs> broke out the cage! Yes! <laughs> All right, there we go. That's him down. I don't like clowns anyway. I'm glad to have started with him. I'm gonna rescue Franklin. No, they're driving away. No! Come on, Chop. We can beat them. <laughs> please, 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 please. Oh, that's so annoying. I was so close to rescuing Franklin. Franklin! Franklin! Hey, Chop, do you reckon you can still track him down? Now we know there's three of them. I think we can take all of them. We just have to be smarter. <laughs> Hang on just a second. Chop thinks Franklin is in Lester's house. What would Lester have to do with Franklin? And why is there a dog on the doorstep? This is really weird. Chop seems to think Franklin's in there. We've got a scent inside the house. Could Lester really be working for them? Okay, excuse me, dog. Can you just let me past? I tried to help Franklin, and this is what happened. They tied me up, locked my door, and robbed my house. I think I know where they went. I heard them talking. Follow me. I have no idea what he said, but I'm following him. Wait up for me. Wait up for me, man. Wait up for me. <laughs> Where are you going, buddy? There's a car parked here and Lester's going upstairs. Hey, Lester, wait up. Wait up, man. Wait up. <laughs> Let's use our sniffer. Is Franklin in this building? He is. This is a very, very strong scent. They've taken Franklin in here. They've dragged him across the floor. He's all over the ground. Oh, my days. Hey, Lester. Thanks, buddy. Without your help, I don't think I would have ever found him. Hello? Oh, <gasps> there he is. They're gonna get him. Okay, one second. Three, two, one. No, don't shoot him. Don't shoot him. Don't shoot him. Franklin, quick, help yourself. Yeah, just hide behind the crate, why don't you? Come on, come on, shot. All right, quick, quick, quick. He's shooting me. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Lester, I can really do his snap right now. <laughs> yes. Oh, my days. That was close. Hey, Chop, are you good? He shot me like five times. Franklin, Franklin, where have you gone, buddy? Oh, my days. I think he's run away. Franklin, come back here. Come back, Franklin. <laughs> Where is he gone? Franklin, it's okay. It's just me. It's Chop. Franklin, Franklin, please don't run away from me, buddy. Come on. No, 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 no. I don't want him to abandon me again. Oh, there you are, Franklin. Boy, am I glad to find you again. I can't believe the day we've had. Don't worry, buddy. It's safe. I took them both out. No one is gonna bother us again. Don't worry, Franklin. No need to treat me. But I'll take a pork chop anyway. Oh, and, and Lester helped out as well. Couldn't have done it without him. Wow, what a team. <laughs> we found Franklin. That is the biggest pork shop I've ever seen, Franklin. <laughs> I am literally dreaming right now. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do, Franklin? There's zombies everywhere. Guys, you're not gonna believe this. A zombie outbreak has hit Los Santos, and it's terrible. I just took out two zombies down there, but some of them are trying to get out to my house. What are we gonna do? Wait, we gotta barricade the swimming pool, Franklin. We gotta put some barricades down. I am not letting you zombies get into my house. Actually, before we do that, let's just pick a couple off. You see this guy? You see this guy? Look at that. I shot him with a sniper, and he still gets some. Up. These people are like indestructible. Check it out again. Two bullets with the sniper and he's still getting back up. Three and he's still getting... I don't know what kills them guys. I honestly don't know. Let's go for the head this time. Maybe that works. There we go. Oh, now he's down. We gotta go for the head then. Interesting. If we don't go for the head, then it's gonna be pretty difficult killing them. Uh-oh, there's a lady coming up. Chop, get in the kennel, buddy. Get in the kennel. I got it. Oh, my days. Okay, I'm gonna have to barricade this place before the zombies storm my house, guys. It's only a matter of time before they break in, Franklin. And... Wait, is that my doorbell? Who's at my door? I gotta check this out, but carefully. Carefully. Maybe these zombies are sophisticated. Here goes nothing. Three, two, one. Who is it? Uh, Simeon? What are you doing here? Hey, Franklin. Fancy collecting some cars? There's some pretty cool ones in Los Santos. Simeon, it's a zombie apocalypse. And you want me to collect cars? Are you kidding me? Oh, zombie! Zombie! Simeon! Simeon, get down! Are you kidding me? Can you stop waving that pistol around, Simeon? It's making me nervous. Hey, if you don't want my money... 
money, then go elsewhere. I'll pay you $60 million. $60 million just to collect vehicles in a zombie apocalypse? You got yourself a deal, Simeon. I'll collect these cars for you, but first, let's see what she had on her. Oh, a bottle of water. <laughs> hey, if you guys could be ever so kind enough to press like on this video, it would not only make my day, but it would make Franklin's day as well. He is risking his life just for your entertainment. So if you don't press like, then, I mean, that's pretty evil. <laughs> Dude, I haven't even seen down my road, but check this out. It's completely overgrown. I've locked myself inside for like 10 days. It's not like I can grab a car as well. All of these are destroyed. Okay, Franklin, keep your eyes peeled. There's people everywhere, dude. They're everywhere. Yes, vehicles. I got vehicles. I'll take the Humane Labs truck. This ought to do the trick. All right, jump inside. Please work. Please work for me. Please work. Yes. Come on, let's go to downtown Los Santos. Look at that, guys. There's trees sticking out of the buildings. That is insane, dude. It's only been a couple of weeks. Like, seriously? Okay, we're looking for a vehicle. That's all I know. Simeon really isn't defining these things, which is kind of annoying. So, we're looking for a vehicle, basically. I'm gonna check out down here. I'm a bit nervous. I'm going into an enclosed space in a zombie apocalypse. This is not a good idea. I'm getting out the car. No way! I found it! <laughs> yeah, this is cool. It's a zombie police car. Well, I, I don't think the police are gonna be needing this. If they do, then they're screwed. Not my problem. Oh my days. I love the mini guns at the front. I wonder if we can use them. And it's got the turret on top. Dude, that's a sniper. You can stand on this car and snipe zombies. And it's even got blades around the back, spikes on the wheels and the front, riot shields as well. This is a really nice car. Yo, these zombies are not gonna survive any encounter with this. I'm just saying, I gotta find some zombies. I gotta find some. Hey, zombie, 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 zombie. Hey, zombies. You're gonna love my new car. <laughs> it's even got a siren. That's even better, dude. I can use the siren. Need on, need on. Guys, coming through Los Santos. Hello. Hello. Oh, we got some zombies. Zombies! Hey! Okay, I'm just gonna obliterate them. Three, two, one. <laughs> that was so easy. Hold up. Dude, some of these zombies can drive. Are you kidding me? Look at that guy. He just pulled up next to me. Yo, these zombies are kind of clever. I'm, I'm a bit scared now. If this is what the first vehicle's gonna be, I can't wait to see what else Simeon sends us to get. Guys, there's so many zombies downtown. This is actually crazy. <laughs> Look at the interior. Hey, Roger, Roger. This is the uh, police car 04. <laughs> I stole it. Screw you. <laughs> I'm now having a lot of fun. I'm having so much fun. I'm pleased to announce the first ever zombie car is parked at my drive. Simeon, I'm gonna love this video. As long as we don't die, I'm gonna really enjoy today. Let's go and grab another car. The dam, hey? I wonder what we're gonna find here. Uh-oh. I can hear zombies. I can hear lots of them. Steady on, Franklin. Careful. Oh my days. Okay, there's just a small group. Maybe not so small. Oh no, it's growing. It's growing. Okay, Franklin, open fire and go for their heads. Hey, have you zombies seen like a, a car around here? You know, just looking for a car? <laughs> there's so many of them. Are you kidding me? Don't let them get back up. Nice one. Uh-oh, they're the other side of the fence now. Come on, zombies. Make it easy for me. I think that's all of them, but I never know for sure. Is anyone in there? Oh, there is. There is. There is. Okay, they're down. Whoa, whoa, oh, jeez. Oh, my days. Dude, <laughs> that was so close. Okay, where's this car? Can someone please tell me where it is? It was meant to be on the dam. Simeon said it would be on the dam. Dude, if I find out I'm too late for this car, that is going to be so annoying. Um, guys, I see this in the dam, and I don't see any other cars around here. I thought we were just collecting cars, but hey, maybe Simeon's got another idea. I don't know. I'm just gonna check this out anyway. It looks different. This is like in the water. How am I gonna get this back to Franklin's house, Simeon? <laughs> oh my days. It's a submarine and it's got miniguns on. Okay, I gotta get inside. I gotta get inside this. This actually looks pretty boss. Dude, it's got a digger on the front. I can grind into rock, into cliffs, into anything. This is actually really cool. Hey, let's go underwater. Let's dive underwater, guys. I'm underwater. All right, whoa. Whoa, there's a lot of stuff happening. <laughs> I got computer screens, this thing in my bobby. I can watch my videos whilst I go submarining, guys. Who even knows this is zombie apocalypse? I I'm watching one of my videos already. <laughs> so peaceful down here. Hey, having a submarine isn't actually a bad idea. I just got to figure out a way to get this back home. So I'm going to need to find a cargo bot. Maybe there's one nearby. If they got this in the dam, then they must have dropped this in one way or another. Hey, I got a cargo bot, guys. It looks like they parked it on the beach at the back of the dam. Well, sucks to be them. 
them because I'll be stealing their cargo, Bob, and their submarine. <laughs> There's the submarine. Dude, I can't wait to take this out of the water and actually see this in all its glory. So since Simeon wants me to get submarines as well, does that mean we might find planes or helicopters in this video? Who knows? But I'm gonna just ever so... Oh, jeez. Okay, that wasn't careful. Yes! I'm on! <laughs> okay. Hey, would you look at that, guys? Back in One Piece, this has to be one of the coolest zombie vehicles I've ever seen. Look at these. It's got blades on, like, a shovel at the front, and this crusher, dude, that's gonna crush anything. Anyway, I think I'll take my bagger and, uh, you know, go and grab the next vehicle. Oh, boy. This looks bad. Yeah, are you looking at the ground? That's terrible. That's terrible. I can't believe Simeon is sending me in here. At least the power's still on, though. There's still lights in the tunnel. It does look like everything's being burnt to a crisp, though. Uh, all right, we're looking for a vehicle which is drivable. I think that's a good start. A vehicle which is drivable. I don't think we can drive any of these. <laughs> they don't even have tires. Sounds very spooky as well. I gotta be careful. Franklin, there might be zombies here. Your gun out just in case. Hey, zombie, 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 zombie. Hey, zombie, I'm not scared of you. I know you exist. Hang on, what is that? That doesn't look like a bus or a car. This is the vehicle Simeon wants me to collect. It's got this shovel at the front. Okay, I'm, I'm jumping inside. I'm jumping inside. What? Are you kidding me? This is insane. I've never seen this ever. How did anyone build this? It's got like two cars upside down, burnt to a crisp, just like attached to the top. What does it look like in the interior? Okay, this is interior. I can barely see anything. I got a radio. Hey, come in, come in. Can I hear a copy? <laughs> this is awesome. And it drives. I'm glad to be out of that tunnel. I felt like the whole thing was gonna fall down any second. I'm gonna call this the destroyer. If anything gets in my way, it is being destroyed. Do, do, do. I feel like this vehicle alone needs epic music. That, that's what it needs. Oh my days. I'm gonna go into that horde of zombies over there. Are you ready for this? All right, three, two, one. Plow into them. <laughs> Yo, dude, there's blades underneath. That is amazing. They can't even escape. Once they're in, they're trapped. There is no escape from the destroyer. <laughs> This is the best vehicle ever. All right, I think I better take this back to Simeon before we get stuck in a pile of zombies. Well, Simeon, what do you think of this car? Hmm, could be better, I suppose. Go get the next one. Wow, it really takes a lot to impress you, doesn't it, Simeon? All right, I'll go and get the next one then. Please, don't be disappointed at everything I bring you, Simeon. These cars are amazing. Oh, and submarines, of course, and submarines. Guys, look at Grove Street. Everywhere destroyed. Whoa, man, it's been a while since I've seen something like this in Los Santos. Look, it's endless. Whoa, this apocalypse really has taken a toll on everyone. At least Simeon's around, you know, he's always good to pay me some money, give me some jobs. <laughs> now, I'm looking for the only car which is drivable, so that should be easy enough to find. Everything here has been exploded, destroyed, ruined. Look at that one. It's flattened. Flattened like a pancake. Nope. Another van, another flattened car. Wait, I can see a taxi. Is that it? That looks like the car. Yes, it's a zombie taxi. <laughs> I got it, guys. Well, this has miniguns on the front, riot shields in the windows, and a crazy engine in the hood as well. Whoever built this is gonna be annoyed. Quite frankly, I don't care because now this car is mine. Yo, it's actually offering me jobs. People are calling taxis in this Apocalypse. Ah, uh, I'm kind of tempted. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do a job. <laughs> I, I, I can accept the job. Just send me the location. Oh, sweet. There's meant to be someone to pick up around here. Is this the guy? I think this this is the guy. I got him. Oh, my days. Come on, get him. He's a zombie. It's Simeon, you're sending me zombies. <laughs> Don't worry. I know exactly how to deal with him. I got spikes on the front. Whoever made this car had everything planned out. Nobody will stop us driving this. Goes pretty fast as well. Stop offering me jobs. I'm not doing a taxi job. <laughs> Give me a break. You're sending me zombies, buddy. Well, that sure was fun, but I've got you a taxi now, Simeon. Hey, do you want to do some jobs? You can make some money. <laughs> There's some guy sending some very safe jobs out. You know, just, just accept one and go and pick them up, Simeon. <laughs> oh my days. I love the amount of spikes on the front of this. Like, dude, if you go into anything, they're just going to be impaled straight on the front of this taxi. Okay, let's go and get another vehicle. What has happened here? I, I take one trip up to Grape Seat and uh, suddenly everything is destroyed. All right, I'm holding a gun just in case. Is that a zombie? No, that's just a plant. Dude, there could be zombies anywhere in here. They could be hiding behind cars, behind trees, behind that container. I'm really nervous. Dude, I don't want to die. I, I want to be paid this 60 mil. I want to go home happy. I want to get these cars. This is the highway. I don't see any vehicles, though. I don't see anything which is working. Oh, my days. Just zombies. Literally just zombies. Don't let me down, Franklin. We are not dying here. This is not where it ends. I'm finding this vehicle, and it must be down here. I'm just following the trail. That's all I'm doing. Following the trail. How's it looking? Okay, pretty clear. Pretty empty. Let's keep on moving. I'm looking for a vehicle. Just a vehicle. That's all I need. Dude, there's someone in the crane. Ah! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That was close. Run, 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 run. That's not it. Where is it? 
Hold up, what is this? What is that an oil tank? It's got spikes in and it's smoking. This has got to be it. This has got to be it, guys. Oh boy, that doesn't look very good. Can I repair this? Okay, you know what? I'm just going to jump inside, guys. I'm going to jump inside this thing. Please work. Please work. Please work for me. Yes. Yes, it's working. The smoke's gone. Oh my days, I can shoot fire from this. <laughs> oh, get in. Dude, this looks like it comes out of Mad Max. It's got like a massive skull on top. Spikes all over the entire thing. Yo, that's a scary horn and it shoots fire. Dude, this thing shoots fire. <laughs> I can incinerate zombies whenever I want to. This is the best vehicle ever. Have you seen the blades around the front, by the way? They actually spin. Yep, this for sure is the best vehicle I've collected so far. Screw police cars, screw taxis, screw all of them. I got this. It shoots fire, ladies and gentlemen. I gotta set a zombie on fire. Yo, oh my days. I can set them on fire. Yes. Get in. They don't stand a chance. This vehicle belongs in an apocalypse. Whoever built this knew they would survive for a long time. At least, now they won't since I just stole the car. <laughs> Come on, let's take it back to Simeon. Well, Simeon, you sure are in for a treat, my guy. <laughs> You're gonna love this car. Check it out. This is the best collection yet. Whoa, Simeon, what happened to you, my guy? Everything okay? Doesn't look okay. Everything's fine. Collect the next car. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, Simeon, don't get angry at me. I'm just, I'm worried about a friend. You know, I'm worried about you. All right, let's go and get the next vehicle, Franklin. Well, I do like an easy job. Doesn't look too busy on the highway. Everywhere looks pretty empty to me. I don't see no zombies. And the next vehicle is apparently down here. I don't really like going underground in a zombie apocalypse. You never know what you're gonna find. All it takes is one zombie and he's stuck down here. Hey, Franklin, how about we uh, equip one of these just in case? You never know what we're gonna find. Hello? I'm so nervous. Is anyone? No, we're clear behind. Behind's clear. Yes, in front's clear. And there it is. Dude, it's got another flamethrower. I've got another vehicle with a flamethrower. Dude, this one's automatic. <laughs> it's a ramp buggy. It's setting fire to like everything. It's even set fire to the vehicle. Okay, take it back. Take it back. This is like a death trap. I'm not surprised it was left underground. It's gonna explode any moment now. Hey, let's test out the flamethrower on this zombie. What's up, guy? How we doing? <laughs> oh, oh boy. I'm glad I'm not him. Flamethrower, get incinerated. <laughs> I don't even need to get out to shoot them, guys. I can just use the flamethrower on these zombies. Anyway, I think we better take this back to Simeon. I really don't want to be driving this any longer than I need to, guys. It's on fire. Franklin, we are driving a fireball filled with flammable liquids. This is such a dumb idea. I'm parking this one really far away, like here. Simeon, it's your problem. I'll go and get the next vehicle. Let's go. Hey, guys, this is the motel. This thing is scary enough, just as it is. I don't need to go in here in a zombie apocalypse. All right, let's see. Where is... There it is. All right, I'm grabbing that car. I don't want to hang out here much longer, guys. So it looks like I've got... Oh, my days. No, it says I need a vehicle repair kit. Dude, this isn't even working. Simeon, it's not even working. Oh, no, 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 no. Do we have one? Inventory? Yes. Okay, I've got one. I've just crafted one. I had the resources. So glad I picked up some resources from zombies. All right, here we go. I'm doing some repairs. It might not look like it, but I am. Please, 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 please. I've used up the repair kit. Get inside. And voila, the vehicle works. Congratulations, Franklin. You're now a mechanic. <laughs> I've got it, guys. Now, this has miniguns on the side. It's a Turismo as well. Dude, this is a supercar. This is my first ever zombie supercar, actually. Come to think of it. I like the paint shop. I like the colors. Again, we got a sentry gun above just to take out the zombies, which we can't be bothered to get ourselves. Two miniguns around the side. The interior is pretty nice. Feels completely luxury to me. I know it's a supercar. I know it's a zombie apocalypse, but hey, you can enjoy cars in a zombie apocalypse, okay? Anyway, I want to try out these turrets. Oh my days. Oh my, are you serious? Dude, these are explosive rounds. Are you kidding me? Okay, okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> I have explosive rounds on this. Explosive. This is my favorite vehicle now. I can destroy anything in my path. And it's super duper fast. Doesn't get any better than that. Whoa, <laughs> where did you guys come from? Sorry. Okay, let me put you out of your misery. There we go. Congratulations. Have a good day now. Well, I'm glad you got yourself cleaned up, Simeon. This is quite the collection we got here. How many more cars could we possibly need to find? There's only two more left. Then you'll be paid. Well, there's the car and there's the zombies. Why are these zombies swarming the car? Are you kidding me? Dude, this is just in the middle of some grass. All right, nice. I think they're down. Okay, now's my chance. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Nice, he's down. Okay, run, run, Franklin, run. Grab the car. Oh, my days. Yo, dude, this is like a mix of an underwater ramp supercar. Hey, I kind of want to test this out. Do you reckon we can actually go underwater? Oh my days, it can. Guys, this thing can go underwater. I can shoot on land. It's also got a ramp car underneath. Guys, I can flip things up. Nothing can get in my way. Franklin, this is such a nice vehicle. Okay, bear with me, Simeon. I'm just going to take this to the reservoir and have some fun. All right, I'm in. Is it working? Come on. 
I can hear it. I can hear so. Oh my days. Look at that, guys. Look at that. <laughs> and I got lights. Check it out, guys. We can. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, how have I done that? I, I fired one missile and the entire thing's on fire. <laughs> okay. Something was wrong with this car. This was not my fault. How is this even on fire? We're in water. This doesn't make sense. Oh my days. I've destroyed the back tires. Simeon, I know what you're thinking, but don't be angry with me. The, the wheels just fell off. All right. I don't even know what else to say. It just, it, they fell off, Simeon. They fell off. They, that wasn't my fault at the end of the day. You guys can vouch for that, right? Right? <laughs> All right, let's go and get the last car. What? Simeon wants me to collect the car from Michael's house? Dude, Michael could be alive in there. You know, defending himself against the zombies. He's built some crazy car. And now Simeon wants me to take the car from Michael. Sounds kind of fun, actually. Uh, yeah, let's give it a go. Hello, is anyone in? Anybody home? I just want to get this car and go. Okay, I'm not, I'm not risking my life here. I just want to grab this car and go. <gasps> oh, look at this beast. Michael, this is such a beast. It's even got a rope machine at the back, sentry gun above, a shield on the front, engine, plenty of spikes, and a ram's head. Yes, and, and more spikes, and more spikes. Well, I'll be on my way, Michael. Thank you for the car. <laughs> I've even got a computer in here. That's awesome. I can find exactly where I need to go to using maps. Wow, Michael really kitted out this car. I wonder if that's Jimmy's computer in the front. Wouldn't surprise me. He's the only one with computers in the house. Thanks, Jimmy. Thanks for your computer, and I reckon that's Michael's coffee, too. No, he's not in the back. I, I always worry. Now we can actually lock ourselves inside with 60 million bucks because this is the final car, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna survive this apocalypse. Hey, Simeon, does this work? Yeah, he seems happy. Oh, my days. What happened to you now, Simeon? <laughs> I have a feeling he's really trying to defend himself. Did we just get attacked by more zombies? Are you kidding me? Alright, well, at least he's alive. I'm alive. I've got the cars. Let's get a bird's eye view. And this is what we collected today. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine amazing cars in a zombie apocalypse. What a crazy day it's been. Hey, I gotta pick a favorite, remember? I mean, we got one which is like automatic flamethrower. Seems a little bit too much of a risk for me though. I don't really fancy dying. <laughs> Police zombie car. I got a taxi zombie car. Michael zombie car. Some ramp one which also works in water. Dude, I even have a super zombie car. And then there's these crazy beasts. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. My favorite is the submarine. It just looks insane. You see that a mile away and you just know it's a beast. Everything I touch in GTA 5 turns to god level. Let me show you how it works. It's very simple actually. So if we go outside and take a look at my beautiful car. <laughs> we got the buffalo here. You know, this is Franklin's standard average vehicle. Drives this around. It's pretty good. But if I touch the vehicle, it turns to a god vehicle. It actually looks kind of the same, to be honest. I mean, it's blue. That's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing has changed about this car. Oh, we got a different front as well. It's sort of upgraded itself. Got a spoiler on the back. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. Dude, the color changes. Wait, now it's green. It's changing again. Dude, the color literally changes. That's so cool. All right, now we're back to blue. If I just get out of this thing, it's purple. Oh my days. I can do this to like anything then. So like planes and tanks and literally anything, even police cars. And we can fire rockets. No way. Oh my days. Yo, this is the best car ever. This is literally insane. Dude, I can't wait to do this to, like, every single vehicle I find. What if I, like, try and godify a person? Do you reckon that's kind of possible? Uh, guys, I gotta find out all the answers. <laughs> Hello? Get out of my way. Oh, my days, dude. I just blew him up and my car didn't even get scratched. Literally not scratched at all. Uh-oh, I gotta want to level. Oh, no. Hey, buddy. Can what? What? Dude, I just sent him to the sky. <laughs> this is the coolest mod ever, dude. I want to, like, godify a taxi. What if I touch a taxi, dude? All right, Frank, I'm right. Run, 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 run. No, no, no. Don't drive away from me. Come on. Oh, my days. I lost the taxi. Oh, a taxi. Again. <laughs> hey, buddy. Well, bam. Well, apparently it's been godified. Let's just jump inside. Has it done anything? Excuse me, buddy. <laughs> We're in the passenger seat. Are you kidding? I don't want to ride. I want to steal the taxi. No, come here. I just godified your car for you. Come on. Get, 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 get me the car. Get me the car. Come on. <laughs> come on. Jeez. Oh, my days, dude. All right. Finally, I got myself a god taxi. What do you guys think? It changes colors. I can jump with this thing. Dude, this is the coolest car ever. I've never seen a taxi any other color other than the original taxi color. This is kind of cool. Just driving around in a multicolored taxi. Hey, whoa. <laughs> hey. Okay, watch out for the lamppost, Franklin. Hey, buddy, do you need a taxi? Hey, buddy, come on. Do you want to get in? Hold on just a second. I've done something to my car and now I can spin on the spots. And we've got these colorful smokes coming out the back of the car. Wait, whoa. Dude, I can fly? <laughs> All right, I'm taking you to a destination, my guy. Whatever you do, please keep your hands and legs inside the vehicle. You do not want to get out when you're not meant to. <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, I think his destination was somewhere around here. Let me just double check with the map. Oh, yeah, it was just a down this road and then to the right. That was the easiest journey ever. And you have arrived. Congratulations, my friend. Get out the taxi now. Now, before you go, before you go, my guy, I want to turn you into a god. What happens if I touch him? Uh, hold on a second. What have I just done to him? What have I just done to that guy? What? Dude, I just touched him and now he's got like a light. You're a god. You're literally a god and you're running away. <laughs> Come back here, dude. He's like completely electrified. This is so weird. Okay, I'm gonna do this to like a dog. I saw a dog down there. I definitely saw a dog. I see you, my friend. <laughs> I'm gonna turn the dog into a god. Three, two, one, godify. And there we go. Congratulations. You're now a god. What does that mean it can do? Hold on a second. What is going on with that dog? What is going on with that? Dude, I just like send the dog to space. Are you gonna come down? I think he's flying. Okay, well, uh, this is a bit awkward. I just, okay, maybe we shouldn't like godify. Maybe I'll godify Michael and see what happens then. We'll do that at the end of the video. For now, I want to godify like every vehicle around me. Dude, including this panto. All right, you see this beautiful panto? Godify! All right, let's jump inside. Okay, let's yeah, break the window. Dude, this thing's already like flying. All right, guys, this is now godified. It's mine. And I'm taking this straight to the military base. I'm gonna go to fire tank. And once I get one of those, we're gonna be king of the city. <laughs> Dude, imagine a god tank just roaming the streets. Got me through, everybody. I just got to touch a tank and I can turn it into a god tank. So please let me do this quickly. <laughs> right, let's look for a tank. Uh-oh, I got a four-star wanted level. Oh, my days. Okay, where's the tank? Where's the tank? Where's the tank at, huh? All I need is the tank. Just give me a tank and I'll be out of your hair. I found an APC. That's kind of like a tank, so I might have to stick with that. I mean, I don't really see any other tanks around here, so APC. Yeah, I think we'll go with the APC. <laughs> Dude, this is so awesome. All right, this thing is literally just like chilling there in the yard. Like, how could I not get this? It's kind of rude not even to godify the APC. I mean, all I gotta do is touch it and it's immediately like a million times better. Okay, this is the APC. Very normal, very cool. Let's give it a touch. <laughs> And now it's turned into a god APC. Yo, this thing even changes color, dude. <laughs> I still got the APC cannon. That's pretty awesome. I can, like, fire it at anyone I want. But if I get bored, I still got the rocket. That's so cool. Thanks, guys, for the APC. Appreciate it. I'll be getting out of here now. <laughs> Titan. Imagine if I upgrade Titan into a god vehicle. I mean, that's gonna be awesome, right? Okay, let's get out the APC. I mean, it's cool and all, but I really want to upgrade the Titan. Okay, let's get inside the Titan. See what I've done. Let's take a look at this work, Franklin. Jump inside. Yeah, bring out the stairs. Ba ba dee boop dee bee ba dee bop. And I'm in. It's red. Oh no, it's not. It's going orange. This thing is a god. <laughs> and it's all mine. Uh oh, this thing doesn't want to take off. <laughs> Yo, I could really do with taking off with this. I can't jump. It won't just let me fling into the sky. Hold on just a second, guys. Uh, that's, that's a tank. That's, um, hey, Franklin, are we sure we didn't just accidentally touch a tank? Because that is huge. <laughs> I think we may have just touched one by accident. Get out of this Titan, all right? Okay, Franklin, just get out of the Titan. We are getting that tank. <laughs> Dude, it is huge! Oh my days! Yo, I gotta get it. Is there something I can, like, fly up to it in? Helicopter, of course. I'm gonna grab the helicopter and we're getting the tank. <laughs> Yo, look at the beast! Dude, that's massive! I can't believe I accidentally godified a tank and I didn't even notice. Hey, guys, give me a break. I just wanna grab this tank. <laughs> All right, I've got my helicopter. I think they've locked onto me. Oh, boy, they've locked onto me. Guys, I'm in a god helicopter. You can't take me down. You can try, but you won't be able to. <laughs> okay, so how am I supposed to hijack this tank then? I think that is like the entrance. You see that little thing over there, that little hatch? If I can get on there, we can get inside. These guys keep missing. You suck. Okay, jump out, Franklin, and let's get on this tank. I am pleased to announce that I've got the tank, and I'll be getting out of the military base. It's been a pleasure, everybody. Thanks for having me. <laughs> Dude, this is awesome. Oh my days. So now I'm flying around in my massive god tank. What do you guys think of this thing? Dude, this thing is literally bigger than a skyscraper. If I just had it down like this, we would be the same height. Dude, I just landed on an entire neighborhood. Wait, is this Michael's house? There's Michael's house. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna land on Michael's house. <laughs> This helicopter is trying to kill me. Dude, give me a break. Okay, I'm just gonna leave the tank, like, on Michael's house. Just like that. Bam. Sorry, Michael. Just gotta leave the tank here for the... Oh, my days. <laughs> What's going on? My tank. No. What? I'll leave it there. I think it's safe over there. <laughs> This is crazy. Hold on just a second. Dude, look what I've done. I've turned the tram into a god tram. 
All right, let's get out of here, frankly. I need to find a way out of this place. Okay, let's look at the map, all right? So we gotta go, like, down here. Next station is there. All right, I'm setting the waypoint, and we're going there now. Wait, hold on just a second. I just teleported. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. What? Okay, what if I just set the waypoint there? Will I teleport again? Oh, my days. Dude, I teleported again. Dude, this thing teleported. What? Oh, this is so cool. I can drive. I can teleport. We can jump. It won't even flip as well. Look at this thing. Dude, I can't even flip. <laughs> Check it out. If I'm about to flip over. Uh-oh. No. -uh. We ain't flipping today. A police car. Finally. I found one, guys. Okay. I'm going to godify this car. Well, bam. Yep. As if nothing ever happened. This guy's looking at me so suspiciously, dude. <laughs> All right. Let's just get inside. Oh, okay. There's locks. One second, officers. One second. Just got to break into your car. Oh, no. Now they found me. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just get away in my god car, thank you. Yo, this thing is so fast. Dude, did, did you see how fast I just accelerated? Oh, no. There's more officers down there as well. <laughs> we gotta go, Franklin. We gotta go now. Okay, so check out my brand new god police car. It changes colors like the other ones. We got a, a beautiful green and then a beautiful blue. And we can jump. Can I fire rockets? I can fire rockets with this thing. Presumably, I can also teleport. Let me try this out. I'm gonna go to Mount Chiliad. <laughs> yep, we can teleport. What's up, guys? You having a good hike? Normal day. Day, usual stuff. Yeah, I know, I know, I know how it feels. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. I'm gonna need you to get off the mountain. This is police territory. <laughs> <laughs> this is so crazy. Dude, I'm traveling like really fast right now. Okay, let me just show you the camera. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> Look at me go. How am I going this fast? I gotta test out the speed. 2,000 kilometers an hour? Dude, I'm in space. How did I just get to space? <laughs> 4,000 kilometers now. Okay, guys, now now we're really talking. This is some serious god vehicle right here. 10,000 kilometers an hour? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Dude, I'm going so fast. Amazing. I'm out of space now. Okay, fantastic. Uh, maybe we shouldn't do that again. Hey, what are you guys looking at, huh? Looking at me with my god cars? Yeah, that's what you get for looking at god cars. Now, if I could turn anything else into a god vehicle, what would it be? We've done tanks. We've done... Oh, hold on, hold on. None of you guys can come into me. Okay, I'm not, I'm not giving out free god vehicles. <laughs> I want to turn... Oi, not you! Guys, I have just turned the SUV into a god vehicle, and that guy is driving off. I am now really annoyed. I have just given a free god vehicle, dude. Oh, no, not another one. Jeez, I just gave two god vehicles now. You know what, Mr. Taco Van, I'm grabbing your car, all right? <laughs> there is no way I am giving three god vehicles vehicles out and letting them all get away with it. All right, this is now mine. <laughs> Just stole the taco van. What if we turn the dump truck into a god vehicle? I mean, this is like the biggest vehicle in the GTA universe. So if we turn one of these into a god vehicle, then we're going to be godifying the biggest vehicle in the universe, right? So it's going to be the strongest. It's going to be the greatest. It's going to be the heaviest and it's going to be all mine. <laughs> Godify. Okay, jump on in, Franklin. We got our dump truck. What can this beast do? Does it change color? It changes color. I've never seen a different colored dump truck, dude. It's always yellow. Hey, taco van, I got a burrito to pick with you. <laughs> Bam! I can't get enough speed to really send it flying. And three, two, one, get out of my sight. Dude, this thing weighs like a hundred tons, and I just sent it like a paper carton. There's only one thing left to do, and that is to drive the opposite way down the highway. Bam! You guys all picked the wrong road to come down. <laughs> Woo! Let's go! <laughs> the dump truck coming through, everybody. Look at these guys. I'm sending them like they're nothing. <laughs> Dude, this is crazy. Look at that guy. He's still flying. I'm done with vehicles. We've upgraded enough and we got to fight too many vehicles to even count. But what I haven't got to fight yet is Chop. Yep, guys, I want to got to fight Chop. And then I want to got to fight Michael. I promise you guys I would and I'm still going to do it. Hey, boy, how do you feel? Do you feel any different now? Uh... I mean, you definitely look a bit different. Okay, this is kind of cool, dude. I have just got to fight Chop, and he has no idea. He's still scratching his ear and probably going for his morning poo, so... <laughs> dude, he literally has no idea. Hey, Chop, you see that officer? Go get him. Go get him, boy. Go get him. Go get him. <laughs> yes. Yes. Go on, boy. You're being attacked by a god dog. How do you feel? I mean, it could be worse. It could just be a normal dog, but this is a god dog. Well done, Chop. Well done. <laughs> You got him! So now we know Chop is an absolute boss going against police officers. Let's see what happens if we, uh, you know, gotta find Michael D. Santa. What do you think he's gonna do then? Uh, okay. Well, this is, uh, this is definitely interesting. Michael is floating now. <laughs> and he's a ghost. <laughs> and he's got the god powers. I have just made Michael D. Santa into a god! Okay, go, 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 go! Chop, you're by yourself. This is too much for me, dude. I'm getting out of here. No, 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 no. <laughs> Chop's still in the driveway. Okay, Chop, you're meant for Michael. Both of you are gods. Jeez, I can hear him charging up. <laughs> 
I genuinely think the house is gonna explode. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh my days. Hey, Franklin, are we good? Everything good? Oh my days. <laughs> Dude, Michael literally blew up the entire of Los Santos. And now we're coming in for a crash landing. Good job in my god cup. The Avengers helicopter is in GTA 5. And it's a good time I found this now because we're about to run out of fuel, Franklin. <laughs> look at those fans. Hey, guys, I don't really want to fall in them. <laughs> they look creepy. Oh, and we've landed. Nice one, Franklin. Is anyone around? We've got to be careful. We're not spotted. They've actually got jets on here. That's so cool. I think we better to take one of those if we need to escape. Come on, Franklin, jump inside and let's get this lined up. I'm really nervous about what we're about to find, guys. I am in the Avengers helicopter. This is where Nick Fury basically lives. If they find out we're here, we're gonna have an all-out war with the Avengers. Okay, Franklin, leave this here and let's go exploring. This must be where they get dressed, watch their videos and stuff. I don't know, like... Seriously? <laughs> they got lockers? Dude, this is where they sleep as well. Yo, this is amazing. They don't show me this. Oh, my date. I feel like I'm seeing something I'm not really allowed to see. Come on, Franklin. Keep on moving before someone notices us. It's that food. Hey, guys, what foods do you reckon the Avengers eat? This must be their canteen area. What do they eat? Let's take a look. Tinned tomato soup, vegetable soup, seafood noodles. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> oh, dude, this is disgusting. They got tuna there. That's quite nice. Oh, yo, this is their games room. Looks like someone already played a game in snooker and had to leave midway through. What are these? Huh? Okay. <laughs> hey, yo, okay. Let's go up this staircase. I really don't want to bump into any of the Avengers. If we bump into Captain America, he is going to be so angry that we're on his ship. I found the control room. I found the control room and no one's flying this. This is literally a dream. Hey, Franklin, how about we start flying this now? So, one of these buttons has to do something. I feel like a kid in a Spaceship. Well, I basically am, actually. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh, how about these ones? <gasps> It's moving. It's actually moving. We're flying this. <laughs> this is so cool. I really hope no one minds we're doing this. I mean, I don't really want to get in a fight with Iron Man, but I will if I have to. Well, this is terrifying. There is no way I'm going on that fan. But if you press like on this video, Franklin will tie rope across that. What are we saying, guys? Okay, well, we're doing it anyway. Whoa, we're on. Whoa. <laughs> oh, this is so freaky, dude. I've made it across, and now I'm in the middle of the fan. Let's jump away this way, guys. Look how sharp they are. Ah, dude. Whoa, this is insane. Okay, we survived. I'm not doing that again. What the? Welcome to the luxury suite. Did you know the Avengers had a luxury suite? How luxury is this suite? I want to take a look around. This is kind of cool. I mean, saving the world seems to have its perks. Oh my days. There's so many pieces of artwork from the films. Look at that, guys. The Quinjet, the Quinjet, the Quinjet. <laughs> oh, that's the helicopter. Is that above GTA 5? Was that from here? Look how busy it is is, guys. You can tell that was a busy day. I like these gardens as well. I mean, this kind of reminds me of those things they just shoot from the ship, so let's not get inside one of those. There he is. The man, the myth, the legend, Mr. Fiore. Whoa! 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 Fiore! I gotta find him, guys. This is so cool. Shield. Oh, my days. Yo, this is quite a luxury suite, guys. I won't lie. We got, like, a massive TV here. The carrier in. Oh, yeah. Hey, Franklin, isn't this just the best party ever? Carrier in. Avengers just below us. I'm waiting for my mates, guys. Guys, Franklin, be careful. I can begin to see military personnel. If they detect something's wrong or suspicious about me, they're gonna shoot me down. We're literally in the most disclosed place in the entire universe right now. I don't think anyone wants me to come here. Oh boy, I have no guns on me either. Okay, we're gonna have to do this very carefully, Franklin. Let's just walk up like it's nobody's business. Hold up, there's even more military personnel. There's a guy literally looking at me up there, dude. Okay, let's talk to this guy for a second. My name is Franklin. I've got an appointment with Mr. Fury. Hang on a minute. Mr. Fury doesn't have appointments. I'm just messing with you. Go on, go in, go in, go in. It's okay. Oh, jeez. Okay. This guy's a bit of a meanie. <laughs> right. No need to mess with me like that, dude. Let's carry on moving, Franklin. Go to our appointment, as usual. <laughs> How dare he? That really scared me, dude. I thought that was it. And now we're literally inside the Avengers lair. They've got a quad bike! <laughs> Whoa! 
Oh, two bodyguards. <laughs> Yo, this is amazing. No one's stopping me. Hang on, what are these scientists doing? What I would do to know what's inside those vials. Imagine if it was like a miniature nuke. Okay, he doesn't want me to look at the window. Fine, I'm getting away from the window. Happy now, buddy. Happy. What does this do? How do I... Can I? Oh, it's a door. I was just going into glass. Okay. This one might mean we fall through the ship. And this one might mean we go to the Avengers. I really don't know what to trust. But I'm just going to go with this. I'm hoping they're honest people. Oh, they are. Oh. <gasps> There they are, dude. Oh my days. Captain America, Black Widow, Spider-Man, even Iron Man, and the man himself, Nick Fury, right at the back. This is amazing. I've literally found the Avengers in GTA 5. Hey, what's up, Spider-Man? How we doing? Iron Man, Captain America, you keep doing your press-ups, buddy. And look at that, Nick Fury. Fury. So many guards. Okay, let's not slip up here. I'm just gonna walk over to Nick Fury like I genuinely had an appointment with him. Hi, Nick. Lovely to see you. You too. What can I do for you? You're doing great. You're doing great, Mr. Fury. Uh, okay. Thanks, I guess. Do you want an autograph? An autograph would be nice. That'd be great. Could you give me an autograph? No! Get out of my face! I was joking! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, Mr. Fury. No need to be that furious with me. I'll be getting out of here then. He was kind of mean, not gonna lie. I mean, the Avengers I thought were really cool, but Mr. Fury was really mean to me. I just wanted to get an autograph. I don't really want to leave without taking a full, proper look around the ship though, guys. I want to know what the scientists were looking at there. There's gotta be some really secret chemical or something. I think if we run inside and grab one of the vials, we can get out of here before anyone catches me. Run, Franklin! Run, 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 run! Grab the vial! <laughs> go, 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 go! I've got it! On the quad bike! Get out of here, Franklin! Oh boy, this is bad! This is really bad! <laughs> <laughs> Quick, Franklin! The alarms are sirening as well. Snipers! It's through this guy! And we're just jumping off. Whoa! Whoa! Jeez! <laughs> this is insane! Whoa, what's going on? Whoa! Whoa! Jeez! Are you seeing this, guys? Something really weird is happening to Franklin. I can barely see! Oh, boy! Quick! Get off the quad bike, Franklin! We're gonna crash! I can't even go! Franklin, listen to me! Franklin! Are you there? Guys, you're not gonna believe this. Inside that vial was a secret remedy which has turned Franklin into Spider-Man. This is amazing. I am literally playing as Spider-Man right now, everybody. I can shoot webs from my wrist. Franklin has become Spider-Man. I want to test out some of these powers. Hey, you, stop right there. I can shoot webs at people. That's amazing. Okay, do you reckon I can stop this truck? I'm gonna give it a go. Oh, okay, I've got a web on it. <laughs> what? Oh, I just moved the truck. Okay, I'm gonna grab this guy. Nope, we're flying over here. I still gotta learn the controls a little bit. I have a feeling Franklin is just picking up this new superpower. What happens if I, I can pick up a barrel and throw it as well? That's amazing. Franklin is suddenly really, really strong. Hang on. He's got spidey senses. There's an armed robbery happening nearby. It's only 300 meters away. Let's go. After all, we have just become Spider-Man. Hey, guys. <laughs> oh, my days. Come on. Whoa. I just kicked three of them in one. One go! This is amazing! Hey, you! Stop it right now! Uh-oh, they're beginning to hurt me. Ow, that crowbar hurt me a little bit. Come on, Franklin, we can do better. Let's shoot some webs. You, get on the ground! You, stick him to the wall! Oh, looks like he's a little bit stuck. Hey! <laughs> Stop right there, everybody! The robbery's over. You failed. Hey, I could get used to these powers. Now, Franklin, Spider-Man, we can do anything we want to, like rob a bank. Well, 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 look where we've arrived. The Pacific Standard Bank. Hey, Franklin, I think we're gonna wipe out this bank clean. Whoa! <laughs> hey, this is so cool. And this guy, hey, um, whoop! <laughs> this is amazing. I can do this to hostages. Oh, come on! Why are you gonna call the button on them? That's just gonna cause more damage. All right, sorry, ma'am, but I can't trust you. Okay, let's rob some money. Put the card in. Beep, 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 beep. Bring out the laptop, and let's start typing. I need to line up these so they meet the red line. Easy enough. We're in. Let's bring the door open, shall we? You know, the money part. There it is, guys. This is the easiest robbery ever. Hey, Franklin, stop climbing on the walls, all right? I know we're Spider-Man, but we don't need to do that. Franklin, we're gonna be so rich after this that we can do anything we want to. Three million dollars! Let's go! That doesn't sound good. Did you hear that, guys? It sounded like an explosion. Okay, let's take a look outside. Don't worry, we are Spider-Man after all. We can defeat anything they throw at us. Oh, no! Guys, they called the police! Don't worry, I'm Spider-Man. We can stop them. Oh, you... Where'd you go? Guys? Why don't they care? That's really odd. I just robbed a bank. Excuse me, officer. Why aren't you doing anything? I literally just electrocuted... <laughs> 
<laughs> They're scared of me. Let's get out of here, Franklin. I think I might just swing my way out of here. Whoop. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Yeehaw. <laughs> Wait. Who's shooting me? Is that coming from the sky? Oh no, it's Iron Man, guys. Okay, Franklin, I think we better fight Iron Man. Oh, <laughs> this is amazing. I'm gonna go out of here somewhere a little bit higher up. Whoa, watch out for his lasers. Let's just kick him. Oh, jeez. Impact web, another web, another one. Yes, that's do the trick. Hang on, did we get him? I just killed Iron Man. You went down so easily, dude. Okay, Iron Man was easy. Now we've got Hulk chasing us. Oh boy, where's he gone? Ah, there he is. Quick, Spider-Man. Franklin, we can do this. Whoa, car. No, put that down. Use another web on him. Oh, man, he's taken out half of my health already. Quick, stick him to the ground. Move it. Stick him. Stick him. Stay down, Hulk. Ow! <laughs> he threw the taco truck at me. Come on. Come on. I'm not losing to Hulk. Spider-Man is better than Hulk. He's better than Hulk. He's better than Hulk. Do we get him? Yes! Get in! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Spider-Man's powers are better than Iron Man and Hulk, guys. Prove me wrong, because I just proved myself right. <laughs> Franklin, we have absorbed the best powers in the world. Hey, Chop, look who's back. I just had the biggest battle ever. Guess what, Chop? No one can stop us. <laughs> Chop doesn't seem to care about my powers. Oh, well, let's take him for a walk, Franklin, and celebrate our hard-earned cash. Something strange has happened to Los Santos. When I logged on this morning, tiny things had changed around the city. And then I got to Franklin's house and realized he's vanished. He's gone. And it's not like I can play as him or try and find him because Lamar has replaced his entire character. But get this, it gets even weirder because when I go inside this house, everything is different. It's as if Franklin never even existed. This is where Lamar lives. He's got photos on the wall, wallpaper everywhere. And if you take a look on the map, everything he needs is here, including Chop and his wardrobe. This is his house. I wish I was kidding with you guys, but this is not a joke. Everything in the house is different and there's not a single trace Franklin ever existed. I mean, even the mini photos have been changed to Lamar's girlfriend. But I'm gonna do everything I can to find out what's going on and to rescue Franklin and bring him back. But I don't know how we're gonna do that because he doesn't even live here. What about Chop? Oh, that's a fantastic idea. Let's see what happens if I say hello to Chop. The moment of truth. Chop's the same. I mean, he's... Wait, hold to interact with Chop. Wait a second. I could take him for walks? Oh, my head is hurting right now. Only Franklin can do this. Have I got a ball? Oh my days. I've got a ball. Are you kidding? This is insane. Okay, let's see if we can actually play fetch. I'm beginning to think that Lamar has replaced Franklin, but how could all of this have happened overnight? Even the car is different. Oh my days. This is a golden 4x4. Hang on, I've got an idea. What if Franklin is in the garage? Did Lamar kidnap him? I mean, that's always possible. Something tells me Franklin's got to be in this garage. It's not even opening, which means somebody's locked it. The moment of truth, Lamar. Uh, let's see, is Franklin in? Wait, hang on a second. Franklin? Franklin? Oh, boy, is anyone in that car? Frank, are you in that car, buddy? What's happened? I mean, I'm beginning to think he either died, he ran away, or moved somewhere else. Can't be anything else. I mean, this doesn't make sense. We need to find some answers. Okay, Chop, let's see if you fetch this bull. If you really remember Franklin, you won't fetch the bull. Go on, go get it. Oh, my days, he's actually getting the bull. This is so strange. Lamar, what have you done with Franklin? Franklin's my boy. I, I don't leave him like this, guys. I need to find him, and I need to find out what's going on. Wait, do you see that? Good boy, Chip. Chip. No, this is Chop. Do you guys see that? Lamar just called the dog Chip. It, it said on the kennel, Chop. Let me try this again. Go on, go fetch. He said it again. Go fetch, Chip. His name just changed. It was Chop a second ago. Do you guys see that too? Wait, guys, the screen's bugging out. Is this my screen? Hang on a second. It's not my screen. It's literally bugging out. Hang on a second. Hey, Lamar, get up, get up. Did you see that? It said help me behind the code. Lamar, Lamar, Lamar. I'm so confused. He just collapsed on the ground and my screen bugged out. It wasn't even my monitor. Did you guys see that too? Hey, 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 hang on a second. What's going on? Guys, it's just switched me out of Lamar. Michael? Oh, good. Okay, some familiarity. Michael's still okay. That's great. If Franklin really exists, he's gonna be on my phone. That's a fantastic idea. I'll give him a call and find out what's going on. A, B, C. C, D, E, F. Hang on. Hang on a second. Where is he? A, B, C, D, E. G, it just skipped out F. I'm so confused. He should be on your phone. Michael, he's your best friend. We play golf with him at least a hundred times. Okay, that's it. I'm going straight to his house and I'm going to find some answers. Now I know Lamar has been knocked out cold and we should have enough time to explore that house and find some clues. There's got to be some reference to Franklin. Like, he can't just have vanished like that and everything along with him has disappeared. That doesn't make any sense. Something must tell me he once existed in this universe. Something. Lamar, how did you get back here so quickly? You were knocked out cold on the park floor. Hey, you don't know me, Lamar. You... 
I'm not your friend. I, you know whose friend I am? Franklin. Wait, what do you mean, who's that? He's your mate. You, your best friend. No idea. Are you kidding? All right, guys, this is so strange. Lamar is acting like he doesn't even know who Franklin is. That's so weird. I'm convinced he's locked him in a cage. Hey, hang on a second. This is, um, this is a new dog. Who are you? Hey, I need to go and check out Chop's kennel first. What in the world? Hey, uh, hang on a second. What's happened to Chop's kennel? I literally saw it this morning. It's gone. Um, guys, I... This is too much mental work for me in this morning. <sighs> I'm not going crazy, right? We definitely saw Chop. Like, a few minutes ago, we were playing fetch with him in, 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 in the park. I don't know who you are or what your name is, but you don't belong here. And when Chop comes back, he's gonna make sure you know that. <laughs> oh, hang on a second. The laptop. Oh, perfect. I'll check out the internet history. What do we got? Order takeaway. Make a good cake. Car repair. That's it. There's nothing sus about these. Oh, man, where could he be? It's not exactly making it easy for me. Think, Michael. There's got to be something which Franklin would do. What about my text? The, of course, the text. Here we go. Unknown. I need help. That's got to be Franklin. I'm being removed forever. Speak to Lester. Franklin must have sent this before he was removed. How can you remove a character? I mean, that's impossible. I've got a clue. Finally, this is amazing. We can actually search for Franklin. My first clue. <laughs> It only took me 20 minutes to find. So he must have sent that before he disappeared. But that doesn't explain why Lamar doesn't know who he is. We need answers. And Lester seems like the only person who can give us those. Let's go to his house and find out what he knows. What do you think's happened to him? If you had to make a guess, let me know in the comments below. Literally anything good at this point. And I don't think any answer is that crazy. I mean, it feels like I've already gone crazy just filming this video. This is where Lester lives. Not much has changed. And it still looks like he lives here, which is great. If I find out Lester's also disappeared, I'm gonna be pretty annoyed. Beware of the dog, no trespassing. Yeah, this is definitely where Lester lives. I don't think anything's happened to him, but wait, there's a note on the door. What does that say? I'm dead. What? Screw this. I'm going inside. Lester isn't dead. Lester, I know you're alive. Where are you? Lester? Lester? Everything's on. I mean, if he was really out cold, then he would be somewhere in here. No, he's not in here. Well, you know what I'm gonna do? It's always a giveaway when you look at their history. I wonder what Lester was searching. Maybe that will give us some clues. How to hide forever? Nearby caves. He's definitely not dead. Lester's hiding, but why would he be hiding? Okay, there's a couple of caves nearby. I'm gonna go and search them and see if we can find Lester. Clearly, he's gone on a run. And he's hidden in one of those caves. Once we find Franklin, I I'm sure we can figure this out, but as far as I'm standing, this is the end of Franklin Clinton. Lester's gotta be in there. The next one is 20 miles away. I don't wanna make too much noise. Let's leave the car and head up on foot. If Lester's hiding in that cave, we'll be able to get some answers. I just really hope he is. Come on, Michael, start running. The moment of truth. Lester, are you in there? I just need some answers. Is he in there? Oh, yes, he is. Michael's even got his hands up. <laughs> All right, I'll keep my hands up as well. Lester, I just need some answers. Uh, a friend of mine, Franklin, said you could help him. Wait, what do you mean, who's Frank? It's, it's, it, it, yeah, he's important. He's significant. How do you not know who he is? You have to believe me, Lester. Something really weird is happening to this universe. Wait, it's happening again. It's happening again. Michael, do something. I gotta get out of here. Michael, no. Come on, there's gotta be something I can do. Get up, Michael, get up. Seriously? Uh, hey, hey, get up. Get up, Mike. What? Wait, this isn't even my house. Can I see my house from down here? There's the golf club. Yeah, my house is somewhere down there. I think I can just about see it. Um, hello? Hello? Is there anyone here? Guys? What is going on? Lester, are you, are you still here, buddy? Oh, yes, you are. Lester. Yeah, I was, uh, I was sleeping. Wait, read this. Hang on, why? Why are they crossed out? Hang on a second. Franklin's on that. Franklin's crossed out. Denise's shop is as well. Michael's crossed out. That, that's my name. Why is my name crossed out, Lester? They're being deleted. No, that's impossible. If, if they're being deleted, how come I'm still here? Because I'm Steve? Wait, no, no, no. no. Hang on a second. Because I'm Steve. Wait, why? Why? What? Hang on. Why does my character will have a different face on it? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm going crazy. Can I double check that? Michael's face is not on there. It's replaced Franklin. It's replaced Michael. And now we're not even Michael anymore. Hang on, Trevor's calling me. Hey, Trevor, what's up? Yo, Steve. Want to throw some grenades? Um, uh, this is Michael. Oh, sorry. Wrong number. What? Dude, even Trevor called me Steve. Everyone in the world calls me Steve. I'm so confused. It, who's doing this? How is this happening? Somebody is changing the game, and that's why Franklin's gone? Well, who's changing the game, Lester? I need to know. Here's an address. Lots of interference is coming from it. Good luck. All right, Lester. Well, thanks, I guess. Let's go and stop them. Where am I? Wait, who are you? Are the 
postman. Uh, hey, I guess. All right, thanks, I suppose. This is my car. Oh, my days, dude. I kind of wish I had Michael's life back again. I don't believe that Michael's being replaced as well. Like, surely this is impossible. How could this... I'm, I'm going to check out my house first, and then we'll see what Lester's address is. If someone's really doing this, then I'm going to make sure they stop. And then I'm going to make him tell me where Franklin is. Why would Michael not live here? We all know this is his house. I mean, come on, we've seen it a million times. Hang on a second. Why does it look different? That's not the same brick we used before. What does it look like? It did not look like this this morning. Amanda, what have you done? Wait, uh, who said that? Someone just said, can I help you? Are you in here? Oh, my. Wait, hang on a second. You're the guy from the wheel. Who are you? You're Michael. No, you're not Michael. I'm Michael. This is hurting my head. Can I punch this guy quickly? I just want to see what happens if I... Do one... Okay, well, let me hit him. That's fine. This is so strange. The maid is still here. What? The kitchen's different? The green juice is still out. The table's different. What? Even the outside is different. I'm so confused. We haven't seen the Taj Mahal before. Or the Leaning Tower of Pisa. Or even Paris. I haven't taken Amanda anywhere. Even London's on here as well. What? Tracy, Tracy, Tracy. Come on, you gotta be in, right, Tracy? Well, at least Tracy's room looks the same, but she doesn't even recognize me. Guys, everything in this house is different. Even the toilet's different. I think Michael has been replaced, and the same thing must have happened to Franklin. Right, that's it. We're going to this address, and we're gonna put an end to all of this. We're reversing everything that's happened, if that's even possible. I mean, how do you undo something that's already been deleted? This is where Lester wants me to go to. It's a government facility, and somebody inside might just be rewriting the entire game. Problem is, if I alert the government, because let's be honest, I'm not allowed in there, then they might be on high alert and lock everything down. And th then that ruins everything. So I need to find a way to sneak in. And I don't think these guys are going to let me in there. Let's give it a go. Do you reckon they'll let me in? I really hope they do. Wait, I can. Amazing. All right, let's just go inside. You don't want to be seen. Let's get close to the walls. Right, beautiful. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, there's two officers there. That security guard has got his back to me. But those two officers, kind of scared about. You know what I'm thinking I use a suppressor and get both of them. Three, two, one. Bop, beautiful. And the next guy, bop, beautiful. Nice. No one saw anything. All right, let's keep moving, Mike. Or Steve, should I say? I don't even know what to call this guy. Go inside. Whoa, it's massive. Okay, we got some guards on that door. The IAA on the floor. Okay, I don't want to alert guards. Let's just pretend like we belong here. And it looks like, wait a second, is that what I think it is? Yep, that's the reception desk. All right, if we just walk down here, I'll be able to take a look around and not raise any eyebrows. So this is run by the IAA. These guys have a tower in Los Santos. They're pretty big. And I don't know what they're doing, but they're up to something. Oh my days. Look at all the computers down there. They have so many people working for them. Wow. Okay, that's crazy. Now, let's see what happens if I talk to these ladies. Hello? Hi, Steve. How do you know my name? You, I, I didn't even say my name. You know everyone's name? Okay. How? Um, okay. I, I'm gonna walk away now. Nope. Nope, I I didn't have no. Why is she saying I definitely did? This is really freaking me out, Michael. We better get out of here. Remember our mission: rescue Franklin, figure out what's going on. This is a really strange place. She knew me, and she acted like I had an interview with someone. Okay, that's it. I'm going straight through these guys. Hey, uh, can I see what's down there, please? I am not screwing around now. I need to see what's going on. Oh no, the alarms got off. The alarms have got off. Hey, you, get out the way, and you as well. Duh, nice, nice. Wait, dude, there's a huge screen in there. What? Okay, what is going on in this room? Why is there a Massive IAA scream. Right, that's it. There's no one in that room. What about down these stairs? They were guarding the stairs. Yes. Perfect. All right, come on, Michael. Head down here. Come on, go, go, go. Floor level minus two. Ooh, it's like a bunch of interview rooms. Wait, Franklin? Franklin, what if Franklin's in here? This is where they do the interviews. Frank? Frank, this is so freaky. Frank, where are you, man? Come on. It goes down again? I'm so confused. Franklin! Frank! Wait, there's even more people. Get them, Mike. Get them! And this guy! You! You've got to be behind this. Whoa, don't tell me to calm down. Why are you calling me Michael all of a sudden? Give me one good reason why I shouldn't. Wait, I can't fire. I can't shoot. Why won't this work? Come on, something else better work. No, I can't even shoot with this either. This is really annoying. Right, that's it. I'm gonna go punch this guy instead. You, go down. Ah! Dude, there was a huge flash. What did he do and how did he do that? Uh, uh, get up. Get up. What is this place? Hello? Hello? What in the world? Where am I? Wait, there, there's something down there. This is a really weird place. There's like dust everywhere. Am I dreaming? see what this is. There's something over there. Hello? Can I help you guys? Someone tell me what this place is. Am I stuck here? This is a box. There's got to be a way out. There's got to be a way out. There has to be. Wait a second. That's job. That's... <gasps> That's Franklin! That's Franklin in the shop! And that's Denise! I can't believe it. I actually found you. What happened? The same thing. The same thing? Wait, you guys 
guys got zapped too. They just said goodbye. The end of Franklin. Have fun here. Hey, but we got to get out of here, man. What do you mean there's no way? There's got to be a way. Come on. We can punch through this wall. Ow! Ow, oh, boy! It's electric. All right, maybe we can't do that. Have you thought about anything else, Frank? This is really weird. They can't just do this to us. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Guys, it just moved me somewhere. Who am I? Hello? Whoa, Lester. No way. Okay, we're out of that box. Whatever that was, someone's just put us there. And I can't do anything about it. Let me see. What's Lester's plan? Go back to the building? That That's not gonna work, Lester. We're gonna die. So it seems like somebody in that facility is rewriting the entire game. And they are deleting characters left, right, and center. But why would they delete Franklin and Michael? At this rate, Trevor's gonna be next too. Climb the wall. All right, we're going in a different way this time. We're going around the back. All right, I can do that up here as well. Wait a minute. Do you guys see that? Disable the power. That's a really good idea, but... First, we better disable the officers around us too. You know, make sure they don't come after us either. All right, he's down. Beautiful. Now let's disable the power. So this must supply the power to the entire facility. If we can do that, we can stop him deleting us. Yep, that ought to do the trick. Ah, oh, beautiful. And then these things too, and that thing, and whatever this thing is. Now the only thing left to do is to sneak inside. Yes, there's a door over there, and it looks like it's left up ajar. Perfect. We'll sneak under this garage door. My guy. Has he even got night vision? That's insane! <laughs> Alright, we can see and they can't. Hey, we know where to go to, Lester. You know the drill. We haven't got long until we get the power back on. This is a huge facility. They've got to have at least seven different generators to back up the power. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on. We're literally running against the clock right now. If they put the lights on, then it's game over and we won't be able to save our friends at all. We can do this. We can do this. We can do this. Wow, you really did do some damage down here, Mike. There he is. There he is. Right, three, two, one. Yes, got him. Beautiful. That's the person who's changing the code. Right now he's down. Uh-oh, that's not good. The power's back on. Quick, shut the door. Shut the door, Lester. Shut the door. Yes, we'll be safe in here for now. This is quite the base you got down here. Look at those servers and look at these computers. All right, let's see if we can rewrite some of this. Bring Franklin back, Michael, and anyone else who's been deleted. Let's see. There's got to be... Ah, here we go. Password. Password. Hey, buddy, did you have a password? Nope. No password. Oh, my days. What's the password? One, two, three, four. Password denied. Come on. Subscribe at same time for password. Does that mean it does? Everyone watching needs to subscribe at the same time. And then we get the password. I I've had to do this a few times in the past, and 50-50 it works, because half of you guys subscribe and the other half don't. Okay, keep your finger over the subscribe button, the TV remote, whatever it is you're watching it on. We're gonna subscribe to this channel together and get the password and save the day. Three, two, one. Whack that subscribe button as hard as you can. Now! 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 Yes, we got the password! Thank you so much, guys. You're legends. Alright, we're in, and there's a lot of stuff here. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna press delete. <gasps> Hang on, I'm back in. Franklin! I'm back! Yes! <laughs> Where's your car, Frank? Where's your car? You know what? It doesn't matter. I'm taking this person's car. We got Franklin back. He's in this universe again. I think I've done it. I have never been happier to see Franklin again. His car's outside. What a relief. Okay, let's go inside the house. Is it still different? Is Lamar living here? Nope. It, it, it's all back to normal. It's exactly how it should be. And chops in his kennel as well. <laughs> Yes, everything's back to normal. What about Michael? Michael, what are you up to, buddy? Okay, looks like he's doing a bit of shopping. Is that who we think it is? It is. It's not Steve. It's Michael. <laughs> it's as if nothing ever happened. This is so weird. I wonder if these characters have any idea what happened as well. I mean, if they technically deleted everything in the coding, then that would have been wiped from their memory. So this entire adventure would just be between me and you guys. Everything's back to normal again, even in Michael's house. Wait, do you reckon Lester made it out alive? We better go and check out his house. Come on, Mike. May as well. Uh, I know we're not really too fond of Lester, but after all, he did just save our life. Wait a minute. Lester, did you do something to the code? <laughs> Michael might have forgotten, but I definitely haven't. He's got so many cars. Well, at least we know Lester's okay. He might have given himself a bit of a better life, only just a tiny bit, but <laughs> at least he's a okay. I'm breaking into the most expensive museum in GTA 5. There's trillions of dollars of artifacts inside waiting to be taken. They've been loading things in there all day, and I'm pretty sure they plan on opening this in two weeks' time. But when we take everything, they're gonna have to reschedule. <laughs> but we got a problem. There's lots of guards, and they have really strong vehicles. And it's just me and Trevor. There's no way we'll get through them. Even though Trevor's super crazy, we have nothing to use and no money to spend. But not to worry, I got a plan. Hey, what's up? 
Are you ready for step one? Yes, Lester, we're ready. Inside the military base is a really strong car. We take that, drive it away, go do the heist, and those guards won't be able to stop us. All we need to do is sneak inside, which is gonna be a little bit tricky, but you're with the pros on how to sneak inside. Now, this person's always looking at the front, so going around there is a stupid idea. Let me just see if I can try my luck, though. Hey, man, can I come into the base? I'm a tourist. I want to go see what you're doing. Authorized personnel no? only. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna walk. Oh my days. All again. right. Yeah, like I Leave said, they're not gonna now. let you go in through the front, which is why we're gonna have to sneak in around the side. And with Trevor keeping a close eye on me, and making sure you know no one surprises us, this should be a walk in the park. Just gotta climb on this, do, 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 and then climb up here, and we're already sneaking inside. You didn't even see me. Now stay as close as you can to the edge of the wall. And yes, we haven't got a wonder level. No one knows I'm in the base. Everything is okay. Now we're just gonna get to the RCV, drive it out of here, and we're gonna be home running. Besides, I need something to carry all the goods from inside the museum. I don't know what we're gonna find, but we need a big enough vehicle to carry it all. This is a building I've never been inside, but if you've been into any museum, you know there's gonna be some crazy things. Now the vehicle I'm looking for is in that car park. Quick, hide here, Franklin. Don't get seen. Yes, there's a tank. It's driving away. Hey, Trevor, is the coast clear? Yeah. All right, thanks, Trevor. Let's go, Franklin. Time to get the RCV. Run, run, run. Oh, my days. I got four stars. I got four stars. <laughs> Someone's seen me. already been shot. And there it is. Oh, my days. All right, get inside, get inside, get inside, get inside. Yes. <laughs> we got the vehicle. Take that, suckers. You really thought you could stop me? Well, guess what? You can't. Now we just got to lose the wonder level. Yeah, we'll do that. Easy. Peasy. And as long as we don't encounter a tank or something, yes, yes, we're gonna be just fine. <laughs> a Stella Vista, idiots. This is a super heavy vehicle. I literally have a shover at the front, so if anyone gets in front of me, there's no way they're gonna stop this. You may as well give up while you're alive. See, you might end up like that guy. Hey, Lester, I got the vehicle, and now what do we do? There's a safe house. Sending location now. Fantastic. Five miles away? You've got to be kidding me. Lester really likes to push my buttons. Why didn't he tell me that first? I would have decided to go right instead of left. Hey, buddy, can you get off the bike? Thanks, sorry. <laughs> gotta go. Wait, does this thing have guns? It's only got a water cannon? Bro, why aren't there rockets on this? That would be so much cooler. I still love it how these people genuinely think they can stop my vehicle. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have got to give up. Maybe I can just make the road slippery. That, that's that got to work, right? A slippy road is <laughs> not going to help them. Oh, I just flipped their car. I have never gone through a roadblock so smoothly. This is amazing. <laughs> Those guards at the museum aren't even going to know what's hit them. Uh-oh. Some smoke just came out of the back. I don't know if that's like a good sign or a bad sign or if it's meant to happen, but jeez. All right, we better be careful. This vehicle could actually be damaged. We're almost there, Franklin. Just keep your eyes peeled for Lester's safe house in 100 meters. Hold on. Wait, that's the only thing around. It's a barn. Lester, that's not going to save me. All right, I'm going in anyway. It says entrance. Uh, yeah, see you later, officers. Oh, my God. Bro, there's a bunker. <laughs> Whoa, this is crazy. Well, we lost the police, so, you know, it must have worked. Now, where is the big man, the one and only, the Lester Crest? You play snooker now? You listen to the radio? Bro, Lester is not this kind of person. Uh, are you sure this is even Lester we're working for? Speaking of which, there he is. The man, the myth, the legend. Yo, Lester, thanks for saving me. Hey, what's through this door, man? What have you got through... Ooh, this is kind of fancy. You got yourself a bathroom? Well, Lester actually washes. That's new. Whoa! Who's... What? Okay, Lester, you gotta do some explaining right now, buddy. You got a panther in here. Oh, hey, Trevor. How you doing? I'm doing good. Yeah, me too. Uh, so, thanks for the safe house and, you know, helping me get the vehicle. Now, can we go and rob the museum? Sure, take this. Ten thousand dollars. Hey, why do I need this money? Buy some guns, new clothes, and a new haircut. Dress up, you know, make sure you're not spotted. Oh, I suppose that does make sense. Come on, see, we got 10 grand to do whatever we can to change our appearance. We've been here before, best place to get some clothes on a budget. $10,000 might seem like a lot, but once we hit the ammunition store, we're gonna go through that very quickly. Now, let me see. I reckon something like this could look nice. This isn't exactly changing our appearance. Oh, here we go. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna go for uh, one of these. Ooh, they got hats as well. All right, let will go for, uh, ooh, hello, look at these, dude. Beautiful. 
of course, got to go over that one. How do we look? You know what? I don't think we need a haircut. What about you, T? Oh, we're gonna have to fix you up with something. Come on, let's go to the hair store. Good day to you, lovely lady. I need something for my best friend, Trevor. Let's see, what can we give him, eh? <laughs> oh, this is gonna be so much fun. I will make him bald if I need to. Hey, can I keep my glasses? I want to take them off, dude. All right, first of all, big old beard. We could always cut this off afterwards. It'll hide our appearance. You don't even look like the same person anymore, T. And if we do this, now you really gotta look different. We're literally different. Taking off patches of his hat. Oh my days. I've never done this haircut for you, Trev. I'm sorry. <laughs> this is crazy. All right, you know what? We're good to go. Thank you very much, man. What an odd combination, dude. It's like someone's just taking the razor around the entire side of his head. If, if the police come asking questions, don't talk to them. Give me a call or something, all right? <laughs> all right, Trev, we got $8,000. Let's spend it wisely at the ammunition. Now, remember, we don't want to go too big. We want to keep it nice and subtle. Get suppressors. Maybe a sniper if we can. If I can afford a minigun, though, I am so getting that. 11,000. Ah, oh, that sucks. What about a grenade? We could do grenade launcher, but that's so risky. Rocket launcher, now we're getting somewhere, but I'm pretty tempted to spend a little bit of money on one of these. Not that much ammo. Let's just... Let's fill it up a little bit, okay? We've got a little bit of ammo. Ah, oh, sniper rifles, $3,000? That's like more than half of my money. What can we do that's cheaper? What about... Hmm, okay, let's go for one of these. May as well get this just for a little bit of cash. Something I can use in the car. And uh, let's go for something which we can do close up with, like... Okay, we'll get that for now. <laughs> now I want to go over something small. 4,070. Not a stun gun. Come on. Give me a break, dude. Let's just go over the good old classic one of these. And lastly, I ain't forgotten about these. We're going to go over some nades. And that's 10 nades. All right, Trevor. I think we're pretty much sorted. Let's go rob the museum. It's time to do what we do best. Get in, T. Let's take him down. What, there's like 60 guards? Well, guess what? Two of us is all we need. We're steady on. We don't want to draw any eyes too early. We want to make sure we can slide in there and take them all down. Okay, that's where we got to go to. Up that ramp. Good evening, fellas. It seems your luck has run out. Because we've arrived to take everything you got. Let me insult. Oh my days, we just... No! Bro, I thought this was bulletproof! Hey, Lester, we died! What?! Are you... Idiot! I'm sorry, Lester! Lester? Lester? Oh, no, 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 I'm in prison! No, 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 come on, this isn't fair! I haven't got my phone? My guns? Oh, we're screwed! Hey, Trevor, are you in there? Yeah! Any idea how we're getting out? No! Is that, is that a no? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna take it as a no. Trevor doesn't seem too happy about this. Come on, this isn't cool. Get me out of here. We want to rob the best museum and not get stuck in jail for the rest of the video. How are we gonna do this, Franklin? Oh, you guys can break us out if you subscribe. Apparently, there's a way to break out of here. Please, I want to find out. Subscribe now. <laughs> oh, what is the way? Is it like running at the door head first? Bonk. I'll do it if I need to. It's still not telling me. Have you done it yet, guys? Wait, hold on. Kick the toilet. All right, I'll kick the toilet. Let, let's see what happens if we do that. Hey, yoink. Whoa, hey, hold on. You seen that? There's a pen. It just fell out of the toilet. I'm gonna scooby-doo my way out of this prison cell. Just gotta use the pen on the door. Do, 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 do. And wait, it works. It actually works. I'm out just like that. <laughs> All right, I'm getting out of here, dude. We gotta go. Wait, my guns. Trevor, the vehicle. Okay, we can't go yet. I gotta break Trevor out first. Hold on, okay, there's a police officer right there, and he's on his phone. All right, Trevor, we gotta be extra quiet now, okay? Ah. No, quiet, Trevor, quiet. Right, let's just quickly get you out of here, and... Good. Can you get through the gate now? Is that... Yes, we got it unlocked. Now, I gotta get my guns in the car, so... Get him! Ah, got him! Oh, he's still alive. Get him, get him, get him! Stop him from getting up. And... Ah, perfect. I don't know. He's still alive? Are you serious? Now are you dead? Thanks. Ah. All right. Do you have a gun or something I can borrow? Ah, perfect. He did. We got a little pistol. I, I know I said stay behind me, Trevor, but you don't need to stay that close. Can I just get out of the desk? Thanks. Now, <laughs> we're looking for the armory and preferably a garage where they're keeping our car. All right, there they are. A couple of officers. Anyone in here? No, we're good. We're good. That's empty. Wait, he's 
playing guitar? Okay, sorry for breaking up the party, fellas, but this day has just gotten a whole lot worse, so get away from me! Hey, Trevor, yeah, just stand there, man. <laughs> it's not like... Get out of my way, Trevor! Jeez, don't hit him! Dad, oh, my days, where are they coming from? Stay down, stay down, and you as well. Just get on the floor. Your guitar playing was amazing. Hey, 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 hey Trevor, help me, dude! Help do something! Oh, man... Maybe it's the haircut I gave him. Oh, hang on, there's someone in there. What's up, buddy? You should have kept the door open. You would have heard the noise and the commotion. <laughs> Can you just die, please? These officers are so hard to take out. All right, I need the guns. There's got to be something in the armory I can borrow. And the door's open. Oh, there is. All right, grab everything you can, Trevor. We're going to take this museum down. So the armory had a little bit of everything, and we have now taken a little bit of everything. I finally got my grenade launcher, and get this, they even have a widow maker. And a compact grenade launcher, a mini one, and the mini gun. We're robbing this museum. There's no way we're gonna fail. Hey, there's my right. And the engine's still on. They couldn't even fit it in their garage. All right, come on, T, get in. And this time, can you actually help me out when we do this heist? You know, there's gonna be a trillion dollars in there and everything. I have a different idea this time. Instead of driving this to them, we're gonna leave this vehicle around the corner and sneak in and take them by surprise. Watch and learn. This is how the professionals do it. Oh, no. No, they were expecting us. We've got three stars. They know we're up to trouble. I guess the vehicle gave us away. Hey, Trevor, did you take your phone? Hey, Franklin. Hello. Are you doing the heist? No, oh, great. Why would no one talk to me? I hate it when they ignore me. Man, okay, we can't even get through to Lester. I left mine at the station. All right, that's it. We're by ourselves, we're on our own. And we're not failing. Police are on their way. I can hear them in the distance. They're searching for us. They want us back in jail. All right, leave the right here, okay? We're gonna break it. Oh my days, they were expecting us, dude. They were expecting us. Okay, Trevor, your time to shine, buddy. We are surrounded. Jeez, we're gonna use a grenade on them. All right, uh, fire in the hole. <laughs> oh, that's gonna do some damage. And again, this way. Oh my days, if we don't die, that's gonna be a miracle. There's so many of them. Quick, get behind the RCV. Behind the RCV. They're even behind here. What? There's only one option left. We gotta use the minigun. The police have already arrived. We can do this. All right, just take out the whole squad. Trevor, you alive? Yes, he's still okay. <laughs> All right, you got us on the side. I'm gonna get the north. I think the passage is clear. Let's keep moving. That's most of them dealt with. Sorted. Perfect. Let's go, 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 go. It's a miracle I'm still alive. I must be on like one HP. Whoa, whoa, I can't afford to be shot again. I love how there's this lady just chilling on the wall. Hey, Scram, get out of here. You're not part of this. <laughs> Go, go, go! I got four stars, but we cleared the area. Yo, a helicopter crash. That's insane. Trevor, it's time to go. Let's go! Enter the museum. Oh my days, I'm in. This is crazy. All right, I am officially in the Museum of Los Santos. All of the special artifacts in this universe are gonna be inside. All right, open sesame. Bro, that's a dinosaur! Wait, hold on. There's someone down there. Get him. I'm not dying to like one or two people. No way. Right, what kind of dinosaur am I looking at? The Triceratops from 67 million years ago. Okay, that's awesome. That's insane. So you know I'm taking some of those bones with me, but I want to find the really expensive stuff. I'm sure some of that artwork's going to be a lot of money. And this is, well, wow, wait, when did this come around? This has got to be like a couple of million years old. Look at this thing. This this is so old. Okay, there's some crates on here. Why are there cloths? Okay, there's a bit of gold in the crates. Nice. And more gold over there. Perfect. That was a hundred million bucks just for two crates of gold. I wonder where that gold came from. It's got to be some sort of treasure. But how do I get upstairs? Oh, there's the staircase. All right, cool. We'll take the staircase in a second. But I uh, want to make sure I check every part of this. It looks like the museum isn't quite ready yet. There's lots of empty displays. This has got to be some sort of new feature or something. A room which we're not meant to be inside. They've even blocked off areas like this. But I want to see what's upstairs because apparently we got Egyptian history up here. <laughs> oh, let's go. <gasps> oh my days, it's gonna be worth so much money. Grab it, Frank, grab it. Okay, so two little statues cost another 200 million bucks. Oh, hold on, there's someone else here. Get him, sucker. No one stops me. I wonder what's under that cloth. Looks like some dude riding a horse. I don't think we can get that in the bag, annoyingly. And the stock room. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> Look at this. Those have got to be the biggest diamonds in the universe. How much is each diamond worth? Like, I'm just curious. Yeah, I don't really care about these paintings. I know they're expensive, but how much are the diamonds? 500 million a piece? Some more Egyptian art. Sorry, I may as well take that. I'm pretty sure those diamonds have got to be the most expensive feature. I mean, how much is this? Yeah, 10 million bucks. Okay, I don't really care about that stuff anymore. I want to find the big, big bucks, like the diamonds. Is there anything else I've missed out on? Like, ooh, hold on. Yeah, I'm getting Night of the Museum vibes. Is this some sort of talisman or something? <laughs> Yo, this is like solid gold. I wish I could read this, but I'm sure it'd say something cool. Uh, let me know in the comments if you know what it says. All right, let's get that in the bag and that thing as well. And may as well get that little piece as well. So what's through these doors at the back? Can I go through these? Ooh, I can. All right, I think I found like a secret area. The stock room. Okay, now we're talking. Look at this. So many boxes. Exhibit storage only. Hmm. I wonder what happened if I set fire to all of this. <laughs> we would make a lot of people very angry. Oh, hold on. This is the first Bugatti ever made. I recognize this. I've collected the car three times. And it's finally reappeared. It has been years since I've seen this car. Years. I'm not even kidding. This is almost 100 years old. It might not look it. Bugatti have made amazing cars since the dawn of time. But trust me, this comes from 1927. I'll let Trevor take the truck. I'm taking this. And we'll sneak off this way. That way the pool police won't see us. I just don't want to tote all this right. If I write this off, a lot of people are going to be angry with me. But luckily for us, I'm a professional driver. <laughs> yeah, and the police, they didn't even see me leave. Now there's only one thing left to do. I'm going to skip the whole Lester thing, you know, pretend I just lost my phone, which technically I did, and instead move into the most expensive house in the GTA universe. We are going to live like a king up here, Franklin. Like a king. Say hello to Franklin. Franklin's new house. Oh, Trevor, you had the same idea? All right, looks like we're sharing then. You get the artifacts out the back. I'm gonna park this up in my brand new garage. Check this place out. It's insane. Yep, we're gonna do just nicely down here, Franklin. This is an awesome house. With his own curly whirly staircase, a nice little tree in the middle. Yep, this is a place where dreams are made. Something's wrong. I'm sleeping on a bench. We have $20 to our name, and it's raining outside. And to make matters worse, I I have a raging headache. I'm freezing, I stink, and we don't look too good, Franklin. Let's get us back home. Jeez, what happened to you, Franklin? This isn't normal. Hey, scram. Oh, great. Now the police are here as well. Fine, fine. I'm leaving. I'm going. You really think I'm homeless? Come on, I got a house I live in. He's following me. Great. Yo, Franklin, what's your step, dude? Are you sure you're okay? What happens? This is really strange. I need to find some answers and figure out what happens exactly to us. Jeez, why can't we walk in a straight line? This is so weird. Oh, my days. First person, and this is what Franklin's seeing. Everything's spinning. Right, I'm calling a cab. May as well use what we have. I reckon that will get me home, but I, I don't have a phone. What? Where, what happened to your phone, Franklin? Oh, great. That's even stranger. Okay, okay. Hey, can you call me a cab or something? Come on, just get me out of here. You want me out of this park as much as I want to be out of here. Thanks. This isn't my house. Th are you kidding? Oh, come on. My house is up there. It's the worst taxi ride ever. Well, at least it's not raining and Franklin seems a little bit better at walking. Almost there, Franklin. Then I'll put you in the shower, get you washed up, maybe even make a hot chocolate and have a nice little snooze until the rest of the end of the day. Oh. Hey, what happened out here? There's like so much trash. What did you do? Oh, it stinks. Worse than you as well. Okay, I'm getting you inside. All right, let's get you clean. Oh my goodness. Who did this? My house is ruined. There's fire on the floor. Burger shop, water bottles, cans. There's flies on this as well. I, I can see them. I can hear them. This is freaking me out so much. Hey, wait, who are you? Yeah, get off my sofa. Come on, get out. Go, go, go. What? What happened to you, dude? Oh, this is such a mess. I'm gonna need to get a cleaner. We'll get our money back and hire a cleaner and figure something out. What's it look like downstairs? Is that normal? What? Hey, Lamar, what are you doing? You're sleeping on a lilo. I don't even have a lilo. Yo, great party, bro. Party? What? That we had a party? Uh, I guess that makes sense. I do have a really bad headache and the house is pretty trashed. So I had a party here then, yeah? Why did I have a party? We rarely do parties at this house. Bro, it was the best. Uh, we partied like never before. Oh, I wish I remembered some of this. Uh, what exactly happened? Don't you remember? Bro, you won so much money. <laughs> 
so much happen, bro. Well, I won money? What? Are you kidding me? How did I win this money? Lottery. Hey, go check the ticket. I think it's inside. Wait, I got a lot. Wait, hang on. Did I win the lottery? That doesn't make sense. I got like 20 bucks. Well, how much do we... Oh, zero bucks. Now, how did I win the lottery? Well, how much did I even win? Five million dollars? You're saying I, I won five million dollars. Wait, who's that at my door? All right, one second. I'm going to go check this out. Maybe they know where my money is. What happened to this money? No way did I use it on this party. That doesn't make sense. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. Jeez. <laughs> whoa, 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 hold on. Who are you guys? Mr. Clinton, is that you? Yes, Mr. Clinton. Uh, might be me. Why do you ask? We're very pleased with the quick sale of your house. Now, if you would kindly give us the keys. Whoa, 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 hold on. Wait, I didn't sell my house. What, what? Why do you think I did? You signed the paperwork last night. You said something about a Brady getting a new house. Anyway, our client wants to move in, so give us the keys. What is this guy on about? I signed some paperwork to give my house away? Oh, no. No, no, no. We paid a lot of money for it. Great house. How much did you pay? Two million dollars. You should have it by now. But where's this money gone? I supposedly had seven million and it's all gone? If you don't give the keys, we'll bring the police back with us. Oh, okay, 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 fine. Here's, let me just take a look at my pocket. Ah, uh, it's... Oh. Hold on, this isn't... Wait, this is a key to a Ferrari. Oh, that must be your car. You bought that last night, too. I have a Ferrari? Well, where's the... Fer okay, one second. Uh, yeah, here's the keys to the house, I suppose. I'm just gonna go and check my garage. <gasps> oh, my days! I got a Ferrari! Wow! I didn't even realize I had this car. Okay, this has kind of made things a little bit better. Um, these guys are moving in. If I don't let them have the house, they're gonna call the police. So I'm just gonna go and get chopped, get in the Ferrari, and... Find out what happened. Can you leave? Actually, no, this isn't even my house anymore. You can just stay. This is so weird. Whoa, Chop? Hey, has anyone seen my dog? Where is he? Jacuzzi? No. No. Where's... Hey, 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 has anyone seen my dog? Chop, what the... Oh, my days, guys. I think Chop's missing. Are you kidding me? Hey, Chop, are you down there? What the... Chop's missing. All right, maybe he's inside my house. Like, I didn't check my bedroom, I don't think. Has anyone seen... Hey, come on, move it. Get out. Go. Skedaddle. Are you serious? Okay, guys, I'm... I've lost Chop. I don't know where he is. Chop! Chop! Where are you, boy? I can't have gone too far. Hey, well done at the casino. Casino? What? Was I at the casino? Can you tell me everything you know, buddy? Because uh, I'm kind of clueless right now. Just seems like I had a crazy night and lost seven million dollars. Well, you won the lottery and sold the house. You wanted to double your money. You went straight to the casino. Don't you remember? Oh, yeah, of course. Of course I remember. So I must have sold everything and wanted to double my seven million dollars. Yep, that's right. You're crazy. Why would I do that? Seven million is plenty. All right, get in your car, Franklin. We're driving to the casino, and I, I don't even know where Chop is. Chop's just MIA. Missing. But at least I got this seriously nice car. This is beautiful. Wow. <laughs> Alright, this isn't too bad. I got a little bit of money in this car, which means I can sell it. Probably do my life back up. But why would I sell my own house? I've lost almost everything. Did I really go here last night? I've never really been inside this place. Too dangerous for me. Alright, better go and find some answers then. Hey, what's up, buddy? Whoa, look at you! Hey, yeah, yeah, look at me. What do you mean? You're still alive! Still alive? What are you talking about? You want big, man. Real big. You're a celebrity now. Wait, did I not lose my money? What? Oh my goodness, maybe my money's in here. Maybe I have like 50 million bucks. I'm looking for my money. You again. Oh, I remember you. Oh, oh, oh yeah? Yeah? What happened? You almost got me fired. What did I do exactly? You won a lot. Hey, can you play some more? Uh, how much exactly did I win? 20 million big ones. 20 million? <laughs> so, where's this money? I suppose it's in the penthouse. Gave you one last night. So I sold my house, I bought a car, I won the lottery, and now I have 20 million. That's amazing. Franklin, we haven't lost everything after all. Let's, uh, hey, which way is it? The penthouse. Um, hey, can you give me some directions or something? Yo, this is my penthouse? Nice. Whoa, great. No, it's all so trashed. Well, we definitely went through here, that's for sure. After seeing the state of my house. How do I go inside? That door's locked for some reason. Oh, here we go. Where would I put the money? Think, Franklin, think. We got 20 million dollars of chips. Where would I put the money? Okay, it's not in this room. Maybe there's someone in here who can help me or something. There's gotta be somebody. Hello? Jeez, it's empty. This is, this actually sucks. Wait, hold on. Bottle smash. You guys hear that? Someone's in here. Let's go and say hello to them and find out who it is. Oh, great. Finally. Fantastic. I found a bunch of people. 
So, what happened? Great. Alright. Don't say a word then. I'll find someone who does. You sleep on the floor. Jeez, Franklin. What kind of night did we have, man? This is not normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How are you doing, ladies? You want to scram? Get out. I'm looking for my money. Just a little bit of money. You know, just, just 20 million bucks. Anyone know where it is? Oh my days. I got this lounge as well? <laughs> this is the best house in the resort. Who's that? Trevor? Is that you? What happened, buddy? Come on, tell me. I need to know. What a night, Frank. Yeah, 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 yeah. Skip the night, skip the party, etc. Clearly, I don't remember any of this. So, where's my money? I want 20 mil. What? 20 mil? Whoa! Did you hear that? I think someone just broke in. I'm gonna go and check this out. Someone's at my door. If this is room service, I'm dead. They're gonna see the state of this and charge me so much money. Oh, yo, who are you guys? Are you kidding? I have no idea who they are and they shot me. Trevor, do something. Do something. I'm gonna die. Where's the money? What money? What are, what, 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 what are we talking about here? I, uh, listen, I blacked out yesterday. I don't quite know what. Where's the money? Jeez, okay. All right. Uh, listen, how much do I owe you guys? 10 million bucks. I, 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 I don't have the 10 million. What? I've got zero. What did I do? Look at this. Look at look at this photo. Oh boy. Wait, that's me. Uh, did I break into? Yes, you did. You broke into our store and stole a Ferrari. That must be the car outside. Why did I steal it? Not my problem. Ten million bucks. I, I don't have the money. If I did, I would pay you right now. I I'm pretty sure there's twenty million bucks around here. Do you fancy searching? You got three seconds, Zoe. Shoots. Oh, three seconds. Trevor, do something. Do something. Do. What? No, fine, fine. The car, the car, the car. You want the car back? It's downstairs outside the resort. You can take the car. Let's call it quits. Don't mess with us again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sure. I won't. I really definitely won't. Sheesh. They almost killed me. Well, now I don't have a car. I don't have any money. And Trevor, you could have done something at least. You could have done something. Hey, don't look at me. I, I don't have anything on me. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say. Listen, I'm gonna go and find my money, all right? I know it's here. 20 million bucks. Whoa, there's even a spa in this penthouse. Wow, this place really does have it all. But where would I have kept my money? 20 million big ones. I need to find it. Without it, I'm officially broke. Hey, what's in that room? I haven't checked that one yet. There's gotta be a vault in here. There's gotta be. I mean, a penthouse this big? It's gotta have a safe or something. Please, 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 please. Oh, man, just another empty room. What does this say? There's like a card on the table. Oh, Charlie Construction. Fleeker certifies. He's a builder. Why do I have a builder's business card? Did I spend my money? Okay, Franklin, we're gonna go and pay Charlie a little visit. So this is it, Charlie Construction. Now we just need to find Charlie, whoever he is. Uh, hey guys, uh, there's one of you called Charlie. I, I got a business card from someone last night. Frankie, good to see you. Oh, you too. So you must be Charlie? Yes, sir. Wow, you're a legend. W what exactly did I do to become a legend? So, what do you think? Go on, tell me. I know you like it. Like what? Uh, tell me, what, 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 is it, what is it? Wow, you don't remember? Wow, that party must have been crazy. Hey, thanks for the invite, by the way. Yeah, no problem. Now, can you tell me what exactly I don't remember? Because I'm, re I'm getting really confused right now. I'm missing 20 mil. I sold my house. Yeah, you sold it and got as much as you could so you could build a new one. Oh, build a new house? Yeah, you gave me every dollar you had. <laughs> And I promised I wouldn't let you down. I built a new house. Right, okay, so that explains where my money's gone and why I probably stole a car. Where's this house? Ha, ah, you're funny. Ah, come on, I'll take you. So I have a new house somewhere? I hope that one isn't trash too. Man, you wanted everything. I was so excited. The house is awesome. It's really good. Yeah, 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 great. I'll, I'll be the judge of that when I see it. I'm kind of worried right now. If that house looks anything like my penthouse and my actual place, that place is not gonna look very nice. You are gonna pay me for the time, right? Uh, 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 no. Yeah, I'm joking. Uh, I'm, I'm honestly joking. It's cool. Uh, so, so there's your house. What? That's my house? Oh, maybe my life has turned around a little bit. Hey, <laughs> how much do you reckon we would get if we sold this? 25, maybe 30 mil. I don't know. All of my money back. Fantastic. Amazing. Hold on. What's that? In the van. You see the van? Oh, my days. That's shop. I'm glad he's safe, but now the police are taking him away. Ah, uh, boss, why are we taking a dog? We hold the dog hostage and demand he hands himself in. Ah, uh, boss, can we do that? No, we're not allowed to. Don't listen to the boss. Listen to me, men. This house cannot go back to Franklin. 
I repeat, cannot! Who's Franklin? Ah, this guy. Went to a party last night with him. Great, so they're taking the house away, they're taking Chop away, and they're not gonna give him back until I hand myself in. If only I had something to use, I would get Chop back like that. Maybe I can sneak inside and find some clues. Clearly this is my house. I got this built, I sold everything to do it, I paid everything for this place. And if I can just find a way to sneak in without being spotted, I might have a little bit of money inside. Or maybe a gun, or just something I can use. On them. Just don't get caught, Franklin. Oh, phew, there's no one around here. Garden is empty. What about inside? Looks empty as well. Yes, no officers. Oh, wait, hold on. This is my phone. Oh, amazing. Come back to Frankie. Boy, am I glad to have this back. Whoa. But hold on. Wait, are you seeing this? I got like 11 missed calls from Lester. What does he even want? Where have you been? Sorry, I've been occupied. What's up? The planet's set. Come on, meet me. Okay, okay, I'm coming. Jeez, what in the world? Hey, yo, I came as fast as you could. What are you doing here? This is Simeon's store. We're robbing the store, Frank. We're robbing the store. Uh, are, you, are you sure about this? What has he got? Oh, I don't know. $50 million of cars. We break in, take him out, take the cars. We split the money. All right, okay. I'm in, Lester. I'm in, but I haven't got a gun. Have you, have you got something I can borrow? Oh, you rookie. Better use your fist, okay? I'm not giving you one. All right, okay. Well, I'll just... Uh, I'm on you. All right, you ready? Three. Two, one. What kind of crazy deal did I sign up for with Lester? Follow me, come on. Yeah, I'm following, I'm following. Yeah, coast is clear. Now let's get the car. All right. Wow. <laughs> you really weren't kidding, Lester. Come on, let's get moving. Ow, oh, what the? Oh, jeez. Oh, Lester, are you okay? Yo, someone's here. Simeon, is that you? Simeon, Simeon. It's, it's only me. I'm so worried. Okay, here goes nothing. Uh, Simeon, it, uh, oh boy, please don't shoot. Thanks for the heads up. I was prepared. Wait, I gave you the heads up? Oh, great. You backstabbed me. Lester, aren't you supposed to be dead? You told me Lester's plan, so I sabotage plan. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess even Franklin, when he's partying, doesn't trust Lester. <laughs> uh, don't mention it, Simeon. Here, yeah, take 20 bucks. Uh, gratitude, you know? Oh, great. I got $20. So you got $50 million of cars, and you're only going to give me 20 I told you, you should have stolen them. Shut up, Lester. Listen, Simeon's my friend. We go back a long way. I have your car, by the way. You seem to leave it here overnight. Oh, that would make sense. I actually don't know where Franklin's car is. Yeah, whatever. Go get your car, and uh, I'll clean up the mess. Yeah, yeah, cool. All right, thanks, Simeon. So apparently I just backstabbed Lester. <laughs> That's great. I did a plan with him and then told Simeon about the plan. But where's my car? There's my car. Oh, I've missed you. Okay, that's great. I got 20 bucks and the car. Now we're back to having something after losing everything. Thanks, Simeon. You're the best. It's my actual car. There's my number plates. Hey, what's that banging? You guys hear that? I think there's something coming from the boots. Oh, oh my days. Wait, who are you? What the? Yo, there's someone in my car. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, I'm going in alleyway. Just chill with me for one second. Someone's in the back of my car. Car. And there's banging happening in the boot. Great. All right. I need to go somewhere quiet. Dude, just bear with me. Oh, sorry, buddy. Sorry. I just gotta be careful with my driving. Who's in the trunk of this car? Oh, there's gotta be a car park or something. What about? Oh, okay. Sorry. Sorry. Jeez, I gotta be careful with the braking and the crashing. Here we go. Car park here. I'll just pull up in this car park and find out exactly who's in the back seat and who's in the trunk. Jeez. Oh, my. Oh, come on, dude. Someone drove in. I need to find somewhere even more secret than this. Alright, this ought to work. It's an alleyway. Perfect. No one's looking. Who's in the back of my ca- Ow, ow. Franklin, stand up, buddy. Who- Michael? What? Booyah! I didn't think you would do it, but, 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 but you did it! Yeah! What exactly did I do? Uh, go find out. <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna stay behind, though. Okay, it can't be that bad. Whatever it is, it can't be that bad. Oh, it's bad. <laughs> uh, you might want to put a mask on. Have you got a mask? Can I use something? Uh, no. Uh, uh, all right, great. No mask. Great. Let's open this up then. Have you got a gun? No. Okay. All right. Let's open the trunk. Oh, here we go. He's gonna do it. Oh, great. It's a police officer. Uh, hey, hey, man. So, uh, what do we do? You. I, I, I just came to tell you to be quiet. Let me go. I got a wife and kids. Okay, listen to me. I, I don't want you in the back of my trunk any more than you want to be in the back of the trunk. Can I trust you not to say anything? I, pr I promise. I won't say a thing. I promise. Sergeant, we got the dog. Have you got eyes on the suspect? Uh, uh, oh. Oh, no. You've been on the radio the whole time? That's why they were at my house, and that's why they took job. I, why did I, why did I take the police officer, Michael? You got a noise complaint. 
he came over and I, I told him you should do something about it and <laughs> you did. <laughs> oh my goodness. I put him in the back of my car and left it at Simeon's. Uh, can I get out? My knee's hurting a little bit. Hey, I'll tell you to get out when I want you to get out. Give me your uniform. How do we look, Mike? Ah, uh, you look good. So you got to break in or something? Yeah, something like that. You just uh, stay with my car and make sure that officer doesn't go anywhere. Now I'm dressed as a police officer. I reckon we can walk straight inside, grab chop and leave. And then go back to my house and live happily ever after. <laughs> Alright, we can do this. I'm a police officer, remember? We got a uniform. They won't even bat an eye towards us. Could really do with a hat though. Uh, hey, I'm looking for the dog. The one you just took away. Okay, this did not exactly go to plan. Um, so... Do you want to use the tough guy? Is it you? Or is it you? Ah, oh, great. I'm going to jail. Oh, look, it's Chop. Yes, I'm in a cell with him. Oh, boy, I'm so glad you're okay. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Yeah, you're a good boy. We're getting out of here. Uh, don't worry, just give us some time. Uh, do, do you want some water from the toilets? There we go. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, hey, officers. So, how are we going to straighten this out? I don't know. You tell us where our guy is, and we might let you go. Yeah, I don't think you're going to do that, because I saw you repossess my house. Do I get that back too? Uh, yeah, sure. Sure thing. Oh, uh, well, we didn't say anything about giving the house back. I didn't say anything about you talking either. Yeah, so I'm not gonna get my house back. Is there anything else I can do, like, give you some money or... You're broke. Face it. Yep, I am. Basically lost everything. Uh, so I'll give you your guy back if you give me everything back. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. I got a this uniform had a gun in it. Oh, that's good. That's good. I didn't know that. <laughs> Chop, looks like we're getting out of here after all. All right, so uh, listen, I'm going to give you one last chance. Let me out of here. I give you a guy who call it quits. I'll get my house back another way. No. All right, well, in that case, looks like you're both dead. Bop, 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 bop. Oh, this guy's still alive, and he's shooting me, dude. All right, okay. Uh, uh, no, no, you're going to die. Uh, uh, uh. Do you want to die as well, buddy? All right, you got to put that gun down. Too late. You're dead, too. All right, come on, Chop. We're moving. Uh, leave the toilet. You don't need any more water. It's, it's technically not very healthy. So, news just in. I've got Chop back. I'm still broke. Apart from the $20 Simeon gave me. And I escaped the police station. That was easy peasy lemon squeezy. And now I've got back Chop. I think it's about time we take our house back, too. Uh, Chop, you're too slow. <laughs> Don't worry, I got you, buddy. We'll open this gate up. Hey, where's my house? Where, where's it gone? It was there a second ago. What are those people doing? Oh, hold on. There's a dump truck. What does this say? Repossessed? Demolition? They demolished my house? They can't do that, can they? It was right here. This is where it was. It's gone. No, no, no. Now I have lost everything. Wait, the bank's calling me. Hello? Mr. Clinton, is that you? Yes. It's it's me, Mr. Clinton. W how can I help you? We need to talk. Is it good news or bad news? Uh, both. Let's meet at the bank. Okay, I'm on my way. Right, they don't even tell me if it's good or bad. Please tell me I don't owe the bank any money now. I, I can't afford that. I don't, I don't have any energy left. And the FIB are here. Mm, they don't recognize me, though. Yes. All right, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Now, what exactly do they want to talk about, please? Please be good. Please be good. Oh, great. Now there's a queue of people. Hey, Mr. Clinton. Uh, come around this way. Oh, great. Okay, I get to skip the queue. Uh, thanks, guys. Thanks, I guess. All right, I got a pistol just in case. Don't really want to get into any bad trouble. Look at that guy. He's going to take me out if I try any funny business. Ooh, okay. So you wanted to talk? Yes, uh, take a seat. Listen, mister, you're really freaking me out. Can you please tell me what this is about? Somebody made a large deposit in your name. Oh, yeah, I guess that's the lottery I won. And the money I doubled at the Diamond Resort. Uh, does that explain it? I need some proof of funds. Oh, yeah, of course. Uh, here's the lottery ticket. Is that enough? That'll do. Here's your bank card. Enjoy. I got a... Wait, I got a card? Have I, have I just got all my money back? I've just been given... A bank card for the first time. And he told me there was a lot of money put in that account. Okay, now I'm excited. I want to see how much. Okay, all the money came in one hour ago. Seven million dollars was withdrawn. Seven million. You can see all my crazy spending the night before. I was filming an hour ago. I wasn't... Wait, hold on, hold on. I need to find some answers. Who just took seven million dollars from my bank? I've just been given the card. I couldn't have done that. Hey, man, did someone else come in here and pretend to be me or something? Because there's seven million dollars missing from my account. That must be your brother. He came in an hour ago and I gave some ID. His, his name was Lamar. Oh, my days. Lamar. He took my money. Right, that's it. Thanks, man. You've done great. Next time, don't give any money to anyone who isn't me. Lamar's not my brother. You better be in. 
He better be in. Come on, Denise. Bring him out. Bring him out, Denise. The right, that's it. I'm going in myself. Give me my money back. I'm not gonna ask twice, Lamar. Come on, get out. Where is it, dude? Lamar? Are you in? Oh, Denise, where's Lamar? He went to the airport. Get out. Oh, jeez. He went to the airport? Lamar's leaving. He he's trying to leave. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. I will drive through anything to get my money back. He doesn't just get to take $7 million and leave. I gotta stop him. I gotta stop him. I gotta stop him. That's him. That's him. Hey, Lamar, give me my money now. Screw you. Oh, yeah, run away. Call the police. Tell them I'm the bad guy. Jeez, he just got hit by a car. Lamar's the guy who stole my money. I give it back. I'm taking that bag. It wasn't your money to take, Lamar. It was mine. Thanks for the seven mil. Hey, taxi, can you get me out of here, please? Hey, where are you going? Don't drive away from me. Come on, I'm, I'm perfectly safe. Just get me out of the airport. Uh, I don't have anywhere to live. Take me to the penthouse. You again. Are you ready to win some more? I don't know who you think I am. Listen, I just got my life back together. I lost everything and I got my seven mil. Oh, that's a shame. I was having so much fun. Yeah, well, I just gotta stay here for a little bit to figure my life out, alright? So, um, yeah, just, just send me up to my room. Oh, jeez. I forgot how much of a mess this is. Uh, why are you still here? Oh, it's you. From the floor downstairs. He's back. Oh, yeah. Want some champagne? No, no, honestly, I, I really, I really shouldn't have any. I, I need to get my life back together again. Oh, uh, go on. Just one cup. Uh, I guess one won't hurt. No, 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 no. Franklin, Franklin. Oh, great. We're gonna lose everything again. I knew it! Someone's at my door. If that's Simeon telling me to drive another car, this yoga is gonna be a waste of time. Let's go and check out what's at the door. Whoa! Whoa! Hold up! Hang on a minute, guys! Big mistake! This is the wrong house! <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Yes, my name is Franklin Clinton. I'm in my boxes, guys. Come on. Can I go and get changed for a second? No. Okay, okay, okay. So, oh, jeez. I'm a little bit scared now, guys. Was I in North Yankton? You know what? I conveniently can't remember. Was I in North Yankton? The bank was robbed for the second time. And you think it was me. No, there's two guards. Two guards. All right, they're both down. Let's go, 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 go. $1.3 million in the bag. Oh, my days. No, there's police officers at my kitchen door. Uh, <laughs> No, I'm not letting you in. Give me one second. I just gotta get changed. Jeez, guys, I don't know what to do. There's police officers outside ready to literally take- There's someone on my balcony as well. They're ready to take me in. How did they find out it was me? Yes, there's no police officers down here. All right, quick. All oh, my days. No police officers are coming to my bedroom. <laughs> I'm not stopping. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> this is terrifying. I did not want to go to jail today. Come on, Franklin, jump. Get over the hedge and get out of here, dude. Right, they've literally sent the entire of Los Santos on me. Quick, Franklin. Oh, my days. Come on. No, no. <laughs> You've got me. You've got me. I'm in. I'm really sorry, guys. I... My days. I thought we could have escaped, you know. I really thought we... Nah, to be honest, there was no chance we were escaping that. Now we're going to jail. We're literally going to jail. I wish I could change this, guys. It's gonna be a long day. You know what, guys? It's been a while since I've seen this place. I feel quite proud. <laughs> <laughs> We've gone quite a few weeks without- Oh my days, he's eager to get me inside. Hey everyone, I don't even recognize that guard. It's been so long since I've been in here, dude. The ways we've escaped, the opportunities we've had, the tunnels we've dug. Oh, it's been a ride. Yes, I'm getting my uniform on, I'm going in. No need to watch me. I'm going in, see? <laughs> Whoa, whoa, hey, buddy. Hey, hey, hey. Look, I was just, I literally just entered the prison. Okay, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta go somewhere else, guys. What? What are you talking about? I gotta go somewhere else. Where are they taking me? Jeez, I'm not even allowed to talk to him. This is strict. So that's where we dug a tunnel previously through that door. Yeah, we're not going into that cell. Maybe this is because we've escaped too many times that they're putting us somewhere else. I'm really nervous. <laughs> where are we going to? Are we going in there? Where's there? Bolingbroke Penitentiary. Are you serious? We gotta go through there. This is like the back entrance to the prison. Oh my days, guys. We're going into an area I've never been in before. Block number three. Hey, 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 hang on a minute. I don't want to go down there. You're tell- I gotta go down there. They don't want me to escape. I don't think we're ever gonna escape. That's a big camera. That is a big camera, guys. Jeez. Yeah, even Franklin's head's beginning to hurt. Press to exit. Oh, could you imagine if- I No, I'm not trying it, guys. Let's go down. Oh my days. It's so long. This goes down so far. All right, let's do this. We're told to go down here, so that's what we're doing. I don't think he's gonna follow me, dude. Oh my days, there is literally a stain on the wall. Where is this gonna take me to? Like, we're going underground. No, 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on a minute, Franklin. No need to get smart with me. Where are we going to, dude? All right, through this door, I suppose. Guys, we're in an underground prison. Oh, geez. They must have built this right underground. Which cell is mine? I don't know. Can you please tell me where my cell is? So when are we allowed out of this cell? This is so new to me. You're underground and maximum security, and I'm allowed out for one hour a day. How am I supposed to escape from this? Look at these beds. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There's four of us. Wow, this is a packed cell. All right, thanks for answering my questions, I suppose. They're gonna bring me food. I can't even get food myself. Wow, this is gonna be tricky. I'm locked in an underground prison. Hi, my name's Franklin. What's your name? Robert. Good to meet you, Robert. What about him? Oh, he doesn't talk. N you don't know his name either. And that guy? That guy's called Tommy. All right, cool. Tommy and Robert. Nice. Good to meet you both. So, which bed is mine? That one up there. Nice. Nice. I would say we got one of the best beds, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, this is really strange, but I'm gonna go and get some sleep. I just realized, guys, I'm down here because I've escaped the prison like a million times over. These guys must be down here because they've done something really bad. I wanna get out of here as fast as I can. We need to think of some way out of here, dude. Plan number one, just thought of it now. Probably not the best one, but it could work. We go outside, take out one of the guards, take what they're using, and then use it to escape out the prison. We hold up everyone else and be like, let me out of the prison or say hello to my little friend. I mean, that's kind of like the going out in style plan, but to be honest, the chances of us actually getting out of the prison are very slim. Plan number two. I haven't thought of that yet, guys, but it has something to do with finding a way out of our cell. Like, there's just a random hole in the wall over there. Like, I don't know what's through there. If we find out more information about this room, we might be able to tunnel out and find a really easy way out of here. It might not look that easy right now, but I have a feeling there's a few weak spots. Oh, lunchtime! Hey, no need to be that serious about it. No one's gonna run out that door. Oh, that looks so good. At least the food down here is quite nice. Mm, mm, mm. Baguette and beans. Oh, that's such a good combination. Just drizzle the beans on top. Eat the baguette. Lovely. Absolutely lovely. The food down here is fantastic. And everyone seems on high alert. I'm guessing it's because we got food. I'm going to totally dig out this place with that straw, aren't I? Jeez, some people, guys. Some people. But that's given me an idea. Next time they feed us, check this out, guys. Have you seen that office room over there? Yeah, there's some guards working in there. Can you see them? When they're feeding us again, I'm going to take out the guards and make a run for the office. We only have like five seconds before we're surrounded again and sent back in the cell, but maybe there's some information in there which would be quite useful to us. I don't know, guys. I'm looking for literally anything. Codes, passwords. Wait, they want to collect the trays? But he's not even done with... I got my drink to finish, dude. He's not even done with... He didn't even eat anything. He's still asleep. Wait, what's everyone doing now? Are you just starving yourself? Oh, my days. Have you seen the toilet? Yes, I'm... I bring the trays. Have you seen the toilet? Oh, my days. Right, you know what? This is it. He told me when he comes back, I better have the trays ready. Hey, mister, look. I got your trays. They're right here. You want them? Come and get them. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm not gonna try anything funny. Whoopsie! <laughs> Oh my days. Right, we haven't got long until he wakes up. Quick, guys, guys, everyone on the ground. This is a hold up. Everyone on the ground, don't try anything funny, okay? I'm looking for information which might help me. Don't even think about calling in for backup. Oh, you had to set the alarms off, didn't you? Ooh, blueprints. Hello. Okay, I gotta take a look at these. Weak spots. Guys, check this out. There's a weak spot in my cell right above my... Oh my days. Right above my bed. There's like a thin layer of bricks and then we're into some pipeline. Uh oh, okay, right. I'm gonna pretend I didn't see that. Oh no, backup's arrived. Yeah, I'm standing down. I'll stand down. Oh my days. <laughs> They're not messing about. Ooh, jeez. Okay, put it down. Put it down, Franklin. We're, okay, get back into the cell. I'm going in. I'm going in. Jeez. What did you do to them? They literally did nothing. They took them both out because they were outside the cell. I wonder where they're gonna end up next. Probably not in this one then. Oh, that's so annoying. At least we get more space to ourselves though. You can put all of that down now, guys. I'm not going anywhere. Look, the door's locked. I'm in here. They're terrifying. I'm gonna go to bed. Well, it's awfully quiet now, guys. But it wasn't done for nothing. I am so glad I did what I did because <laughs> right behind this wall is a system of pipes and tubes and so many different things which is gonna get us out of here, guys. Oh my days. I can't wait to escape. So let's look around the cell at things we can use to start picking at the wall. Hmm. Have you got a pen? Oh, I forgot. You don't talk. I wonder what this guy is in for. Do you reckon he's nice or do you reckon he's bad? He's been looking at that book since I've got here. I really don't know what to make of him. Oh, hello. Okay, we could use a bit of the ladder. Maybe I could snap a bit off that. I'm not using anything on the toilet, although what is that on top? No, I'm not using that. I'm not using the tap. That's too suspicious. 
I might use what's underneath the bed. Anything? Nothing underneath the bed. Yeah, I'm gonna use a piece of the ladder, guys. Yes, guys. Between me and you, it's working. I've taken out a brick and I can see emptiness behind it. There is definitely a system of tunnels behind this wall. Careful now. Hang on. I need to show you what else we're doing. <laughs> to cover this up, we flip the bed around and check this out. Bam. No raised eyebrows. You know, this pillow covers everything up. Fantastic, guys. No one is gonna suspect a thing. Wait. Who? Oh, no. Someone caught on. Oh, it's you asking me what I'm doing. Don't just... Ah, man, I thought you were a god. <laughs> what am I doing? Good question. I'm escaping. Do you want to join me? Yeah, he's in. Nice. We got an escape, buddy. Wait, if we both escape, they're going to know something's wrong because there's going to be no one in the cell. We got to move quickly. I ain't slowing down for you, okay? I'm running out of here, and if you choose to follow, that's up to you, but I am not saving you. Come on. Almost just push the brick forward. Yes! Guys, you probably can't see. I just released the final brick. We can escape. What? They're inspecting the cell? Oh, jeez. Quick, put the bricks back. Franklin, put the bricks back. Yes, I put the bricks back. Now stop talking about it before he catches on. All he has to do is push those bricks and they come out, guys. And it's quite obvious. Oh, my days. He's gonna know. Guys, I can literally... Can you see where it's damaged? Can you see? He's gonna know it's that a mile away. I've noticed it a mile away. Please don't don't think anything. Wait, what? Oh my God. Guys, we've been given some time. He doesn't want to climb the ladder in this state. He's worried the ladder's going to break and he's going to hurt himself. Okay, he's going to be back in five minutes with a new ladder so we can check out up there. We got to escape now. Come on, man. You coming with me or what? Yeah, he's coming. All right, let's go. Squeeze. Squeeze through. Almost. Yes, we're in. Hey, do you recognize this place? No idea. Me neither. We've only got five minutes though before they catch on. Let's get out of here, dude. Is this even the right way? I mean, that looks like a a dead end to me. Why aren't you following me? He doesn't trust the plan. This is the only plan. It Do you want to escape or what? I'm not wasting my time with him. I'm going. I'm getting out of here. If he wants to escape, he can. If you want to go back to your cell, play it safe. That's fine. But I'm getting out of here, dude. Please take us to freedom. Please. Come on. And what about through there? It's just a fan. It's not even working. This Oh, no. He's not following me. He's disappeared. He's left. Wait, do you hear that? Stop. I can hear footsteps. I can hear multiple footsteps echoing down. And a siren. And a skull. Oh, my days, guys. Guys, guys. They're chasing me down here. They found this. They know I've escaped. They Come on, come on, run, run. This better lead somewhere. It better go some. Oh my days. It goes even further down. I'm literally being chased down here, guys. Come on, come on, Franklin. Get out of here. Go, go, go. Please take me somewhere. Yes, a door. Go through the door. Oh, it stinks so much. I'm surrounded by dirt. Ladder, ladder, ladder. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry about the stinking part, Franklin. Just get up here. Go. I think we're coming back up to ground level. We're literally climbing up through the ground. If this takes me back to the prison, I am going to be furious, you know. Come on, come on. All right, please don't put me back in the prison. Yes, we're out, guys. But I've got six stars. Are you? Oh, jeez. All right, in the Lamo, in the Lamo. Go, 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 go. Have they found me? I don't see them yet. There's some helicopter. Oh my days! They're searching sandy shores, and there's some helicopters coming to the Lamo. Quick, underwater. Ooh, they're shooting into the. Oh my days! Evade them! Evade them! Evade them! I think they can see me, guys. Ah, oh, this is so tense. Wait. Oh, my days. I know somewhere. Just as I thought. There's always a boat here. Finally. And it's this one. It's a fast one. It's not a yacht. Hey, guys. i will just be taking this. Thank you. Oh, my days. They got jets on me. Can you see the shadow? They literally sent jets on me, guys. All right. Sail away. Sail away as if nothing has ever happened. We did not escape prison. We did not go underground. It was a pretty epic escape, to be honest. Come on. Get out of here. Go, go, go. Yes. I think it's working. All right. Sail away. Yes. We lost the six stars. <laughs> How we've lost the six stars. I have no idea. They must have mistaken me for a civilian or something. I'm literally wearing a prison outfit. I'm going to an island and we're staying there for a while. At least until things calm down, I'm going to fish for my food and I'll figure something out for water. There's even a cabin on this island. This was meant to be. Now let's just keep our fingers crossed. No one's here. <laughs> I'll try and be friends with them. Yeah, I'll try. Yeah, that looks docked up to me. Let's go and check out our new neighbor. Please tell me it's abandoned. Come on. Oh, no, there's people here. Looks like we got a couple on the date or something. Well, I'm moving in. <laughs> If any of you try and tell anyone anything that I'm here, then you're not leaving this island. I'm gonna lie low here for a while. We just escaped six stars in GTA 5, and we escaped a maximum security underground prison via tunnels. Hidden around the ocean of GTA 5 are the smallest to the biggest sea monsters we've ever seen. And make no mistake, the smallest ones are just as dangerous as the biggest ones. In fact, a thousand people were eaten alive this morning, and there was nothing left of them, including their boats. The police, the military, and 
and the Coast Guard all ran away. And if anyone's crazy enough to deal with these monsters, they get paid $5 million for each monster they catch. Which sounds pretty amazing to me because I have no money. And if we make $35 million, then I can buy this super secret exclusive rare car in GTA 5. Now the first sea monster isn't too far away. We're hunting down the smallest one, but like I said, they're just as dangerous as the biggest. And I'm pretty sure that this one is one of the most dangerous ones. It devoured three boats and 103 people just today. You wouldn't think it could do that when the size of this monster is, what, like this big? But I can see it on my map. We're not too far away. Oh my days, there's two of them. I didn't think there were two. I wouldn't want to be on that yacht. And every time this beeper goes faster, it means we're closer to the monster. I can literally see it on my radar. <laughs> oh no, this is going to be terrifying. Just a little bit closer. We must be 10, 20 feet away. Ooh, just a few more seconds. Wait, my engine. No, the engine cut out. No, no, guys. It you need to fix this. It says subscribe to put the engine back on. Please subscribe to my channel. Let's get the engine working. The monster is below my boat. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes. Oh, thank you so much. All right, the engine's working. I can't escape, but the monster is circling my boat. I can see it on my map. It's literally right behind me, and I can't even see it. You know what's annoying about being the smallest monster is that they're so well hidden. Can I look under the water? Ooh, come on. There's got to be something on the surface. Literally nothing. No fin. Not even a splash. Right, that's it. I'm going to go and take a look at myself. Really? You're kidding? Literally underneath my boat. This is kind of- Oh, my days! It's it's smashing into the boat. I can hear it! Stop it. Oh, my goodness. This boat is tilting so much. <laughs> right, whatever you do, don't go into the ocean. I'm going to find this sea monster fish thing, and we're going to take him out. Oh, come on. Come on, dude. Why is it so hard to find him? Get out from under the boat. Uh, don't you dare. Oh, jeez. This is terrifying. <laughs> I genuinely think it's gonna flip this boat. Right, that's it. I'm gonna throw down a grenade. All right, if this doesn't get the monster, I don't know what will. Hey, heads up. Come on. Seriously, then do anything? All right, three, two, one. Let go, let go, let go. Oh, this is terrifying. Why isn't it killing the monster? All right, that, here we go. Is nothing. I'm just gonna throw it literally right underneath my boat. Go! Oh, this monster's good. It's so good. Come on, one. Two, three, four, boom! I, I think I gotta go in there, which I really don't want to do. It's giving me no choice, though. I don't like this. I should have bought a submarine. That would have made things way easier. Here goes nothing. <sighs> Hello, fishy, fishy. Where, where is it gone? Okay, this is kind of creepy. I don't see anything under the boat. Maybe if I just take a little look around. It was right under here, dude. It was literally here. Maybe the sea monster moved on. Let me take a look. Where are we looking now? Okay, it's right over there. It, it's not too far from us. Let's go and pay a little visit. See if we can do something with our little knife. <laughs> this is so scary. This monster is vicious, by the way. You do not want to come head to head with a sea monster like this. Wait, there it is. Oh, my days. No, that's terrifying. Get away from me. Get away from me. I'm not afraid to use my knife. I will use it. Uh, come on, get it, Franklin. This is a little piranha. It's the smallest sea monster in GTA 5. If that grabs my toe, I've lost it. I'm not even kidding. These things can devour people in, like, seconds. Hey, get away from underneath me, dude. Quick, go underneath the piranha. If I can get underneath it, then we got a really good advantage. Right, where have you gone? Oh, no, I've lost it. Oh, no. No, there you are. Get him. <laughs> This is so scary. Oh, my days, those teeth are sharp. Oh, I've got you now, little fish. Look who's laughing now, eh? We got the piranha, the smallest sea monster in GTA 5. <laughs> you look terrifying. Those teeth are so sharp. Razor thin. Now, this is the smallest sea monster. There's still plenty of the sea monsters in the ocean, so I wouldn't go rushing into the water yet. But I just got my first $5 million, and I want to make more money than that. So let's go and grab the next monster. Monster. All right, buddy, you're coming with me. Unlike the piranha, only one of the next sea monster actually exists in the ocean. We picked up some radio frequencies of it the other day, and it's at the other side of the map, and some of you guys might have even encountered it too. But lately, it's decided to team up with the other monsters and take down boats and even people. So there's only one thing left to do, drive it to extinction. We've arrived just off the coast of Polizio Bay, and it doesn't seem like this monster is on my radar, and I'm not picking up anything on the sonar either. We're gonna have to really work hard to find this monster, but luckily for us, it's not the size of a fish. This one is much bigger. In fact, it wouldn't surprise me if it was as big as this boat. Let me check again, anything? Oh, 
Hold on, we're picking up some more, more frequencies. You hearing that, guys? It's getting faster and faster. It's getting much faster. We must be getting closer. But where is it? Wait, it's getting really fast now. I think we're right above the monster. Okay, let's go and take a little look, shall we? What are we dealing with? Now, this one's a bit slower, so I, I feel a bit more confident just diving into the water and taking a... Whoa, oh, that's a pir there's another piranha. Are you serious? Right, no, I'm not dealing with you. <laughs> I already got one of you. I don't care about driving you guys out of this ocean. Are you kidding me? There's more piranhas? I, I didn't sign up to this. Right, that must be what the sonar was picking up then. Okay, I'm getting out of here. I'm finding the actual sea monster. You know the one which we're meant to actually find? Jeez, I don't get paid millions of dollars for taking all the sea monsters out. Just one of each. I'll need a miracle to get those piranhas out of here. There must be hundreds if not thousands of them. It's getting choppier out here. I hope there isn't gonna be a storm. I don't think this boat can handle one of them. Are you hearing that? It's getting faster. It's getting, it's getting faster. And this looks like the spot. All right, put the anchor down. All right, let's just go. Let's go and check it out. Come on, get off the boat, Frank. You know the drill. We got another monster to find. Whew, what have we got? Ooh, okay, no piranhas. Do you hear that? That sounds like a whale. And it's right around us. Why can't I see it? Where is it? Where's the whale? There you are! You're right there! And you are massive! <laughs> and there's another piranha. Fantastic, right? I'm gonna leave the piranhas do its thing. Please don't eat me. I just wanna get this wet where the whale go. Oh no, are you serious? Did you eat the whale? The whale's vanished. That's it. I gotta get back to my boat and find it again. I literally... Oh, there you are! There you are! Amazing! I gotta do this quickly because there is a piranha eyeing me up for literally lunch. All right, come on, whale. I'm really sorry about this. Wait, have I got him? Have I got him? Yes, I've got him! That's the second sea monster! Go, go, go! And wait, the piranha just drags him away! <laughs> <laughs> wow! Well, at least I got video footage of me taking out the sea monster. That's the second one dealt with, and it was much bigger than that piranha. And now we're on a cool 10 million dollars. But we better be careful now, Franklin, because the next sea monsters, believe me, are not anything to laugh at. So we're gonna need more than just a knife. We're gonna need one of these. The next animal we're looking for lives in this cove. And believe it or not, it is bigger than the whale that we just slayed. And it's not gonna go down as easily. I'm picking it up on my sonar system, and it's not going to be too far now. I mean, this isn't exactly a deep area. We've got to be it. This has to be it. Okay, I'm going to take a little look. Maybe I can see this creature from the surface. Got to be careful it doesn't tip the boat. I've got my scuba diver gear suit on as well, just in case. You never know. I mean, if this flips the boat, then we could be screwed. I don't see it above water. I'm going to have to go in myself, and I don't want to do that. All right, let's just give it a go. Come on, if we see anything, Franklin, anything at all? Looks pretty empty to me. I don't see any sea monster. Maybe it swam away. Maybe we scared the monster. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to take a little look under this cove. I mean, if I was a sea monster, I would hide under here. Do you see anything, Franklin? There's nothing down here. I don't see the monster. All right, what about the other side of this? Anything? What about behind us? No. It's got to be around here. It can't be far from us. From us. Oh, boy. I think that was the monster. Right, get back to the boat, get back to the boat, get back to the boat. I'm gonna put down a few distractions, try and lure it over here. I got a good idea on what to do. If there's one thing sea monsters love, it's food. And I took some food with me. I'll throw this cow in and just like that, <laughs> and wait for the sea monster to arrive. I mean, there's no way the sea monster's gonna give up on that cow. Which in comparison to size, I mean, that's gotta be just a snack for the monster, right? That's not a main meal. What if I throw some little grenades down. What if I put down one of these? Boom! Come on, monster! Come on, I got a cow for you! A little peace offering. Jeez, why is it so hard to lure them over here? Hold on, did you see that? That's gotta be the monster. Oh, oh my days, that's huge! That's huge! That's literally- Quick, uh, get back up, get back up, go, 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 go upstairs, Frank! That is massive! Bro, that's a megalodon! Eat the cow, just get the, get the cow. Alright, throw a little sticky down. No, not on the boat! Are you crazy? Okay, I can't use stickies now. This is gonna blow the entire boat up. Duh, you're out of your mind, Franklin? Right, just throw some nades, come on. That's too far. Three, two, one, again. Oh, jeez, how am I gonna kill this thing? <laughs> It's literally there. All right, three, two, one. Lob it down. Oh, you are big. Bro, this is just the third monster. Imagine what the others are going to be like. Okay, it's time to use some actual machinery on this guy. Come on. You want to sink this boat? I'm not going down without a fight. I kind of want to jump in and take a little look at this beast. I can see bits of it from up here, but I got to see the whole picture. Right, let's just jump in. 
Be very quick about this. Oh my days. Yo, that's the mouth. That's literally the mouth. Oh, jeez. How did animals get this big? Okay, that was a terrible idea. I think I'll just get back in my boat, actually. I'll just throw down some more stickies. Nope, you're not getting me. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, that's the biggest shark I've ever seen. It's bigger than my boat. And there's plenty more animals bigger than this one, too. Oh, boy. If I can't kill this, then there is no way I'll be able to kill the others. Uh-oh, I just realized there was one on the boat, but it's okay. We're good. <laughs> yeah, everything's fine. Right, I'm just gonna risk this. May as well now. <laughs> if it sinks the boat, it's we're good. It's not gonna sink the boat. Here, sea monster. Here, sea monster. It's only a few stickies. Where's it gone? Have we scared him off? There's only one way to find out. Come on, come on, please. Oh, yes, we've taken it out. Screw you, Megalodon. <laughs> you see this little fishy down there? That was the size of a piranha. This is the size of this sea monster. And they're only going to get bigger than this. <laughs> I want to get this on the beach and show everyone else. Wow, you are huge. Well, I don't care. I made my money. Check it out. Another 5 million bucks. <laughs> that gives me $15 million, which means... I'm 20 million away from buying the super rare, amazing, really expensive supercar. I can't wait to see what that is. It's gotta be good if it's 35 mil. All right, let's go get the next sea monster. But this time, I'm gonna need to make a few changes. You saw how hard it was to hunt down this guy. So before we go any further, I'm gonna buy a rocket launcher and a few more heavier things, you know? Things I can fire down and obliterate the sea monsters in minutes. Maybe even seconds if we're lucky. All right, minigun, need one of those. Grenade launcher, definitely need one of those. Rocket launcher, hands down, I need that. Now, the other things I'm not too fussed about, we don't really need those. I've already got a knife, and I can't use anything else underwater, but what I can do with is more grenades, more stickies, way more of those, and I don't want to forget the rail gun. I may as well get the homing launcher, too. Yep, that's basically everything I need. Thank you very much, mister. You have a good day now. I'm just gonna go and slay the rest of the sea monsters. <laughs> oh, beware of the piranhas, though. They are literally everywhere. Next on my list is the monster from the dinosaur age. This one is big, but not the biggest, but still pretty big. So I upgraded my boat as well and got myself one of these, which comes with its own turrets around the front and the back. And it's also got a really scary mouthpiece. So if any monsters see this, <laughs> guess what, buddy? My teeth are as big as yours. It's also a little bit fat. Faster, which we could definitely do with. And are those guys out of their mind? If they knew what was around here, they would be running home. They're on jet skis, and I think they're about to have a race. I've still got my sonar kit, so I can pick up the monsters whenever we're close by, but I'm pretty sure the next one is around here. Hold on, wasn't there a yacht over there? I'm pretty sure there was. That's weird. I, I, I literally saw one a second ago, and then it vanished. Right, I'm gonna go a bit closer and take a little look. There was. It's upside down. Oh! <gasps> Oh boy, okay, we're really close. We're seriously close. It just took down the boat. That's kind of terrifying because that boat is uh, a little bit bigger than mine. Let me take a little look in the water, see if I can see anything. Nope, I mean, this is quite a shallow area. How did the sea monster get up here? But down there's a bit deeper. All right, looks pretty clear to me, but that went down literally like less than a minute ago. There is no room for error because if we make one mistake, we're gonna end up in the water and lose everything. Now, here's the deal. I don't wanna move too quickly because if I do, we might alert the sea monster. I wanna just glide on the waves and make it seem like I'm just right in the sea. No boats here. What have we got on the sodar? I think I think it's getting faster. Let me just go a little bit further this way. Is it? Yeah, it's getting. Oh my days! There it is. There you are, dude. That's the monster. This is the one from the dinosaur age. It's the Mosasaurus. You guys have seen Jurassic Park, right? It came up and ate them right at the end. You're massive. Right. One second. I'm gonna have to use the turret on this guy. I'm not even gonna try and use a rocket launcher on him. I don't want to make a mess. Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> Oh, no, you don't. You're not getting away from us. Don't let him get into this boat. You see that mouth? There's so many teeth in there. All right, I, I'm pretty sure this is, like, very similar size to the Megalodon we just saw, but it's taking forever to kill. Come on, Franklin, you can do this. There's no hiding now. <laughs> yeah, screw you. You snooze, you lose. <laughs> this boat is really overpowered. We should have got this earlier. Imagine this against the piranhas. I would eliminate all of them, but I got the next sea monster, which means I just made another five 
million dollars. That means we've made 20 million, which puts us even closer to our goal. This boat did a pretty good job. I'm gonna use it for the next sea monster. But if I get there and find out it's like triple the size, we might need a bigger boat than even this. And to get one of those is not gonna be easy. Oh my days, there's a shark. <laughs> I completely forgot about those guys. You're not even dangerous or scary anymore. Look at you. Uh, you look kind of cute trying to get this boat. <laughs> Listen, buddy, I would love to hunt you down, but you're not on my list. I don't get paid. I tell you what is on my list, though. Another sea monster, which luckily for us isn't actually too far away. I'm pretty sure it lives somewhere around those islands. To the ordinary player, this might look like a nice place to relax. Get away from the enemies. Maybe even set up a camp. But make no mistake, these islands are home to some of the biggest sea monsters this world has ever seen. Your life as you know it will be nothing more than a little snack, which will soon be forgotten after two minutes. This boat is basically a floating bowl, and I'm the grape inside of it. <sighs> All right, let's take a look in the water and see if we can find anything. Usually they hide under these weeds. Pretty good spot if you ask me. Keeps them away from the satellite, the drones, the planes in the sky. I don't see nothing. All right, back in the boat we go. It seems like wherever this monster is may have gone for a little journey. Maybe it's hunting for food. Maybe it knows we're coming. Maybe it's hiding somewhere else. All right, listen out, Frank. Anything? Nope, nothing here. What about this way? It can't be too far. These things can't swim too fast. Wait, I think it's speeding up. That's speeding up. It's speeding up. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. All right, this is kind of good. This is great news. Keep on going, buddy. Keep on going. Oh, what my days. When is it going to stop? Come on, dude. It's still getting faster. Okay, I think that's it. I'm pretty sure this is it. This has to be the spot. Right, I'm not going to jump in yet. I just want to get on this gun. And we're going to take a little look around using this turret. Last thing I want to do is become a little snack for this guy. A little taster on what's to come. Oh, my days. Now is not a great time to be seasick. <laughs> Oh boy, all I need is like a fin, a claw, a tooth, some ripples, just anything. Come on, where is it? I know you're here. Wait, did you hear that? That was a splash. That was a splash. That was a big splash. It came from this side. All right, that's it. Turret on the other side. Looks like you're on the other side of this boat then, eh? Whew. All right, you're not gonna get away from me, trust me. You're dealing with the best of the best. Are you kidding? That's, that's on the other side? Come on, dude. What are you trying to do? I'm not gonna fall in. Come on. You really think I'm gonna fall in? I'm not that stupid. This monster's got a brain. I think it's toying with me. Come on now. You wanna make another splash? Do it. No, oh, no, not on the other side. Are you kidding? All right, that's it. I'm standing on the roof with a rocket launcher. This monster is literally toying with us. Probably scoping the place out, making sure that it can... See every part of this boat. Come on, buddy. Where are you gonna splash next? Front? Side? Back? Why isn't it splashing anymore? Where's it gone? Oh, bro, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Come on, come on. Oh, my days! Ah, 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 bro, it just went into the boat. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, get up, Franklin. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? You know, it's rude. To oh, my days, there you are. No, 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 no. Quick, come on, come back to That's literally massive. Come on, get me in the boat. Get me in the boat. Get me in the boat. I am so glad this thing flipped back over. Oh, my day. Oh, jeez. Ah, get off the boat. Oh, oh, boy. Okay, that's massive. That is the biggest sea monster I have ever come across. And it just annihilated my boat, but somehow it's still okay. All right, get back on. What the heck is that monster? Bro, I am terrified. I know it's around. <laughs> Where is it gone, dude? Mr. Houdini, the sea monster here. This boat is amazing, by the way. This boat cannot sink. It's flipped three times. I might just buy this myself because this is this is such a good boat. Are you sure it's not down there? It just vanished. This monster's a magician. Should I be scared or should I be happy? Have we just gotten rid of the monster? I just heard it. I, I can hear it. It's like tapping. You hear that? That's the claws. I remember seeing the claws. I think it's breaking rocks. Hold on. It might have just given up on us. If that's the case, I better hunt this down before it comes back. It's found another boat. I can hear screams. I can hear screams. Okay, now's our chance. If we can get to that monster now, we can probably take it out whilst it's occupied with somebody else. There it is. That's the boat. That's got it. It's got to be there. It's got to be there. Hey, fellas, don't worry. It's, you're okay. Where's the sea monster? It was here, bro. I... <laughs> It's under us, I promise! Okay, now, oh my days. No, there it is. There it is. There you are. Alright, go for the other guys. Bro, that boat didn't even stand a chance. Right, now's my chance. Come on, kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Come on, dude. The shell is so tough. Ugh, come on! You are going 
down! Well, at least we got a little distraction going, but the moment it's done with those guys, it's gonna come after us. Oh, boy! Okay, no more spinning! No more spinning! Oh, my days! It's sinking the boat! If it hits us with a tail, it could blow this boat up. Oh, come on. Come on, you can't be that hard to kill. I think I gotta go down the mouth. It's gotta be the only way. Oh, no, no, no. Don't swing that over. Please don't swing that. Oh, jeez. Don't. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my days. Franklin, are you okay? Where are you? Are we, are we good? Oh, no. No, I'm in the water. Oh, no, no, no. Come on, get back in the boat. Get back in the boat. There it is. Oh, no, no, no. Leave it alone. Come on. You're in the boat as well. Oh, jeez. Quick, underwater. Underwater. I'm gonna do a quick dive. As deep as I can go. Ah, uh, try and get me now, buddy. <laughs> yeah. All right, this looks like a pretty good plan to me. And then loop around. Come on, try and confuse this sea monster. I mean, it's huge. It can't move around that quickly. I am right underneath it. All it has to do is, like, grab its legs, and it's got me. All right, sure is this way. Get me to the shallow water. I don't want to become lunch. I haven't even looked behind me yet, guys. I I'm really worried that the sea monster is going to be, like, two meters away from me. Oh, wait. I think we're okay. We live for another day, but I still gotta take out that monster, and I don't think that boat's gonna cut it. We're gonna need something even bigger. Say hello to the military's battleship, complete with its own explosive cannon rounds, underwater torpedoes. Yeah, this sea monster is so dead. <laughs> we're using a battleship to take it down. So this is where the other two boats were, and those guys were made a meal of. Where are you? Come on. Just because I'm in a bigger boat doesn't mean you can start hiding away. Ooh, there you are. <laughs> yeah. And there you go. I'm so glad we got this. I annihilated it in one go. Although, what would have happened if it got to the battleship? Do you reckon I could have sunk it? Yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter. I got the sea monster. Just want to make sure it's definitely dead. Yeah, that's not moving. Well, who wants lobster? Because there's going to be a lot of it tonight. <laughs> This is gonna feed a thousand people. Well, it's about time you give back to the community after everyone you took. And just like that, another five million bucks. That puts us on 25 million, which means there's only two sea monsters left to slay until I get that supercar. And now I got a battleship, courtesy of the military. We should be just fine. Oh gosh, there's two of them. I didn't think there were two of them. I found them so quickly. Didn't even get a chance to search. All right, come here, big boy. <laughs> yes, one of them's dead. Let's get the other guy. Oh, you wanna run away now? Guess what, mister? You can't run away. <laughs> you have been in the sea for way too long. These are megalodons, like the actual megalodons. The ones you see in the movies, the big ones, the ones Jason Staten wants to hunt down all the time. If only he had a battleship because this can take him down pretty easily. Although this guy, for some reason, his skin is really tough, but finally I got him. <laughs> yes. Well, that's the next one dealt with. That's super easy. I'm so glad that didn't take too long. This battleship is just overpowered. Like trying to stop this is literally impossible. And ka -ching, another five million bucks. I am one sea monster away from buying that supercar. Let's get it. But for this one, I'm not gonna use a battleship. We're gonna use something even better. Instead, I'm gonna use one of these. The most powerful helicopter in GTA 5. There is no way the sea monster is gonna catch us now. But we better get there quickly because this one <gasps> is about to get on the land. No way! And that's the biggest one I've ever seen. That's the luxury yacht. That's the sea monster. Let's get a closer look and prepare those missiles. You can call this whatever you want. Giant sea crab, sea scorpion, huge mythical monster, an abomination. Whatever it is, it's about to get on land. You see those babies? They're meters away. Right, I'm going to take out the babies, then take out the mother, and then that should be the end of the sea monsters. This is the biggest one in the world. And it's even got fangs at the front. Oh my days, that's super loud. The military are on their way, but there isn't much time. If these get onto land, it's gonna be a catastrophe. All right, that should deal with that little guy. Let's get this one. No, oh my days. This is so difficult to fly. Boom! All right, that should deal with the other guy, too. Now it's time for the mob. I think I'll use the machine gun on this one. And when the military arrive, you have no chance of surviving. If I can just stop the monster from getting on land, then we're gonna be fine. Oh my days. Wait, it's doing another. Oh, jeez! Oh, my engine. The engine. The engine's gone. No, 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 no. Don't crash. Don't crash. No! Oh, boy. 
Okay, get out. Dude, it just crashed the helicopter with the sound of the sea monster. That's a pretty loud creature. And it's massive too. This has got to be the size of May's bank. There's only one thing that's going to destroy this. We're going to need an airstrike. Good luck, fellas. Do your worst. <laughs> this is one of the first sea monsters I've used airstrikes on. But once that hits the head, <laughs> there's no coming back. Yes, 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 yes. That's another five million dollars. And you know what that means. I've been looking forward to this all day. Thanks for keeping it warm, Simeon. I got the money. Now where's the car? <laughs> it's a Bugatti! And it's even got the color of the ocean. It's even got the wave effect on it as well. Well, I'm gonna really enjoy this ride. One of the fastest in the universe. And for 35 million dollars, it's gotta be one of the most expensive cars. But the oceans are near enough safe. Just be careful of those piranhas. <laughs> we have managed to hunt down every single sea monster from the smallest to the biggest. Today, I'm joining the FBI. We're gonna become the best investigator around and track down any single bad person who crosses the line. But it doesn't end there. If anyone doesn't subscribe, Franklin will know. But luckily for you, I'm not in the FBI yet. We're gonna join the organization, which is why I've dressed up in a suit. <laughs> Franklin, you're looking smart, buddy. Be on your best behavior, because once we go inside, they're gonna be watching me and judging me. My name's on the list. I got an interview. I told them I wanted to join. After all, this is literally a dream of mine. Hello, mister. I would like to join the FBI. Go upstairs. They're waiting for you. Thank you very much, mister. Looks like they're waiting for me already. I take that as a good sign. They must be anticipating Franklin. <laughs> I did hand in a pretty good resume. I've been a police officer. I've been a SWAT officer. We've done it all. So, there's only one thing left to do. Join the FBI. We have to get to floor 48. Let's see. Oh, my days, dude. There's one of the top ones. Wait, how? How am I still on floor one? It feels like we've been going forever. Okay, this might take a while. I'm still on floor one. Come on. This is not going well. How slow is this lift? Maybe we should have taken the stairs, Franklin. <laughs> that would have been a much better idea. Floor 49. We've finally done it. All right, here we go, Franklin. Here we go. FBI. What's up, buddy? <laughs> All right, these guys be waiting for me. Now, who's the boss? Who is gonna interview me? Is it this guy? I'm just gonna go inside and pop my head and say hello. He's, oh, it's me, Franklin. Hey, Frank, over here. Oh, sorry, mister. Looks like I got the wrong guy. My guy's over there. Hey, man, good to see you. <laughs> oh, this is not a good start to an interview. So, I am here to join the FBI. This is pretty cool. Look at all the things going on. This is gonna be a dream come true if I actually get into the FBI. So, tell me, what have I gotta do to join? Follow me. Follow you? Okay, where are we going? Just keep walking. I'll tell you where to go. Okay, this guy's... <laughs> being a bit suspicious right now. Why do I have to keep walking? I don't like this. So, uh, where are you taking me to, mister? Is there like an office we're gonna sit down in somewhere quiet? Take the elevator. Oh, wait, you sure about that? You really, you really wanna take the elevator? <laughs> yeah. Took us a while to get up here. Just get inside. Okay, all right, looks like we're going in then. Excuse me, my friends. You can't be here. But I came to play the guitar. And nobody likes guitar. Now get out. What? What is this guy talking about? Where are we going to, mister? Is this seriously the interview? Yes. Now why won't this door not... Close! Why is the door not... Oh my goodness, come on. We're going on a mission together. Oh, a mission? No way. It looks like I've already been accepted. I'm excited. What is this mission gonna be? Whoa, check it out. We have our own FBI vehicle. <laughs> so, where are we going to, mister? I'm taking you to the police station. The police station? I wonder what's going on there. What do you guys think? Most wanted person in jail? Who knows? Maybe we have to interrogate somebody and find some classified information. I mean, I will do whatever it takes if it means I get to join the FBI. Whatever it takes, eh? We'll see about that. Oh, maybe he took that a bit too literally. Hey, <laughs> did I say whatever it took? I I'm sure I did, but uh, let's just let's just put a cap on that, shall we, for now? Afternoon, officer. FBI coming through. Just uh, let me in. Afternoon, guys. You're doing a fantastic job. Terrific job, everybody. Keep walking. He's downstairs. Downstairs. Who is this guy? Okay, I guess there's only one way to find out. Hello? Oh, is that him? He looks kind of scary. He's doing sit-ups. You know they're scary when they do sit-ups in their prison cell. Hey, what are you doing? What are you? Th He's pushing me. Hey, what are you doing? Ah! 
Ah, come on! Make him talk to graduate! Really? Are you kidding me? Ah, oh, my days, this guy? Well, I suppose we could make him talk. He's not exactly that strong. <laughs> you better get talking. Tell me what you know. Why would I want to talk to you? Oh, let me just tell you one reason why. Because I am in the FBI. And if you don't talk to me, things are gonna get ugly. <laughs> it can't get uglier than your face. Oh, 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 this guy's asking for it. Okay, time to make him talk. Come on, tell me what you know. Oh, you think you can get up from that? Oh, here we go. Now we got a bro. Ow! Ow, come on. This is not how I expected my graduation to go. Ow! Ow! Ow, ow, come on. I don't think we're gonna survive in here, guys. Wait, if you subscribe, we can make him talk. And Franklin might su survive. Oh, he's really hitting me hard. Guys, can you subscribe to the channel? Because I don't think we're gonna win this. Talk, say something, just anything. Uh, uh, duh, uh, duh, come on. Oh, yes, has it worked? Okay, okay, I'll talk to you. Finally, thank you. You guys are the best. If it wasn't for you, I would have died in here. 100%. These guys are crazy. Sir. Oh, how'd it go? It went fantastically. I got the information. Do you want to know? Don't tell me. It's too classified. Here, follow me. All right, looks like we're going on another follow mission. I wonder where he's taking me to now. At least we've done the hard part, though. Huh? Wait a second. Why am I on the train tracks? This is not cool. What did he tell you? Don't tell him, Frank. Don't do it. I'm so confused. Both of you guys are with the FBI. I, I, who do I talk to? Don't tell him, Frank. It's a test. You better tell me or you're dead. Oh, my days. I am so confused right now. Do I tell the FBI what they wanted me to get? Or do I not tell them? And what's going to happen? Oh, my days. There is actually a train. Hey, officers, come on. This has to be a big misunderstanding. Don't tell him, Frank. I don't know. I don't know. The, the train's coming. No. No. Wait a second. This was a hologram? How am I still? I'm alive. No way. Oh, my days. Oh, boy. Seriously, guys? That wasn't even real. Welcome to the FBI. Why, thank you. I love my outfit, by the way. It's w Michael. Wait a minute. You graduated too? <laughs> hey, I think someone got the letters mixed up on your jacket, buddy. FIB? <laughs> no. You're meant to be part of the FBI, Michael. Come on, get with the club. You both passed the test. You're now partners. Now, go get to your car. Partners, you say? Hey, Michael, you hear that? We're partners. Hey, you can really deal with a trim around the back. You trying to get a mellow or something, Michael? <laughs> what is that, dude? Right, you know what? I'm just going to stop being mean to Michael. I love my outfit. Franklin, you look like a true boss. I can't even see your face anymore. This is amazing. Da, 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 da. Hey, Michael, are you ready to see what cars we got out there? Because I can see them, and they look amazing. So, I got the 4x4 SUV style. Or we could go with the classic, the one we were driving in with my guy earlier. Uh, that one has open up on the number plate. This one <laughs> says FBI high. I like the FBI high. Yeah, all right, we'll go with that one then. For once, we actually agree on something. I think we're gonna get along today. This is great. So this is my brand new FBI car. I think it looks pretty amazing, to be honest. This is what it looks like inside. Hey, why do you choose the back seat, Michael? Do you not want to come in front seat or something? I get road sick. Oh, wow, all right, you're not gonna last too long with me driving then. <laughs> now let's see, which corners do I want to whip this round? All units, all units, meet up immediately. Oh no, okay, we'll have to wait a few seconds because they're doing a rendezvous. They want us to meet up. Let's see, what do you reckon's going on now? Seems to me like we're going to the science labs. I got the sirens on, ready for business. What's happening at the laboratory? Anything could have gone down here. I mean, these guys work on so many different products. Dangerous products too. Okay, there's a couple of police officers. I don't see any FBI agents though. Hey, where's the FBI? Oh, here we go. Oh, okay, wait a second. There's plenty of FBI people. All right, we got an FBI group readying up. I think that's got to be us, right? I'm here. It's me and Michael DeSanta, part of the FBI. What's going on, my days? Even the army's here as well? What is going on? This is insane. A group of rebels have captured the labs. We need to get them back. They caused quite a bit of damage. We got snipers, but so have they. We need to tread carefully. And there's 12 hostages around the back. They got to return safely. Oh, my days. 12 hostages? The entire laboratory under siege? Right, we better think smartly. Uh, since the FBI are here, I reckon we should take control. We know strategy. If anyone wants to follow behind me, you're more than welcome to. Mr. Rabbit, you better get out of here. Things are about to get ugly. Now remember, Franklin, no hostages can die. Hey, excuse me, guys. Why don't we just uh, give it up, call it a day, go get a McDonald's. What do you say? How about no? Well, that's not the answer I was looking for. Are you willing to compromise 
see if we can negotiate. How about this? I'll get you a big meal. A large one. It doesn't come with chicken. Uh, no. No, it doesn't. No, I can only give you the burger. You want chicken nuggets? You gotta pay me something. Deal's off. Okay, then, men. Let's do this the hard way, then. Oh, boy. Okay, they've all got guns. I didn't realize they had guns. No one told me that. <laughs> Okay, right guys, let's just chill out for a second. Is anyone gonna help me? Guys? Guys? No? No? Uh, just me then, just me. Franklin Clinton, FBI, open up. Looks like I will be the one to save the day. Oh boy. So they told me there were snipers. Oh my days, they weren't kidding. There are the snipers up there. Get them! Right, that's it. I tried to negotiate with you guys and nobody was interested. So now every one of you shall die, okay? <laughs> yeah. Easy peasy, yeah? Well, let's go and get some high ground, shall we? Oh, wait a second. There's one sniper there. What's he doing? He's sleeping on the job. Job. And these guys are having a battle with the police outside. Nice. Good distraction. Oh, my days. Another sniper up there. Come on. This is crazy. There's people everywhere. Check it out. I'm in a perfect spot right now. And they've seen me. <laughs> yeah. Nice. I think there's one guy left. Oh, I missed. No. It, ah, my days. Come on. Can you stop moving, please? Come on. Make it easy for me. Okay. There's got to be most of them down. Oh, let's get that. Whoopsie daisy. Sorry, guys. I can't believe this. I might actually do this myself. Single handily. Come on, Franklin. We can do this. Make sure the hostages don't die. You can make sure they're taken out. That guy's sorted. All right, wait a second. There's still that guy left. There's another guy up there. There's gotta be everyone. I think there's everyone. Wait, no. There's still another person. Where is he? Show yourself, dude. I'm so glad I got bulletproof armor. This is the best armor ever. Just a few more people left. Nice. And boom. There goes your cars. There's gotta be everyone, right? Oh, wait a second. There's one guy there. Michael, get to see you. Where have you been? Go on. Run along, everybody. Run along. It's safe now. Everything's okay. Watch out for the fire. <laughs> Make sure you don't walk into fire. And there's an evil person right over there. Nice. We saved the hostages. We sorted out the labs. And we have retrieved... Oh, my days. Do they really want to get these? These are missiles. <laughs> these guys were preparing for something crazy. Hey, officers, come in. I've secured the labs. No thanks to any of you. Well done, Franklin. We're moving in. Well, it looks like my job here is done. <laughs> what a job we did. Well, you guys are pretty much useless. You haven't even moved one spot. I bet the still briefing right now. Come on, Michael. Get in the car. I'm taking you to McDonald's. You deserve it. Hey, Frank. The boss wants to see you. Oh, uh, the boss? I can't get one moment silence in the FBI. Okay, let's go and see what the boss wants. He's probably really impressed with how I did over there. I don't know about you guys, but that's pretty impressive. I can't wait to meet this guy. He lives on top of the Union Depository. This is where all of the money in the world is kept. Hey, Michael, best behavior right now. This guy could give us a promotion. We could become controller of the FBI. Imagine the bank heist we could do. Shh, between me and you, of course. All right, here we go. Floor number 38. Uh, Michael, you just stay here. All right, let me do the talking. I don't want him embarrassing me. You know how it is, Michael. This place is amazing. Yeah, okay, we definitely can't have him in here. Now, let's see. Hello, Mr. Boss. Me, Franklin. Just wanted to say hello. This is a beautiful place. Look at this kitchen. Oh, here we go. I found him. Hello. <laughs> yeah. you, you wanted to see me? You impressed me, Frank. Now I need your help. Oh, I impressed you then. Nice. Looks like we're in the good books. <laughs> yeah. So what do you need my help with? Oh, you know, just a few things here and there. Yeah, more specifically, though, I could really do with knowing. Follow me. Oh, great. It's another one of these follow and talk situations. There could be bugs in here. I can't discuss inside. Uh, let's go outside. All right, we're going outside then. Uh, what about out here? Uh, go up the stairs. If I find myself on a train track again, I am not going to be happy. I'll leave the organization, okay? I'm the best person you've got. I know you are, Frank. Uh, don't worry about that. Everything's gonna be fine. Is it, though? Is it, buddy? I got real big trust issues being in this organization, and wow, this is beautiful, dude. I love this place. Check it out. He's got a games room. Oh, yeah. It's a nice place, all right. Hey, keep walking. What is it that you want my help with? You better talk, because I'm not gonna hang around here all day. Somebody stole classified information. We need it back. Okay. Well, what is it? That's classified. Oh. Oh, yeah, of course. <laughs> How could I be so stupid? Well, in that case, don't worry. I'll find this information. Have you got any leads? I spoke to my team earlier. They're already investigating it. And they should have found something by now. Where do you think I'll find this classified information? All units! All units! We got a lead! Yeah, that's them right now. You better listen to that. Looks like they found something. Yeah, well, it looks like they have. We got a lead. We think we know where this information is. Let's go and find the classified information. Hey, guys, you ready for this? Want to make sure there's no mistakes. 
This could get dangerous. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. This is the FBI. Open up. Get them, Franklin. Duh, duh. Nice. All right, they're down. Oh, my days. Are you kidding me? The classified information was how to print money. No way. Look at this. Are they 20s? It is. They're printing $20 bills. Oh, wait a second. What's going on? Oh, my days. Someone's in here. Ah, ah. Uh, Michael, you gotta get him! Get him, guys! Come on! Die! How dare you ruin my plan! Uh, uh, come on, Franklin. We need to stop this, or else we're gonna die! Three, two, one... Uh, hey! You! Looks like you forgot about me! Why is he super strong and why am I holding a sniper? Uh, amazing! That's what you get! Oh, no, you don't! Get him! Uh, hey, guys, I got him! Guys? No, 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 no. Michael! Talk to me! No! Oh my days. I lost Michael. I lost my men. But at least we got the classified information. How do we let this happen? Right, that's it, Franklin. We're getting out of here. I gotta tell the others. Calling all units. My team, they've been taken out. We got the classified information, but I need a cleanup crew. Sending coordinates now. We're on our way. Hey, have you heard? Heard about what? Uh, the crazy devastation that just happened? No! No, the president! He's been kidnapped! Kidnapped? Are you kidding me? Oh, man. It's just trouble after trouble after trouble. Right, I'm coming to the offices now. I won't be long. I heard about the president. Uh, what's going on? Somebody kidnapped him. Do we have any idea who or where they took him to? Why would they want to kidnap him? Oh, I don't know. You know, the president knows a few things. Area 51, uh, the codes to every bank phone. Okay, drop the sarcasm, mister. Now tell me, where have they taken him? you got to have something. Well, we spotted him on a camera. Looks like they took him to the sewers. The thing is... Everyone's scared to go down there. What are you guys? A group of babies scared of the dark? Uh, 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 no, no, definitely not. Yeah, right. All right, okay. Send me where the entrance is. I'll go and explore this place myself. I'll find the president and I'll rescue him. Ah, that's the spirit. Uh, trust me, well, we'll pay you back, I promise. Yeah, you better. I lost my partner today and I might just lose my life. Let's go and rescue the president. Well, here goes nothing. Looks like we're going down into the sewers. <sighs> Okay, a scary place, scary place. It's not that scary, Franklin. We're gonna be fine. Just think happy thoughts. Wait, do you hear that? Tell me everything! Everything? Yes! That's them. It's echoing down the sewers. They're definitely down here. Hey, wait a second. Do you see that, guys? That looks like the people who kidnapped the president. No way. Hey, let's just listen to what they're saying first. Careful now. Gotta make sure it's the right person. I mean, this does still look pretty sketchy if it's not. So, are you gonna make us rich? Rich on the inside or on the outside? What does it look like? I want millions of dollars. Oh, on the outside then. Okay, well, uh, uh, no. Yep, definitely the president. Definitely. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Sorry. Nice. President. Oh, my days. How are you alive? No. That was close. We almost lost the president. <laughs> hey, Mr. President, it's okay. You can come out now, buddy. I'm getting you out of here. The FBI has arrived. Thanks. You saved my life. Uh, my security isn't that good. Yeah, clearly. Clearly isn't that good. Hey, let's take the ladder. We'll climb out of here. Hey, what's up, mister? You've just been standing there all day. Meanwhile, I've been out there saving the day. <laughs> hey, guys, check it out. Look, it was two chicken to save the president. That's right. You guys, not me. Franklin, you deserve everything, which is why we're going to give you... Yes, yes, yes. A cookie. Congratulations. Yeah, a cookie. Let's go. What? Are you... T oh, my days. This is the weirdest reward ever. I've done so much. It's not just any old cookie. This is a triple chocolate chip cookie. It's big. It comes with a cherry on top as well. Well, I guess that's what we get for saving the president. But hey, it has been a fun adventure joining the FBI today. And you know what, guys? I'm willing to stay. There's a flying car in GTA 5, which only trillionaires can afford. I've never seen this car before, so I'm really excited. And Simeon gave me the location. But there's one problem. The flying car belongs to whoever Whoever owns this house. So I went up the stairs and snuck inside, and to my surprise, I didn't find anything. In fact, I could hear music, and there's people in the garden having a barbecue. I'm not getting past those guys. But if I put my gun away and pretend like I'm one of the others, I reckon we can blend straight in. Hey, what's cooking on the barbecue? 
Nope. All right. Just not even speaking to me. Fair enough. He's telling me to go away. Well, maybe I can't blend in as easily as I thought I could, but at least they're not chasing after me. Anyway, let's take a look around the front because I can hear a ton of music. You guys hear that? Sounds like a disco's going on. Anyway, where's this flying car Simeon's talking about? I've never even thought it's possible. Hold on. Who are those guys? What? Hey, yo, I know GTA 5 is 10 years old, but that anniversary was a few days ago. You guys are still celebrating. Oh, this is crazy. Wait, do you reckon it's in the garage? Let me take a look. Okay, come on. Open up, open up. Hey, get away from that. Wait, what? Oh, someone's talking to me. It didn't even open. Sorry. Uh, listen, can I join in on the party? No. Oh, come on. Be friendly. Listen, guys. It's only me. I want to party with you. You'll ruin the groove. Leave or die. Oh. Right, they're gonna kill me otherwise. Hey, what if I say no? Oh boy. Okay, all right, okay. I, I won't say no. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. I'm going. <laughs> Jeez, they're literally shooting me. Okay, that's not good. That's not good. If I die, we're never gonna get this car. But you guys can give me backup if you subscribe to the channel. Oh my days, you gotta give me backup. You guys saw how many people were in there and they're all chasing me. Oh my days, quick subscribe. Give me backup. I gotta find a better hiding spot. These guys aren't giving up. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Leave me alone. Come on, please. I really, really wanna get this flying car. Have you guys subscribed yet? I don't see any backup. Come on. I'm gonna wait it out here. Uh, no, actually, I'm gonna jump over this. Okay, nice. Well done, Frank. Everything's okay. Just hide behind this wall and fingers crossed they don't see us. Oh my days, they're breaking in. They're already in the garden. But wait, what's this? Oh, oh yes, we got some backup. Oh my days, they're literally tearing them up. I don't think we have enough. Hey, yo, I, we might need some more subscribers because I'm seeing more of those guys and not as many of us. Oh no, there's only three of them left. Quick, guys, get me all backup, please. I don't want to die. I want to get this car. Whoa, hey, what are those shadows? What the? Oh my days, you came in with an airstrike? <laughs> you guys are actual legends. Hey, I'm gonna just run away so I don't die in this airstrike thing. Whoa! Boom! That was awesome. We may have killed our backup, but I think we've taken out all of the disco warriors as well. Is anyone alive? Yes, we got all of them. Fair play. Fair play. I never thought that could actually happen. Anyway, let's go and grab my car. Oh, hold on. There's two people left. Bop, bop. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. You guys actually call yourself professional? <laughs> you suck. Whoa, hey, do you guys hear that? I think that was an explosion. Maybe that was from the airstrike. Yeah, no, not my problem. I want to open up this garage and, you know, see. Oh, my days, there's still people in here. Yo, there's people on the balcony. Are you kidding me? Jeez. All right, now they're taken care of. Let's get this garage open. Come on, come on. Jeez, oh, it's not opening. What if I try and blow it open? Ah, it's never going to stay shut like this. Boom. Are you kidding? It's not even opening. Oh, great. Okay, how do I get this garage door open? This doesn't make any sense. This sucks. Hey, hold on. Is this the car he was talking about? Something exploded. This doesn't look like a GTA car to me. This looks like a brand new car. Kind of like something which could fly. Oh, my days. Wait, maybe it wasn't in the garage after all. Maybe this is the car. Can I get inside? Yo, I can. It doesn't have a name. It's really rare. This doesn't belong in the universe, which means it's probably the flying car, but it accidentally exploded. Okay, the airstrike was way too hard, but that's okay. I'll get a tow truck, get this repaired, and we'll have the flying car, which only trillionaires can afford. Now, all I gotta do is get this hooked on. No, I don't want to accept a towing job. Why does the game think I'm actually working for a tow company? Do you mind? I just want to grab this car. Come on, this is the best car in the universe. Alright, lift it up. I've got it, got it now. Come on, come on. Yes, I've got the car! <laughs> Once we get this to Long Sandals Customs, we're gonna have the best one in the universe. Da, 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 da. Wait, oh, come on, dude. I really... Jeez, I need to focus on my driving a bit more. I already detached it from the hook. I don't want to break this car in half. Are you serious? It's falling off again? <laughs> Jeez. This is going to be a very long journey. I mean, what kind of car even is this? I genuinely don't recognize this car. There is too much glass. There's, like, not even a side to this. I hope it's bulletproof glass. Driving around in GTA in this? Basically a death trap. You're waiting to be killed. Now I know why it flies. But look at the vents on the back. Like, this vehicle looks crazy. I can't wait to get it repaired. Thank goodness for editing, eh? Without that, you would still be back in Vinewood Hills. <laughs> Alright, get it off the truck. Let's get it in the custom. So, what have we got here? Do you reckon it even, like, belongs to a brand we know about, or do you think this is, like, its own vehicle? Oh, 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 look at this beast! <laughs> he repaired it for about a thousand dollars. I think it's a great investment when this car actually flies. It's from Mercedes! Look at these wheels! Have you ever seen tires which look like these? I bet they're 
helium balloons. I mean, you gotta get something to get some height on this. I mean, how is this car actually gonna fly? Are there jets underneath? Are there, like, vents here which push some air out? I honestly think balloons, jets underneath. It's the Mercedes Vision AVTR. And, yo, it hasn't even got a steering wheel. This is completely automatic, and I love the paint job. All right, thank you so much for getting this repaired. Now, let's get this in the sky. <laughs> I want to see how this beast flies. All right, okay. So, it dries pretty well. Oh, look at that. Look at that. We're basically pivoting on the spot. This is such a beast. <laughs> but how do we fly in this machine? No, that doesn't work. What about this? That doesn't work either. I'm just tilting forward. And Franklin, what are you doing in there, buddy? How do we get this thing to fly? Is it this one? Okay, maybe Simeon knows how to get this to fly. He usually has the answers to these things. Surely this is the one. I mean, th this is such a nice car. I've never seen this on the GTA website. It's exclusive. It looks like something which can fly. But how do we get this in the sky? Unless maybe I just do one really, really big jump. And then we just take off and we float around, do some gliding or something. <laughs> I don't know. The sky's the limit. I've got an idea. I'm gonna drive straight up one of these banks. You just wait. I'm gonna be gliding through the sky in no time. All right, give me like a ramp or something. Something good. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I am so gonna crash this if I'm not careful. Come on, there's gotta be like a hill or something I can use. Please. There is. Here it is. All right, three, two, one, and take off to the clouds. Seriously? This car is way heavier than I thought it was. This kind of sucks. What if I go downhill? Maybe that works too. Woo! Oh, come on! Dude, it just went straight down like gravity actually exists. Is this even the flying car? Come on, it's gotta be. Simeon sent me to that location. It has to be the flying car. He's gonna have some explaining to do if it's not. Yo, if the car could have flown, we wouldn't have crashed like that. And Franklin, your head goes through the ceiling. What kind of car am I even driving? Simeon, you got some explaining to do, my guy. You better tell me what I'm driving right now. How do I get this in the sky? Stop dancing, start talking. Let me take a look, uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, Simeon, I don't want to hear you muttering or anything. How do I get this thing to fly? One problem, my friend. Yes, and what is that problem? This is not the car. Uh, you got the wrong one. The wrong one? No, this was the only car at the house. I couldn't get into the garage. It was locked, and this one was next door. I exploded it, got it repaired. Are you sure this is the wrong one? Positive. Hey, listen, I'm tracking the flying car. I know where it is. And it wasn't there. Then why did you send me to the car? Oh, jeez. All right, Simeon, send me to the actual location, okay? Hey, and this time, don't lie. I promise. This one is actually the car. Hey, take this. You'll need it. Wait, you gave me $10,000? Why do I need this, Simeon? Trust me. You need money. All right, well, I'm not complaining. You just gave me 10 grand. Now, let's go and get the actual flying car and not this. Simeon, this is not going to turn into a video where I just collect nice cars for you, all right? This better be the flying car or I quit. And this is where the flying car is. They don't seem too friendly. There's a bunch of guards outside this barn. And who's this guy? Why are you checking your watch? Bro, I'm not exactly late for anything other than taking that car. Let me just take a little look. Oh, my days. I am looking at it. You guys see that? There's something behind the doors. Don't look. Wait, what do you mean, don't look? Why can't I look at what's behind the doors? I want to see what it is. Rumor has it. It's a flying car. One of the first ones in GTA 5. Worth a hundred million, a billion, a trillion. I don't even know, but it's worth a lot of money. Hey, do you mind if I just go through and get it? Step away from the door. Oh, great. These guys aren't exactly budging. Come on, please. A favor for a friend. Well, I'm sure we know each other somewhere. Away from the door. Now. Oh, great. Okay, he's not letting me go near that door. And I don't exactly know how I'm going to get to it. It's only me. I can't get any backup this time. It's not telling you to subscribe. You didn't do it. Can you try it out and see if I can get some backup? Uh, any minute now. Any second now. Hey, uh, what a race. Well, who's this guy? Uh, no, I want to get that car in there. The really cool one that flies. Win the race, you win the car. Whoa, hey, you're telling me all I got to do is race you guys and I get the car? Yes. But to enter costs $10,000. That makes sense. Simeon gave me $10,000. Okay. Well, what do I use to race? What have you got? Well, I've, I've got this car. Is this gonna do? Uh, it's probably a bit too slow, but we'll take your money. Hey, listen. Don't call my car slow. I'll see you at the start line. Here's your $10,000. Yeah. He thinks he's gonna beat me? <laughs> Fat chance, buddy. I'm gonna win that car. Oh, boy. Okay. I don't think they fly, which is good, but... 
Those are nice cars. And I'm in the last place. Position, wait, 21st? Are you kidding? Oh, my days. Yo, you see that? That was a massive crash. All right, gonna whack this guy off the road. Sorry. <laughs> Just want to win this car. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, my days. Okay, we've got a bit of a pile up. There's a door in front of me. Yo, they got a helicopter filming this race. This is crazy. Come on, don't lose. Don't lose. Don't. Hey, get away from me. <laughs> I'm so mean. Right, keep going. Keep going. I'm gonna take out this guy in the Zentorno. I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. Yoink! Get off the road, buddy. <laughs> yeah. I actually feel so mean right now for taking them off the road, but it's gonna be done. They're in supercars. I'm the only one who isn't. All right, come on. I'm catching up. I'm about to get into top five. Whoa, this guy skidded out. Third place. Third place. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Can I take second? Can we do it? Take second place. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Almost skidded out there. That was risky. And they're already catching up. Come on, I gotta win. I gotta win. I need this car. All right, we're coming off the highway. Oh, boy. All right, I don't know where the finish line is, but I want to make sure I win this second place. Let's go. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> yes. Oh, get wrecked. Sorry. Not sorry. That was perfect. I would be so angry if I was him. Here it is. The finish line. I just want to see how much space there was between me and them. Where are they? Where? Uh, where? <laughs> Yo, that's where second is? Third. These guys have only just left Log Santos. That is wild. All right, you know what? I'm finishing. I'm done it. I've done it. I've done it. I ain't waiting any longer. We got first place and we got the car. Boom. What did I say, eh? The car is mine. I told you I would win. Now give me the car. Come on, open it up. I don't care who you are. I don't care how tough you are. I won the race fair and square. Give me the car. <gasps> Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, this is nice. Another amazing paint job. Got the purple, the green, the yellow, the blue, green. It's got every single color. Yo, this is insane. Thanks, fellas. Listen, I'm never going to forget this, but I'm definitely going to forget about you. This is it. This is the one that flies. <laughs> Check it out. This is crazy. Yo, hey, Simeon's calling me. Hey, Simeon, I got the car. Look at it. It's so nice. You want me to send a photo? That's not the car. It's good, but uh, not even close. What do you mean, Simeon? I want to race. I pay 10 grand for this. It's the car. It flies. It is the old car. The new one is much better. Hey, make a detour. You can do a trade or something. A trade? I don't know if I want to trade this car. It's really nice. All right, whatever. I'll do the detour anyway. Apparently, this is the old flying car. And the new one is yet to be found. He's definitely messing with me. Oh, great. Hey, what now, Simeon? Are you going to tell me I got to break into the military base or something? Uh, no, but you're not going to like it. Uh, look for the plane and break in. The plane? What? I found the plane, Simeon. Now what? I don't know. I'll figure it out. Okay, I'll figure it out then. We'll just try and crash through the back of this plane. Oh boy, this is so dumb. This is so dumb. Hey, let me in. Uh, <laughs> do you reckon they will? Come on, open up. Come on. That didn't exactly work as I imagined. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to take this down instead. Yoink. <laughs> oh, yes. One right on the back. Then throw one on the top. Another one on the top. This is not gonna end well. All right, this got to take out the engines. Maybe the wings as well. And on the count of three, I'm gonna blow them up. But first, I want to make sure I'm inside so it doesn't, you know, crash into the ocean. All right, that's lined up pretty well. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, quick, get in, get in, get in. Hey, sorry about this, fellas, but I got some business to do. Oh, boy. Okay, we really are falling. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. No, Franklin, hold on to something. Oh, come on, come on, come on. That that did not exactly work. The plane's falling and there were people inside. Well, there goes my car. Come on, I really thought I had that too. All right, make sure you go where it lands, Franklin. We might have to do a few repairs, but I really, really want to get this car. So there it is. I didn't see a car inside. Did you guys see anything? Like, I'm pretty sure it was totally empty, but let's take another look. Yep, nothing inside. Yo, uh, Simeon. I'm pretty sure I took down the plane. There's nothing in here. Uh, look around the area. Maybe you'll find a box. Who knows? A box? What are you leading me on, Simeon? Are you sure this is it? I pinky promise. I never break them. Pinky promised. Hasn't broken one of them so far. Okay, well, I guess I'll trust him on that. Let's take a look around for a little box. Because apparently that's where the car is. Are we building this car? Hey, there's mine. I think it's actually okay. Can I still ride this and fly this? Oh, fantastic. Well, I'm glad the old car is at least working. <laughs> In case we'd ever find this one. Oh, for 
crashed here. The box can't be too far away. Probably isn't on the hill. It would have slid down. Maybe it's on that cliff. Ooh, ooh, watch out. A little bit steep around here. Franklin already bruised up. I don't want you to get hurt any more than this. Where is this box? He wasn't kidding. There is a box. Check it out. Okay, let's get this open. I don't know how you can fit a car in this, Simeon. Like, what's the deal here? Oh, come on. There's got to be something I can do. Right, that's it. We're blowing this box up with a rocket launcher. I'm running out of patience, Simeon. There we go. That ought to have done it. And wait, I just got the key. You guys see that? It just said key acquired. Oh, hold on. The key was in the plane? Hey, Simeon, I got the key. Is that what you were after? The key! Bingo! Now let's get car! Yes, let's get the car, please! I've been searching all day! I send you location! Good luck! Thanks! Oh, wait, these guys are still alive? Bro, you survived the plane crash? Alright, I better get out of here before anyone else notices me. <laughs> Alright, run, 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 run! We're gonna get this car. They film at studio. In one building is car. Good luck! Filming at a studio. Alright, better put the gun away. We don't wanna get on anyone's radar. I'm gonna pretend that I belong here. Yeah. Afternoon, buddy. I'm just doing my thing. I'm basically a cleaner, an actor. I don't know. You can call me whatever you want to call me. Now, let's go and find the crew that's actually filming. Is it these guys? Hey, uh, anyone know where this filming or something? I'm, I'm looking for a film set. I was sent by a friend. Down the road. All right, down the road. Thanks. You guys have donuts here? You guys got everything. All right, let's go down the road then. This is pretty awesome. We have a swing pool, a huge bag screen. <laughs> wow. All right, let's just keep moving. There's some astronauts. Okay, this has has to be it. This is it. This is definitely where they're filming. This is an entire film set. It's like I'm in a little Italian town or something. Wow. And there's a marker which says enter. We're about to get this super secret car which these guys have been working on for a movie. Never thought in a million years I'll be finding a car from the movie studio. That's it. That's gotta be it. That's the car. Are you serious? This is insane. Now I know why Simeon wants me to get this car. It's got propellers on it. Wow. I have never seen a car which looks like this. All right, jump in, jump in. I've got the key. It opens up. No one's guarding it. This is crazy. <laughs> Wow! All right, this is the best car in GTA 5. I don't care if this is a million dollars, a billion dollars, a trillion, a quadrillion. This is priceless. All right, now I just got to... Oh, okay. I got to figure out a way out of here without crashing this car. That might be kind of tricky. But you'll be pleased to know I got out and I'm flying over the city. There's the movie studio. They're going to be so annoyed when they find out this is missing. This is what I can see. I got a little dashboard showing me the model. Wait, it's got a hatch. What? Yo, I can... I can fire missiles from this. This is the best thing ever. No way. Yeah, this is a pretty nice ride. Not gonna lie. I love it. It's like a huge quadcopter drone. You know what? I'm not gonna return this to Simeon. I'm keeping this myself. We're gonna ride off into the sunset with my brand new trillion dollar flying car. If you enjoyed the video, smash like and help me get to 7 million subscribers. Thanks for watching. My name is Nort. And until next time, stay awesome.